Mr. Underscore Chicken Underscore Nuggets Underscore Just Redeemed Pope Champ of the Day. Hi AVI.
All right, everyone, let's hop in now. I am going to die. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Is the audio okay? Welcome, everyone. Yo, I didn't know that Avi got wrapped up in Barry's ERP shit. <laughs> yes, of course, of course. So and that's going to stand for ethical role-playing. This just in, Avi is live now. Hello, my beautiful wife. P uh, b -b 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 I always forget your, your name. Uh, the, the pause. I want to call you pause, but your name is not. It's cat. It's cat. It's cat. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm so used to your, uh, to your, um. To your maiden name, your maiden name that I totally forget that you're referred to by a cat. Never mind, she's back. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Pause. Yeah, your name is Pause. No, your name's not Pause. It's Cat. I don't know. I know it's something animal related. That is my mistake. Don't worry. That that is on me. I am very bad with names. Uh, pseudo names. We do have to use different pseudo names now that uh, <laughs> in case uh, any criminals or uh, politicians wants us dead. But welcome, welcome everyone. Hello, hello, hello. I am so. Exhausted. Cat Paws Perkins. There it is. Hello, Lucas. How are you doing today? How are you doing tonight? How are you doing? I know it's a bit of a later stream now, once again. It is Thursday, after all. And tomorrow we'll still be streaming at the same hour, of course. Um, but, but... Let me tell you, I've been doing some offline uh, GTA RPing last night. Out of character, honestly, is probably what's going to happen in this uh, part of the segment of stream. Also, thank you, Becca, again for subscribing for uh, 35 months. <sighs> Being a first-time RP person in the server is so fascinating. Everyone seems to know what they're doing at all times, and there was an entire dialogue and story that was going on. So, uh, I can't believe you started streaming at 4 a.m. me. No, it's not 4 a.m. Nah, none of us do. Hello, Apollo. Oh my god, you say that, Apollo, but you're a liar. I'll be hopping on a DGA soon. I know that's the game category, which probably pinged the... Uh, uh, lovely BTubers uh, amazing uh, Twitch tracker for it. Can you guys believe that there's only two people online right now? <laughs> Which is fine. At least last time I checked. Lol, well, watching Nayu and Barry play this, no one knows what the fuck they're doing. It has been a process. Uh, I know a lot of popular events were happening with the Hollow Boys, um, which was really cool. But actually, last night, uh, I was offline uh, because I wanted to stream, but I was in a call with Becco. All of a sudden, Becco gets dropped up in the storyline, and I was like, whoop, I'm unable to communicate with her. Um, she, she even got Gavin to call her, um, she, uh, she even got to transport Gavin, because we got separated during the call. I forgot what we, were, what we were going to do together. But all of a sudden, she went to go get her, uh, scooter, because she loves scooter. And then there was Gavin near the area, and she, like, basically, um was his transportation for the night and he was like oh you are now my ninth wife and i was like what the fuck <laughs> oh but that's okay i didn't i didn't mind it was really funny first of all i just want to see to that fucking whore gavin that's my goddamn wife i even told him when we first met that this is my rep my uh, camera woman my writer my producer my lover and he didn't listen to me he took my goddamn wife he took my goddamn wife yeah, she scooted us out, the legend. She is, she is, she is a legend. She's amazing. But no, honestly, I'm not... Uh, I'm so jealous. But also, I'm so glad though, because it was like a crossover episode between my two favorite human beings. And I think it was really funny that um, I couldn't, I couldn't see everything because we were on a Discord call together. So I, I saw her stuff going on, but I also had my own stuff going on too. While that was happening with that plot line, I was going around asking locals around, and not like uh, the, uh, sorry, not locals. I was asking the other residents, there you go, about uh, their jobs. And last night, I got to talk to a bus person and a coffee owner, oh, sorry, coffee worker. And I was like, damn, I forgot to do a career day. So today's stream is going to be dedicated to careers. Wait, Avi, Avi, have you ran into Clavio at all? Um, who is Clavio's character? I wouldn't have known because honestly, I didn't know until last night that I ran into Grimmy. Uh, she was a crazy character, but I ran into Grimmy. <laughs> it was so funny. She had like British accent. Grimmy is a really good voice actress. Um, 
Yeah, we were up until 5 a.m. last night, so I think people are recovering. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's why a lot of people are not offline. But it's nice to see you, Apollo. Every time I see your name, it, I, my brain wants to say Apollo, even though your name is very English and not... A <laughs> but it, I don't know. My brain is so silly. I'm definitely really tired now. Avi Paz? Furry com confirmation? No! Not Avi Paz. People do call me that, so you... Really? Apollo. Hold on, I need to Google Apollo. I feel like that's already a word. Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. What's the name you call last name? Oh! Yeah, people call me Boya. Oh, okay, okay, got you. Wait, what? How the fuck do you say last name in Spanish? Hold on, hold on. Last name in Spanish. Apeido! That's what I was thinking of. Fuck, I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, don't worry about it, Apollo. Don't worry about it. Ooh, I don't know. She hasn't streamed it at all, so I have no clue what things, uh, what her thing is. Uh, no worries about it, chicken. I totally get it. Okay, okay, actually, look around. Have a good day! Oh, it's so a strange thing. The darndest thing, actually. I think I might leave early because I'm having a midlife crisis. No fucking way, Caliber. I'm so sad. <laughs> You're not going to stay for career day? I'm going to ask around town for it. Apeido. How do you know it, Caliber? <laughs> Wait, is it the same thing in the Tagalog? That's crazy. I mean, that makes sense. We were both, uh, conquistated by Spanish. By the Spanish. Conquistador. I I'm so bad with English right now. Ever since I joined this RP stream, I've never needed- I never wanted to read books more now than ever. I used to read a lot of literature back in the days, and I told you guys this all the time, but the gap further- for, uh, strays further and further from how long ago that's been. I have an entire library of Jurassic Park, Stephen King's It, uh, Count of Monte Cristo. Have I read any of them? No. I- I like collecting books, but I gotta read. I gotta lock in now. Because I want to improve on my writing. I also have a friend that is really into D&D. &D, and his writing is spectacular. And when I talk to these res residents and everyone who is uh, the, the new people in town. Everyone has such immaculate language. And I still talk like a two-year-old. I was so bad at being in the moment for the RP. Because I had the call with Avi. The police radio. And people talking all around me at, all over at once. I was super overstimulated. Yeah, it was really a lot of attention, honestly. When you... I'm so sorry, like, you had your- I wouldn't say you had your moment in the spotlight, but there was a lot of things you had focused on you for a moment there, too. It was crazy. You go from having, like, zero um, encounters with anyone to having the radio station, and then me, and then, uh, uh Mattel. But I'm glad, Becco. I'm glad that you did tune into the stream at the end, and you see why I am so normal about my OG. <laughs> I'm so normal! Yeah. I'm just glad to be in the same air as him in the server. I'm so normal. Yo, D&D! &D, yeah, 90! Welcome! I'm so normal. Um, speaking of which... I had to go get a work, uh, thing today. And I had to trade in my work badge for a new updated pass because we have security around the mall, right? And I get, like, entrances, you know, all that stuff. Employees only. And with it, I have my, uh, Gavis Metal keychain because, um... <laughs> If it's, if there's anything that keeps me entering back into my 9 to 5, it's my goddamn Oshi. That, 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 uh, tier 3 membership isn't gonna pay itself. Um, uh, but today, um, I lost my lanyard because I wanted to trade in my, uh, badge, and I just lost it. I don't know how. And I'm so upset. I'm, I'm not, and I'm already in kind of a cranky mood because, oh, my fucking class today was, ugh, insufferable. And we're at school. So, the fact that I lost my beautiful Oshis, like, very gorgeous pin by, by an artist in Ofkai, I was so upset. I'm not supposed to be in the spotlight. I'm supposed to be a fly on the wall. Yeah, I know. It was insane. But it, it was crazy. You went from being a reporter to being his ninth wife. For him, it was just a regular Wednesday. But he got you wrapped up. It was great. I'm glad you got to meet Apollo and Gav Spedal. It was great. Oh my fucking god. Wait. Why did I call the police instead of the taxi? No, never mind, never mind, never mind. Sorry. Quite no problem. Today I want to do a career day though. I think it'd be really cool now that people want to uh, be drivers and mechanics. 
to ask things. I, I, I need to come up with questions for them. I need to come up with questions for the article for sure. Claiming to be normal is the first time of mental illness. Information for the internet. No, you're so right though. Oh my god. Also, I got informed by this by my mom, but she can't remember some parts. But apparently my grandma was there when World War II happened, as well as when there were still Spaniards in the Philippines. That is so interesting. What the hell are the Spaniards doing there? Oh wait, no, no, no. You know, it's so crazy. Like, in America, we only learn about, like, what happens in the... Our side of history. So, it's really unfortunate. I don't know what the heck is going on in other countries at the same time as World War II. The smaller ones, at least. Play, uh... Ooh, can we help? Yeah, exactly. You guys can help. This this day is dedicated to uh, improving my journalism, honestly. When I'm on the spot with questions, um, I tend to forget to write them down because I'm very in the moment. But then I forget later and I get really sad. So I think today I will dedicate time to ask a GTA career day questionnaire. What made you want to work your job? Money. <laughs> if people answer that way, I need to think of witty responses for that or be like... Because <laughs> it's so true though. So true though. I need to ask, what is your job? I think your questions were very good yesterday. Hello, bug! Hello, bug! Hello, bug! How are you doing today? I have two bugs in my stream now. Um, It's so nice to see you. Oh my god. How long did you stay up last night? I, I saw you in some of the... uh the main stage of the uh last night's gang activities you are a bug i am a bug uh bug was actually one of the taxi drivers i didn't stream my end because i wanted to do some things but then i got wrapped up in a story as well and it was really funny hanging out with you i wish i got to record it yours was like when we had our interaction last night i was like okay i need to fucking record this if i can't have the energy to stream it in the middle of the night i i can have the energy to record it but I'm so sad I missed out on our, on our interactions. I'm good. Way too late. I'm glad you're able to be awake. Uh, are you of EST or PST time zone? If you don't mind me asking. Uh, <laughs> all right. Hold on. Let's go set up together. You guys are my news crew. I'm sure we'll interact more today. Fuck yeah, dude. It's Mr. Grandpa. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, PST. Yes, you're also in the PST time zone. You know what? I'm very, very happy to see another uh, person. That is in similar nature as me. Because you meet a lot of EST folks and you're just like... I, I, for me, at least. I meet a lot more EST folks. And it feels like, uh... Interesting. Because, uh... You see some of them be awake at like 3 a.m. Be like, hey, are you awake? And I'm like, bro, it's 3 a.m. I can't answer you. And then I'm not... And they're 9 a.m. It's your 6 a.m. And it's like, okay. You're expecting a VTuber to be awake at 6 a.m.? Impossible. Uh, yeah, most of the people I interact with are ESC. You understand me, then. Um, what a time. Thank you for the hydration, Pickle Nick. Asked them if they ever thought if this was where they would end up as a career. Any of they could, would. And if, and if they could, would they change careers or stay? That would probably be an interesting question. That's very good! I like that, Caliber. I was thinking at a higher time tone than usual. You were that first... You were that first night you played GTA. You were that first night you played GTA. You were awake. Oh, I was. I fucking was, dude. I stayed up, like, until 5 a.m. I was that person. Oh, I messaged Damon something, I think. I think you messaged me something, or I messaged you. It was really fun. Oh, yeah, because I had, um, storage issues. Yeah. Never thank me. Brings me bad luck. You know what? That's fair. All right. Okay, let's put some questions in. Um, did you... ever... thought you'd be here? Would you change careers? Or stay? That would probably be an interesting question. That would be an interesting question! I love that! Thank you so much! Uh, what are the questions? Okay, first of all, the basic questions such as, uh... What is your job? How much are you paid? Uh... How... How much... How... How much do you make? Per paycheck. Um, is the city... Does the city have resources for your job? What are the resources... What are the... City resources... For your job? Like, is it... Is it a... Okay, so here's the thing, right? There are some jobs... 
where like it is very very good to be in this field such as the police you get access to the police building and you get access to weapons and walkie-talkies exclusively for free and weapons of course but if you're someone like a mechanic, there's not really a lot of uh, resources to, or uh, textbooks done on mechanics. So the ones that I know of, they're um, they're doing the best they can with what they got. But obviously, things were very prioritized with the police and the uh, gang activities last night for sure. And the hospital especially. Oh my goodness. So I think it would be really cool to ask around. Like, uh, is this like... Very good. Was it, how was it your first time? Uh, hold on. Let me let me ask that. Like, uh, uh ask them if you if you're uh, gonna lend you if they can lend you one dollar. Yeah. Tee -hee. I have a meeting in five minutes. No worries. After thank you for letting me know. Um, me who's eight minutes from four a.m. Jesus Christ, Caliber, why are you awake? <laughs> I hope you woke up like uh, after an eight-hour nap, right? Sorry, eight hours sleep, right? My brain not working. That's okay. I understand. What are the city resources for your job? Hold on, let me actually look at VTubers' uh, little tracker thing. I try not to actively uh, watch the other people that are doing GTA, especially my Oshi. <laughs> it, not gonna lie, because the Hollow Stars were in the server, it was a little bit more nerve wracking for me as a first time RPer. The the first time, you're just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna do this and that and that. But then there's like really, really cool people on it at the same time as you. And you're just like, oh God, they have their own audience with their own opinions and they might think negatively of me. The usual brain rot. But that's okay. Uh, uh, ask some philosophy stuff, some complex stuff about math stuff. <gasps> oh my God, I love that. You're right, you're right, you're right. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. See, here is the uh, current Twitch tracker of the GTA stuff. Uh, let me give a shout out to the home girl VTuber. Shout out. If you want to check out this thing, this will actually show you who is online. So right now it says I'm online, even though we're not streaming it right now. Uh, VTuber. Let me see if I did this right. Yay! You can check it out. You can actually interact with it if you're on the mobile. Oh my god, Lumi is playing LNR. Sorry, sorry, distracted. Grandpa Jimmer Jimma 3 was ranting about woke and Bigfoot with someone! You were ranting about woke? That's so good! And I only learned later that he was a Hollow Stars. Yeah, right? For me personally, I, free I I have been a really big fan of Hollow Stars for quite a while. And I'm really glad that a lot of people are exposed to them. And I hope they see why I love the boys so much. Normally, obviously. That's me! That's me right there, guys. Do you see that? I think B's work is really fascinating. I mean, if we want to go deep, is what they're doing an actual career or just a job? Because a career is something that you work full effort to get to a higher goal or something. And there's a job where you just got it because you need to get cash somehow. That's true, that's true, that's true. Hold on. Okay, we'll do that after the uh, questions about did you ever find yourself in this career and things like... Are you in it for money or the love of it? And uh, who... Actually, the question is who are... I want to say got any wife and kids, but I don't know about that. I didn't know about them until like yesterday, and they seem cool. Yeah, I love being a fangirl about VTubers and other. They're cool. Yeah, I'm so glad. I'm so glad they were chill and awesome. But you know, they they uh, most of them actually uh, won't hang out in the server again because they had like a story arc, which is fine. You know, they can do what they want. But it's great though. Uh, I know a lot of attention and resources were poured into them, so I kind of, um, I wouldn't say, Oh, thank God those guys aren't there anymore! But it's more so like, okay, yay! I'm excited to see what everyone's gonna do after, since, uh, the plot point concluded. Maybe we could talk to ex-gang members about how they're doing around town, not the, the, uh... Gangs have departed, the gang leaders departed. Okay, anyways, but back to my sayings. Um... Uh, okay. What do you wish the city... The city can provide. What other question could I ask? What is your job? How much money do you make per paycheck? What are the city resources for this job? What do you think that what do you wish the city could provide? Did you ever thought you'd be in this career? Would you change careers or stay? Are you in it for the money or the love of it? Okay. And then, uh, 
Oh, what I was gonna say. You should use some wasp and bee lingo. Like, ask them about honey and what waggle means. Like, as if you were a wasp in a trench coat. <laughs> that would be incredible for a, new, for a reporter roleplay idea. Just being like, and... Well, we're getting the buzz on this latest news. Okay, meeting. Bye. Bye, Scepter. What's the last four numbers of your social security card? <laughs> That's a good one. I love that. Like, after 10 years, would they still be in that career or be doing something different? What? <laughs> that is such a good question. Do you see yourself in this career 10 years from now? AKA season two. A whole nest of wasp in a jacket. I love that. That's so silly. Oh, actually, hold on, hold on. I actually want to ask things like, uh... Got any colleagues? Competition? Uh... How many customers you get? I love asking how many people get, like, how many, uh... Customers in a certain amount of hours. It's really fun. Well, I think we're just about at it. I kind of want to do, uh, hop into the server, like, right now. Just to see what the activity is like. I know there's only, like, a couple people. So we'll need to spot around, look around in the city. Oh, I guess that's the, uh, other thing I would say. What is your... What is your work hours? And what do you do in your free time? That would be really interesting to ask. All right, here's another really cringe thing I kind of want to do with this. That's right, baby. I'm pulling out the Google Do uh, Google Sheets. I don't know why, but I can't work with Google Docs. I think it's the fact that I associate Docs with school. And Sheets is honestly, like, my comfort. They got tables for me already. Is that weird? I think it's weird, but I love it for that. I love being weird. Hey! Hello, Elrin. Welcome. We're doing. We're getting ready for some uh, GTA RPing um, later on. Hold on. Let me make it so that I can format it so everything could be uh wrap. No, 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 no. No, I think wrapping is good. Okay. Uh, that one. Questionnaire. Google Sheets. I see. I prefer Google Sheets. <laughs> we're so silly, Chad. You're so silly. Uh. Okay. Okay. What is your job title? Okay, 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 okay. Let me do this. All right, all right, all right. So, job title. How much do you make per paycheck? Uh-oh, uh-oh. The format doesn't look good. Hold on, let me do this. Format. Wrapping. Wrap. There you go. Born to shard, forced to wipe, Genghis Khan. Yep, I'm sure he said that at least once. All right. What are the city resources for your job? All right. Hold on, let me ask education. Education for this job. Okay. Uh, okay, hold on. Let me post everything in there. And then be very normal about this. What do you wish? La, 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 la. Colleagues ask about, like, people relations. What do they... Like, uh, who do they see at around a certain time? How many customers they get? It's really exciting. I love it. I love seeing everyone's character. This is really fun. As my first time RPing, I'm kind of glad I went to a for a reporter thing and talk about other people. And then later, let's talk about my backstory. Let's make a backstory for Avi. Can we be chaotic and have crossed out questions that ask if they like their boss slash managers? You know, just be a little funny thing. Ooh, I like that. We can ask about a uh, coworker gossip. Hold on, let me add that. Let me add that. How do I cross out a word? Dude, can I tell you about my school thing? I'm going to tell you about my school thing because this is my stream. Can I tell you guys one thing about something? My fucking teacher. I thought she was a young teacher. I really did. And, and because she's a young teacher, you know, I don't have any preconceived notions about young teachers. I usually just... I mean, I thought I didn't have preconceived notions about young teachers. Until I had her as my teacher. I can't guesstimate to you guys how old I assumed she was when I first looked at her. But I just thought she was young enough to, use how to, to know how to use technology right and let me fucking tell you my teacher has no idea how to do google slides and usually when she has a layout she zooms in super duper close like this and she uses the uh, zoom in feature for browsers so every time she presents a slide it's like this 
and even worse, hold on. So imagine you're a, you're a student, me, watching this presenter with a projector looking like this for information. Lol, she's hag maxing. It's even worse because the class has a bunch of haglers in there. I am in college. Taxi driver is also a very good first RP job. I am just silly in luck to talk to people. Yeah, exactly. It's very good to have a job if it's your first time being like someone that takes in information at least in my opinion because you get to like people watch and i very much love people watching okay but we didn't see that setting the audio menu so are we really that much <laughs> are we really that much better at technology oh that's true you're so right you're right you're right who am i to complain this is like you know i had preconceived mo notions about my teacher and some biases i need to work out but i honestly really hate my class that i have on tuesday and thursdays so I'm kind of like a little sad that I had these streams after this class because I'm like, my blood sugar has risen. It has risen and the coffee I had this morning made it worse. Hello, Miss Garcia. I'm so sorry I'm late. Ladies, it's nice to see you again. Don't worry. Maybe with this, we can use, uh, we can, uh, come up with Avispa. La Avicia, Lord. La, La Avicia Garcia. This is legit how my professor types because she's like, oh, you know, I could go full view for this. But I like being able to edit in there. And this is what we all came up with to resolve her of her issue. And by we, I'm in my class of hagglers. It was, oh, it was so annoying. La Vicia Garcia. Uh, Telenovelia. Damn, get called out la abuelita. <laughs> I really did deserve that. Understandable. Honestly, fuck, I've been trying to get that word out of how that setting to everyone as much as I could while still being in character. A little hard, though got any gossips crushes work drama all right yeah same <laughs> yeah i know it's like it's been a blessing i had one reply to that post and that got me like yay i, I helped someone okay um hold on hold on hold on hold on and then do this there you go there you go there you go Okay, okay, okay. Shower, free tail table. Shut up. Okay, and then this is where I'm going to put the names. I love doing Google Sheets. I don't know about you guys, but I really like Google Sheets. NDA that you can disclose? Oh, shit. <laughs> I love that. Is there any NDAs that you can disclose to this news? That would be really exciting. All right. Now, let's come up with the Avispa lore. Because, honestly, I, I kind of wish I tuned into other people's streams earlier for this. Because I saw Grimmy's story, and Grimmy's, like, character is really good. It's great. NDA that you can disclose is really funny. Dude, I know. My chat is kind of on fire right now. Also, it's very nice to see you again. It's so silly. I love being silly here. That you want to disclose? Hi, Lavisa. Hello, Lady of the Moon, Little Mist. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. We will be hopping onto RP soon. We are just creating my character. All right. So the way I see it, my character is reporter lore. The simple fact. So about me. So listen, about me. I went to college, went to college for journalism. From... I don't want to say I'm from a small town, but I want to say that my lore is got... What's smaller than... Is it called an urban area when it's like smaller than a city, but bigger than a, than a cornfield city? Cornfield area? I don't know what you call it in between that. Hola, ITM Pop! A suburb? I guess you could say suburbs. Suburbs of Cali. Got kicked out for reporting news of something controversial. And uh, now I am blacklisted from any news network. Indie reporter with unethical journalism. So how do we do this? How do we twist this? I went to college, so I know what I can't do. But I do it anyways. What kind of character do you think that is? Nah, I should have said you're from Liberty City. What does that mean? Why? Explain that. Explain it to me, please. 
Whenever I hit a certain hour of being awake, I go from neutral good to chaotic neutral. Yeah, I can't believe you stayed up and are staying here. I appreciate you, uh, Caliber. Did I ruin your sleep schedule? If I got longer, I'm going to chaotic evil. And it's GG's from there. <laughs> I hope you'll be able to fall asleep before that. Okay, so. I'm trying to think of, like, lore stuff because it's really interesting. Maybe I should delete the going to college for journalism. No. Hold on. Why would a co actually no? No, I'm I'm unethical journalist because the city has unethical laws. Do as the Romans do. Is that what they call it? Would that be a good explanation? Everyone around me is getting influenced by the city. It's kind of funny. Liberty City is from GTA 4. Ooh, I like that. I like that. No, it's because I fucking love it here. So technically, yeah, my sleep schedule was actually pretty good until I got here. <laughs> oh, such is the curse of uh, VTuber fans, honestly. Well, was getting good. Real. That's honestly real. New lady. Hell yeah. Yeah, there's so many ladies. This is a sleepy lady. There's mother. Happy to see you again, all of you. It's so nice to see you, too. All right, I think I'll be hopping on here soon. We'll think about more of the lore stuff uh, later. I'm really bad with writing backstories. Now let's get to playing. All right, let's get to playing, everyone. Are you guys excited for a uh, second stream of, of uh, the GTA RP? Looks like there's a lot more people. Let's fucking go. Let's go find everyone. I'm kind of appreciative that it's the uh, only five people. If I can just find those five people, it'll be great. Hold on, I'm turning off the music. When it was 60 last night, it was insane. It felt so busy. There's late. I'm not gonna read that. 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 Uh, hold on. Let me go take a sip. Hello, Kodachi. How are you doing? Have you heard about the GTA RP going on around here? It's been a really fun time. My voice is really higher today. Uh, today I will try to have a good day. I will have a good day. Today we'll have a good day. The coffee will hold me strong. Alright. I'm a bit of a new news reporter woman. I have my beautiful vehicle with me. Let me turn off my VGM. And we are going to get some serious reporting in here. I am someone that knows the laws of ethical journalism, but doesn't follow it. Because, well, this city is going to need a lot more than rules to be able to get a good scoop of things. But luckily for today's career days, I can actually ease in a bit, right? I can ease in a bit. Nothing crazy is happening. The gangs have all um, dissipated for now. Thank goodness, because actually last night, I talked to a wonderful woman who uh, was new in town around here. And, uh, well, let's just say that once I told her about the gang activities and how they are labeled themselves after women, aka the Ten Wives and the, uh, the baddies, I thought to myself, well, that's really weird. This is kind of like some weird cult thing. Uh, and with like, and similar to the cult things, I talked to an EMT lady and I was like, hey, so what's your employment? And she said, a wife. She said uh, one of the ten wives or something, and I was like, that is not fair. Don't you want to have a career, do something else, make your own money, instead of being affiliated? And she's like, well, I'm an EMT wife, and I was like, no, that's not the same. So, I think my job will be trying my best to uplift women. Also, hello, lifting dude. Going to do all the Grand Theft Auto 5 and need a pizza. Oh, shit, you know what? I haven't had a pizza. I don't know whether anyone's on the pizzeria right now. Hold on, let me get my car. It's always a good day when Avi streams. Thank you. You guys are so nice to me. Ethics are for square. You don't get the juicy news and truth if you follow the rules. Exactly. And you know, some people are unfortunately, you know, in need of cash in the city. So I would be happy. Oh, God. You know, I was about to take my news report, uh, my news report vehicle. But um, I feel like we should really appreciate the, uh, the jobs of the, the, how do you call it? I feel like the city should start thinking about foot traffic and uh, the level of the carbon dioxide we're releasing into the air. I think 
I actually talked to a bus driver yesterday who uh, says that they're interested in doing their career, but no one really wants to take the bus, and who can blame them? The city is huge, and there's only about... One, two, three, and four areas you can go to. Like, that is not fair at all to me. We got this grand old space, but this place only has four bus stops in just a tiny little corner. Good old Betsy. Yeah, I think I will retire Betsy. Just for today's missions, you guys. I hope the production, che uh, the production team will be happy with these choices. And we will wait until the daytime to start the new story. Every single night. Sorry, I want to have good lighting. Uh, actually, no, I can actually fix that. Bro, that thing's a brisk wind away from crumbling like a Ritz cracker. My, <laughs> actually, let me see if there's repairers, uh, mechanics in this world right now. Chat, who's Avi talking to? Us? Yes, I am. You guys are my news crew. We should really come up with like some lingos. Hold on, what was I gonna do? Oh, my phone. Ow, my back cracked. Okay. Usually in here you can see uh, which of the service workers are available. There's only one taxi guy in the entire area. I think this is all the players actually. Hold on, let me move. Let me move my model a bit. We got the taxi, police, ambulance. That is so funny to me. Well, we got a long day ahead of us, so let's go start. Let's go start with a taxi driver. <laughs> all right, news crew. Hello? Hello. Hello, I am in speaking to a taxi driver, right? What may I call you? Uh, you can call me D guy. Uh, where do you need to, uh, where do you need to pick up? D guy, all right, all right, all right. Let me go check my map real quick. It seems my DPS says I am located in the number 8070. All right, I'll be right there. Thank you. See you soon. Uh, would you be okay with an interview while we are on the drive? Uh, sure. Absolutely. Love to see it. See you soon. Thank you. Yep, that is our first person. I think the phones are a little bit glitched out. You getting paid? Yeah, apparently the city uh pays me every hour. Hold on, make let me uh enable it so I have a push to talk. Okay, hold on, hold on. Where's push to talk? About? Where's push to talk? About? Hold on, let me find it real quick. Let me find it real quick. Let me find it real quick. Key bindings. Enter. Hold on, I gotta I gotta do this real quick before he pulls up. Close. Cycle. No, that's cycle. That's uh push and talk. Wait, no 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 no. What I need to do is that's the wrong setting. Uh hold on. Hold on, news crew. Hold on, news crew. Uh There you go. No, on. But stuck. There you go. No, no, no. All right. Okay, my should Okay, good, good, good. We got this now. We got this, guys. Now I can talk exclusively with my earpiece to you if I need to. And I'm honored to have an amazing crew like that. She served her purpose well. Maybe we can get corporate funds to put her in a garage. Yeah, she is in a garage already right now, actually. That's why, um... I came across here. All right. While we wait for the taxi driver, I'm so excited to meet him. Uh, let me just pull up my questions that I have prepared for us. So, HD guy. She's growing up. I am. I am growing up. Okay. We're watching Avi talk to a real person, not just the camera. Yeah, I am. I'm socializing. I, my news, my news reporting job has really made me, uh, start to, uh, come out of my clamshell. Alright. I wonder where he is. Maybe I should have asked how long, he, where he is. Why are you doing GTA crimes? I haven't done any crimes just yet. I'll have you know. Hold on, let me actually call up an officer to see if I can do an interview. I don't know whether I want to go to the police station or the hospital. I think I'll go to the uh, police station. So let me call up that guy. Uh, this is gonna be an exciting day. Is that a Samsung Android? Um, who's asking? It's a little bit of both. It's silly. This is my. Oh, 
Hello? Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Hello. How'd you, how'd you get this number? Well, Who's first this? of all, you I see every person has access to the police's number. It's 911, silly. Oh, right. Hi. Yes. Yeah. I was just wondering, t uh, I was just here calling to ask if you would love to do an interview with me. I am reporting in my uh, indie network um, for career day as my theme for today. Oh, um... Uh, who is this? Can I, can I ask who's calling? My name is Avicia. I'm so sorry. I have my number as anonymous because, you know, as a reporter, I gotta keep myself safe. Alright, well, Avicia, I have a little bit of time, so I guess I could do a quick interview. Alright, I'll be seeing you, you soon, then. Yeah, um, where do you want to meet? Uh, just at the police station if you're not there already. Sure, I can head over there right now. Yeah, thank you. All right, no problem. Uh, what may I call you? So I can ask the oh. uh, clerk at the front. Yeah, this is Officer Balls. Oh, Balls. oh, okay, okay. I've seen your name in the network somewhere, in the in the yellow book. Um, I thought it was Bool. I thought it was French. Oh, no, a lot of people get that wrong. It's, uh, it's Balls. Oh, I see, I see. <laughs> well, see you in a bit. All right, well, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. I love the fact that whenever I call up the services, everyone's like, how do you get this number? And I'm just like, um, it's, pu it's publicly available. <laughs> it comes with a mobile phone. It comes with, uh, choosing an EMT. And it comes with a career for, uh, mechanic, EMT, and police. Silly. Duh. It's 911. Miss <laughs> Garcia is something of a social butterfly. That's why she's the very best reporter in Los Santos. Well, sometimes in the city, you gotta make the news come to you. Um, and you know, you gotta be an active participant. Damn, where the fuck is this taxi driver? I mean, sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't want to talk mad madly about a taxi driver. Let me call him up again, see if uh, anything's wrong. I forgot you can call. Oh, hello! Hey, sorry, I'm having a little trouble finding you. You said 8040, right? Uh, yes, yes. Let me look in the map again for any significant locations that I can give you. Yeah. Uh, it seems I meant to say 8070. Uh, oh, and it shall be in one of the public parkings. Okay. All right. I'll be right there. Yeah, just right across the street of 8069. Don't get those confused. 8070 public parking. Right. Thank you. Right. Gotcha. Thank you. All right, I'm glad I called him again. Sorry about that. I, I think I did give off the wrong digits. Well, you know how it is. I forgot you can call police. I had the best grandpa bit in my head now. Yay! Really? Wait, 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 wait. Are you going to do the thing where you call the police and then you order, like, um, a pizza delivery order? 8070, Avi. I'm so silly. I'm so sorry. He's looking at the wrong place. That was probably on me. I'm so sorry. I I'm going to have to tip him more. Oh, shit. I need to go to an ATM. That's what I need to ask him. All right, we'll go to the police station and maybe I can ask him if he's familiar with any ATMs in the area. Actually, you gave him the right digits the first time. Oh, okay, good, good, good. I'm gonna call the police and just talk to them like they're my grandkids. <laughs> I love that. Um, I, oh, 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 hold on. Whoa, there you are, sir. All right. All right, all right. <laughs> So, Where do you need to go today? I'm doing very good. I actually um, am interviewing for Career Day as my theme for my reporter job. Oh, okay. So you can drive around. You can drive a scenic view to the police station, but, but you know, you don't have to be quick with it. All right. Uh, yeah. Let me just put it on the we could do like circles and donuts all around it or whatever. Yeah, that sounds fine by me. Yeah. So what would you describe? What would you call yourself? What is your job title that you would self-label? I'd call myself a driver. Right now I'm driving a taxi, but mm. I feel like anything that, that puts me on the road is uh, a good job for me. Mm, all right. May I ask you how much you make per hour? Uh, About like 125, 130. 135, 130. No, I also get, uh, depending on... Uh, 
on pickup or mm. and traffic city can be more of a it all depends. Start to do the math sometimes. Mm, that's the standard fare or the standard rate, uh, latent rate is like 125 per hour, though. Yeah. Do you say it's pretty good, especially with the gasoline prices? You're a little uh, bit speedy, yeah. uh, D guy. I, I get a little motion sick. May I ask you to slow uh, down, sorry, please? I'll, I'll slow down a bit. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, I'd say it's pretty good. It's, uh, uh, well, sometimes if it's a slow day, the gas is a pain. Yeah, no worries. That's good. That's good. Just making sure. You hear a lot of stories about, like, Uber drivers uh, not making very good money. Yeah. Yeah. So, did you have an education for this job? Uh, my education was the street. I kind of just, they kind of just let me in and I, uh, and I was able to I was able to do my work from there. I was surprised at how easy it was. I was I was under the impression I would need a lot more training, but ah, uh, I got good at what I was doing just through on the field work, of course, of course. Yeah. Well, um, do you think you have any competition in this? Actually, no. Let me ask you: How long have you been in the city? Uh, I've been. I think I was here the first day. All these new arrivals started coming in. Oh, so I was on the first wave here. Ah, oh, that's that's good. That's good. You know, I I know right now it's a bit of an off hour. Thank goodness for you, right? Yeah. Yeah, you're in the, you're the first name on the list, actually. Yeah, it gets very busy here uh, when there's not when my coworkers aren't not, aren't on. It can be a little overwhelming at times, but mm -hmm. it's pretty it's pretty chill at this time of morning. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Did you did you ever did you oh fuck hold on. The audio. Did you ever see yourself working this job? Uh, I think so. Yeah, it's what I had in mind when I came in town. It seemed like a, a good first job. Mmm, it is pretty good. Uh, you it do like meet. That's a good way to settle into the city and get to know people. Yeah, yeah, get, get to know, know people, hear the gossip from others, know who to avoid and who to go collide with. Yeah, I'd say so. And do you see yourself doing this, um, 10 years from now on? Uh, I'm not sure about that. I think, uh, but at the same time, I'm not so close to it, but I would like to expand my, uh, expand my options a bit. Yeah, any, any career path in mind? Huh. Uh, I'm looking at maybe doing some bank driving, maybe, uh, Doing some uh, driving for, let's see. Uh, maybe driving the EMT around sometimes. It's all. Oh, an EMT kind of driver would be very interesting, actually. Yeah. What about a getaway driver? Oh, definitely. I feel like I'm born to do stuff like that. Ah, uh, I'll make sure to tell anyone that if they need someone fast, <laughs> they got the guy to call. Uh, yeah, I'd, I'd say that's a, I'd appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. And, of course, I'll, I'll let you in. I'll put a good note for you for any EMT people, for sure. I would love to see you advance in your career aspect for driving. Very, very Thank admirable. You. Thank you. All right, you can take me to the police station now. Uh, All right, uh, and... let me put it back on the map. Yeah, I... it, uh, <laughs> my GGS, so. yeah no worries. And yeah. uh, don't worry, you can go as fast as you can for this one. I'll even time uh, you. Starting now. One, two, three, four Mississippis, five Mississippis, six, six Mississippis, seven Mississippis, eight Mississippis, nine Mississippis, ten Mississippis. We got people at the studio right now coming in for a production team. Twelve Mississippis, fourteen Mississippis, sixteen Mississippis, seventeen Mississippis, eighteen Mississippis, nineteen Mississippis, twenty Mississippis, twenty-one Mississippis, twenty-two Mississippis. Do this turn. And 23 Mississippi's world record, Shirley D. Guy. Thank you, thank you. Welcome, thank you so much uh, for the thank raid! Thank you for with us today. Yeah, thank you, of course. I mean, how do I pay you? Well, how much should I pay you now? Welcome! Yes, the DJ is going super well! Thank you so much for the raid, Kyro. It's nice to see new faces. How do, how do I, uh... How much do you want for rates, of course? Let me uh, just, just ask that. Just 100 is fine. Just 100? Sure. Alright, what is your favorite number? Starting, uh... Do you know how to find your favorite number? 
Uh, I never thought Shit, I'm gonna get a call! Number too much. Uh, how would I find it? Uh, on your mobile device on the top left. This should be either two digits or three digits. Oh god, I got uh, a phone number. Uh, oh, I see. My number's, uh, 15. 15, alright. Your number's 15? Whoa, that I've never met that before. Alright, hold on, hold on. Let me pull up the, uh... Yeah, I could have sworn my number was different before. Maybe it changes up sometimes. Cash give. 15. Oh, it is 15. Holy lord! All right, I'd love to ch I'd love to chat some more, but I do have an interview with another person. Thank you so much. I hope to see you in the field. Uh, you too. Thank you. Yeah! Thank you so much for the race. Sorry, we were in the middle of a storyline. Today is career day. My name is Alicia Garcia de la Novelina, and I am trying my best to interview as much people as possible for this little bit of a slower news cycle. I know we had a lot of very interesting things last night. If you need a raid and run, totally understand. Thank you for bringing your team over to mine. You guys are now the news crew, all right? If you got any questions you'd love to see me elaborate on, I would gladly do it. Just let me know. You're good. I wanted to check out the GTA RP stuff. Yeah, I'm so glad that... Uh, have you checked out BTuber who has like an active um, stream right now? Just to... Uh, hold on, let me go call the police again. I forgot to answer him back. Shit. Uh, but yes, yes, yes. Telenovelinia. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's really funny. I love having very big last names. Hold on, is he right in front of me? Oh my god! I, I, oh, I'm I, so sorry. I'm officer! So sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I, was, I think I'm calling you right now. Sorry. Yeah, that's me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Uh, uh, that, that's the big No, no. I had my car. <laughs> uh, I was focused. I was lost in thoughts. And uh, we had uh, new people in the studio back at home. So I, I needed to do some duties, you know. No worries, it's all right, my bad. Um, yeah. My muscles flex in a weird way on there. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, How long have you been in the city for? Thank you so much for the uh, raid, Keo. I've been here Keo. for about two days now, actually. Oh, very, very exciting. Um, Would you yeah. love, uh, I would love for this career day interview to be in your police car. In my police car? Yeah, all would right. you do the yeah, honors? sure. Yeah. Why not? You can come with. Of course. And I actually think uh, if there's a location that would be very good for an interview with a police officer such as yourself, I think the, the, the Bean Cafe is the perfect area. The Bean Cafe? All right, I've never been, so you might have to tell me how to get there. Oh, I'll give you, I'll input the location and the GPS once we get in the vehicle. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Yeah. Oh, it seems your car is a little... Well, it's been through some things. It is the work of a police officer. Uh, but yes, thank you. Yeah, Will so you be there next season, oh, Keo? I'd so love to see you. How do I? Am I able to just unlock at the GPS system here? I let me let me tap on the uh, GPS screen real quick. Double tap for me. Sure. Uh oh. I don't think I'm able to do it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right. I, I don't think it's able to let me. But if you look in the map, uh, right near us is a B letter on the map. But thank you everyone for the right. raid. What were you guys see. doing? Um, let's see. Do you know what the number is? Oh, I see it. There it is. Yep, a big B. All right. So, Mr. Uh, Balls? Yep, well, that's me. You would call yourself a police officer, right? Just a regular old police, run of the mill? Someone to just protect and... That's what I do. Ooh. Did you have dreams of being a police officer your whole life? Yeah, I actually grew up uh, watching a lot of, uh, like reading a lot of comics. Like Criminal Brains shows? Um, not necessarily that. I would say more along the lines of like Spider-Man and stuff. Oh, and Batsman. Oh, oh, I'm not much of a comic yeah. reader myself, but it's really interesting to see one. Yeah, yeah. I grew up watching them, and I always thought, you know, I'd always want to do that. I'd want to fight some crime. Ew. Yeah. What is your favorite story from any issue? Um, I think it would have to just be the origin story of Spider-Man. He's mm -hmm. very, um, how would you say? He's very relatable to, to us. Ah, really? How, how, and how do you think so? He's just an, uh, you know, average guy, average kid, just wanting to do good, had some, have, has some big responsibilities, but still tries to do his best to do, and, you know, like, maintain his own social life. 
yeah, yeah, of course, of course. I'm, I'm very glad that you resonated a lot with Spider-Man. I, I hear he's very popular these days. Yeah, that's what I've been hearing. I've been wanting to catch the latest, like, some of the movies recently. All right, all right. Let me go see if this area is self-serving. Sure. Yeah, I know it's your first time in here. You can be free to take a seat. Oh my god, it's a new Vespa! I am new Vespa! Um, you you look at your third eye with the alt muscle. A bit of a uh, zen moment, yeah. And you can see the circles and interactions you can do in this area. Alright. Yeah, Alright. Nice place. Yeah, it is a nice place. I actually went here when there's uh, baristas in here, so, and they knew what to do way more than I do right now. Oh. I, I think you actually have to be in the career to uh, interact with the item. I mean, yeah, interact that's with everything. Right. No, that's okay. Do you oh, want to just hit up a gas place. station instead for some food? Uh, I mean, if you're hungry, yeah, we can do that. Or, uh, I mean, I'm fine. I I already ate lunch. I, like, uh, you caught me on my, in the middle of my lunch break, but... Oh, uh, actually, we can just chill around. I can uh, wait to eat later. It kind of sounds like Tobey Maguire a little. Actually, my production team, um, after hearing your Spider-Man comment, they they would say you kind of sound like Tobey Maguire. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 there's no way. I, uh, <laughs> no, I, I, I've, I've never gotten that before. Stop it. <laughs> really, really? Oh, my goodness. And you know what? You got a similar haircut to him at that movie. <laughs> oh, yeah, you know, the Spider-Man. I remember that Spider-Man 3 thing. Yeah. The Sam Raimi trilogy. <laughs> Too? Yeah, yeah, the, the whole dancing and everything. Yeah. I don't think you'd catch me dancing on the streets anytime soon. <laughs> oh, oh, what a shame. <laughs> it was a very funny dance. Um, Back at the studio, they did say they're running a three-minute ad break. You know, we got to get money for our indie newspaper. Sorry about that. Do you want to say anything yeah, no to problem. those at home that have the premium subscription to our news network, though? Um, I, Any exclusive I, uh, content? And, uh, just... Uh, well, what's the age range that like we're, we're oh. talking to? Well, just, families in general. Uh, usually, uh, older adults tend to watch my news. I advertise it as such. Foul language oh. is allowed. Yes. Oh, uh, um, don't worry, citizens. Um, the the Los Santos Department will be taking care of any issues and keeping you safe uh, during the day and night. Uh, and I don't, I don't, uh, to be honest, I don't really have any spicy news to go for, for that or anything like that. Really? But, yeah. All right. Can you give us a little bit of a, of a Spider-Man quote reference, Mr. McGuire? I mean, Mr. Balls. <laughs> uh, uh, any favorite quotes it, it, from the movie? It's pizza time. <laughs> he does say that. He does say that. I quite remember that. Uh, my favorite line from that movie is, uh, Something about sand. How does it go? Oh no, dirt in your eyes. Oh, I I, I don't know if I'm familiar with it. How, how, what was the what was the entire quote? I'm gonna throw dirt in your eyes. Something like that. I I I, ve I remember watching the Sam Raimi movies like last years. Oh okay, yeah. It's been quite some time since I watched uh, since I watched the movies. I I've been a really big fan of that Tom Holland kid. Oh, I haven't watched Tom Holland myself, actually. The Marvel Universe got a little too crazy for me. I wasn't keeping up with it at first, but... And now I'm really, really behind. What about you? Yeah, no, I I, I just watch them for the entertainment. I, uh -huh. I don't... Like, I know a lot of those comic book guys are uh, just up in arms about how it goes. I think they're fun uh, to an extent. Not really sure how I'm feeling about like these newer movies, but you know, I think it's the so original, funny. St like the older Marvel Universe stuff, uh, they're they're all right. Yeah, yeah, everyone's everyone's entitled to their own opinions. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. I was reading a comment at the city. Hold on, let me let me. <laughs> Someone said their favorite quote from the movie is "Ah, my back" from Spider-Man Two. I don't know whether they just made up the quote or not, honestly. My production team could tell me anything about the movie quotes, and I would believe it. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure he said something about that when he, when, when, when his back got hurt. <laughs> something along the lines. <laughs> it was really cool. Uh, maybe this is spoilers for everyone, but um, uh, they, they actually referenced that in the, 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 the latest Spider-Man uh, Far From Home what was, was the movie I think about the back was. hurting. They referenced yeah, that. They do. That's it's so a, it's silly. Really, really cool. Yeah. Wow. I think it was like really nice. <laughs> Most, yeah. 
Well, it I do, looks. I do like that Andrew Garfield kind of get got guy too. Oh my inspired. goodness! I don't know anything about the Andrew Garfield movies, but he is quite the handsome man. That Andrew Garfield guy. Yeah, yeah. I think he. I think so. I, I would say so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Even if I, I'm sorry if you don't swing that way. I just thought it was. You know, everyone knows him oh, as no, a pretty no, boy Spider Man. Enough to be with. I'm comfortable with the, with myself enough to be like, yeah, that guy's a good looking. We love to see that from a cop. <laughs> Anyways, the ad segment is over now. So back to the interview questions. Oh, before we do that, though, every single advertisement, we have to do a hydration check. Make sure our voice is clear oh, up. Yeah, of course. <clears throat> yeah, let me, uh, let me do that real quick. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, my production team just informed me that I accidentally made a pun. A Spider-Man pun when I said, um, don't swing that way, like, like, like web swing. Oh, <laughs> yeah, just, yeah, just like Spider-Man, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> sorry, sorry. See, my earpiece is cutting up uh, the voices of you for a moment. That was really robotic. <laughs> Some uh, satellite disconnection. Oh, no, sorry. Is, is this better now? Yeah, it's better now. It's better, now. It's better now. But just for a moment, that was really funny. Um, let me ask you another question. Yeah, sure. So, so how how are the other polices? How are your colleagues? Oh, they're great. Um, I actually work fairly closely with uh, my part with my uh my my, my work partner uh, Kenneth Goldschlager. He's a detective. He's a pretty nice guy from the UK. Um, we also have uh, Officer Dover. And uh, we got Richard Slanger. He, he, that's that's our police chief. He's a, they're they're all great guys. You know, I'm starting all, to all, notice Officer Wang. I'm starting to notice uh, an interesting name and convention little, with little, you guys. Guy's a little high strung. Oh fuck! I was like he's, um A little manic here and there, but he's not a bad guy at all. Yeah, yeah, it's one of those cops that you know you you still love him. You still love him, of course. Are you playing on course, PC? I am yeah, playing they're, on they're all, both. They're all really great a PC, guys in their, PC. Own, in their own way. They handle the law pretty finely, at least from what I've seen. Ooh. Well, you say pretty fine from what you've seen, but, uh, you know, you got any gossip about your coworkers? Ah, uh, gossip. Oh, man. I could tell you. I could tell you a lot of it. So the other day, uh -huh. uh, Goldschlag found out Goldschlager is actually a really big fan of, um, what do the kids call it? White girl music. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's like we 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 had it. We 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 got it. We we were doing a we were doing a case, and while we were walking, um, you know, I made a small reference to a Vanessa Carlton song. You know that song, Thousand Miles. Yeah, and he knew all the words. He oh. Even the piano parts up his mouth. It's crazy. That, that's just like. Have you ever seen the movie White Chicks? Hello, Doctor Pig. Thank you so much for yeah. the raid. Yes, I actually have. It was, yeah. It actually went down just like that. <laughs> I love that movie. You know, I probably watched that movie when I was way too young, but that makes watching it as an adult even better. Right, right. There's a, there's a lot of things that you catch here and there. Yeah. That you probably wouldn't have caught as a kid. <laughs> no, no, for sure. No, no. But that moment with, um, what was that actor name? With the... Uh, Terry Crews? Terry Crews. He played yeah. such a fantastic role. And he was also a cop in oh. that movie, correct? Oh, uh, um, no, no, I think it was the Wayland Brothers. Sorry, like, uh, don't don't want to make you seem like you're wrong, but... No, no, uh, no, no feel the, free to correct me. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the Wayne's Brothers, that's what... Yeah, the Wayne's Brothers were the cops, and he was just another character that just got involved into the... Yeah, yeah, but he was so amazing with that yeah. white girl music segment. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, yeah but I didn't fantastic. know that about Goldschlag. I may need to bring that up once he gets around uh, to waking up in this town. Yeah, I highly recommend if you ever see him. He's a really, really nice guy. A little bit weird because, you know, he's from the UK. They do things a little bit different there, but a really pleasant person to be around. Yeah, actually, funny that you mentioned the weird people from the UK because um, I actually do broadcast um, that really caters more to UK audience and just general European viewers. So it's always exciting oh, really? to see the production team uh, tell me something about the area or stuff. I, I agree, they are kind of strange. Yeah, they they do drive uh, on the wrong side of the road. Has uh, has Goldschlag done that a couple times? 
<laughs> and uh, you know, like some of the other Europe, some, some other Europeans just kind of have some like uh, weird tastes in food. What, what's that? Their strumming? Like I, I don't know if I can ever get behind that. Sorry, what was it? The it's like a it's like a really stinky fish. I, th- I think it's like the, it's a Swedish thing. The Swedes do that. Oh, the Swedes. Okay, how do you spell that fish? Uh, it's, it's, it's like S. And it's got that, it's that U with like the, the U with, the, it's like a weird like dot, the dots on top of the U. Uh-huh. Uh, R-S-T-R-O-M-M-I-N-G, I think, something like that. Oh, I, I oh, fuck, but hold it's on. it's like this weird fit, the, the fish that they cook in ammonia, that they like leave in ammonia for a while. Oh, dear Lord. They are quite the interesting bunch. Yeah, probably like something. I, I, I don't know. Like it's got to be an acquired taste or something. Oh, definitely. Kind of like how uh, the French got their blue cheese. I think that's French. Yeah, yeah. I, I feel like yeah, French cheese. You know, it's like I, I think they just go hand in hand, right? Yeah, probably. I don't know. We might need to do a cultural day segment as well. A culture day segment. Yeah, I don't. I, I don't. I haven't met met any like French citizens here just yet, but. I'm sure we have some around. Like, yeah. Los Santos is a very melting pot kind of place. Yeah, exactly, exactly. The beautiful state of California has blessed us with citizens from all across the country, from everywhere in the world. Yeah, and we, 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 we here in Los Santos, we, we accept all walks of life, you know? Yeah, exactly. Okay, Um, another question I can get from you. Uh, Do you, do you see yourself doing this uh, police work in another 10 years? Yeah, you know, like, I think this is the career path for me. Mm. Uh, I think the only thing that could probably stop it is if, you know, like, God forbid something were to happen to me. Oh, but yeah. <laughs> other than that, you know, I'm in the line, like, the, the police, wor- police work isn't doesn't mean I'm always going to not be in the line of danger or anything like that. So, you know, like 10 years from now, yeah, I'd hope I'd be here. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I'm glad. I'm glad you're gonna continue your line of uh, police work. Um, speaking of which, dying a bunch. Um, how are you in your relations to some of the EMT people? Oh, uh, the EMTs? They've been great. They've been fantastic. I mean, anytime, anytime, like, uh, anytime we need someone to get taken care of, they're pretty quick. I don't think I've met. I don't think I've met an EMT who hasn't like done their job. A little on the expensive side, but you know. Ooh, it's yeah. The expensive? How expensive are we talking? I don't know. I think I've been charged five hundred dollars once just for, uh, just for like for like service. But five hundred dollars you know, like, for one service? Do you remember the name yeah. of this EMT? Uh, uh, off the top of my head, no, I I don't. It, it was in the middle. It was we were in the middle of a big case, and like there was just some stuff. There was we're getting like, some real drama production team left and right, and you know, things happen and. I just wound up with the five hundred dollar bill. Jeez, I was it like a shootout situation? Uh, yeah, you might have you might have seen it on the news. There was a, it was just it was it was a small it was just a small ordeal with um, with a uh, with just a couple drug dr- like uh drug lords from what I am understanding or. Oh my god, thing, like, you were there for the drug war. There. I I didn't know. Oh fuck. I didn't know you were there with the drug lords. Oh my goodness. I heard about that, but there was some, I didn't know where to find them. And, and I had a uh, one news reporter actually tell me about that, but, uh, I think they, uh, clocked out as soon as I went to texting them. Oh no. Well, yeah, I, I don't think I can divulge any more information. Uh, oh, NDA, NDA, private case. Yeah, definitely can't talk too much about it, but yeah, it was, uh, it definitely was a thing that happened. I know. I'm not sure like how much news coverage was on there and how much we can really divulge, but I'm, just, you know, just to be on the safer side, I think we'll just leave it at that. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Um, speaking on that though, uh, can I ask if this case is resolved or will we see another appearance today about that? Uh, so the only thing I can tell you really right now about that is like everything's been taken care of. We shouldn't have to worry about anything on there. Damn it, basic, And when I say basic. shouldn't, I mean we've gotten a little taken care of. There should, like the streets of Los Santos are safe. Police have taken care of everything on there. 
I uh, don't foresee any issues going on in the future here. All right, let's just hope. We can only hope, though. We can only hope. Um, but that uh, but that actually leads me to my final question. Um, is there any like NDA you would love to disclose to us, if you could? Ah, uh, about that. Any that if I could, that I mean, you want I would, to, yeah. If I could. But you don't know, worry, like we can keep that. this one on the down yeah. low. We'll 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 uh, be able to. Uh, yeah, yeah. Look, look, I, I, don't, I don't like, like, ma'am. I I know, I know that you're doing, you're just doing your job. But I, you know, I'm doing my job. I can't divulge any of that information here. Ah. Uh, I'm so, uh, I'm sorry. Look, like, I, I I've got I've got a I've got a job to uphold, and I, I'm sure I'm sure like I I 100% believe you. I I have full trust in you, but you know. I got to do my job and I can't talk about it Damn it! right right now. I mean, if you'd like to, you can always ring up our police chief uh, officer, uh, De Chief Deputy Schlager. Okay, um, Schlager. I can get you his information later, but yeah, just go ahead and um, uh, you can you can reach out to him. You can reach out to the Damn. police force and everything. If you have any other questions and he'll take care of it from there. Okay, Schlager is someone I can go potentially for this question. Potentially yeah, for potentially any. Potentially you can talk to. Yeah, I'm just... I'm just I'm just a rookie officer. I've seen I've seen my fair share of things here in the past few days, but uh, you know you'd have to go up higher than than me to get some more information off of that. And you know what? I admire your amazing ability to uphold your oath. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, you know, I'm just do I'm just doing like once again. I'm just doing my job. You know, like you know how like uh, Uncle Ben says, you know, with great power comes great responsibility. What Schlorpin? You know, We're interviewing a cop for rep, career day. I just want to show people, you know, there's there 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 there's still good cops out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know what? I would say you're up there with one of the best. Oh, thank you. Appreciate yep. that. Thank you. That concludes my interview with you for today. Uh, if you don't mind, I would love to be uh have one more ride in your police car. Yeah, not a problem. We can do that. Okay. Um, I'm more than happy to oblige. Yeah, um, do you know where the EMT might be when there's not a dying person in the streets? Um, I'm not 100% sure, actually. Or different divisions, so, uh, you might have to, you might have to search around. They might just be on patrol is all. Yeah, thank you so much anyways. Uh, I will need to pick up food for myself, and then you can be on your merry way if you would love to. Yeah, sure. Just any gas station. Does your police car require gas, actually? It does. Yeah, we still pay for our own gas and everything. <laughs> Uh-oh. All right, I'll be getting up from this chair now. Sure. Are you familiar with how to... Yep, okay, good. <laughs> yeah, I think I, I watched the, the hand... I watched your muscles go up, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're very intuitive, officer. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All right. Oh. Yeah, don't. Yeah, I, I always forget to wait a little bit for the car to unlock. There we go. There you go. All right. Uh, uh, make sure you click your seatbelt on. Oh, yep. Yep. For sure. For sure. I forgot to do perfect, it to the last guy. Your see. limbs look quite functional today. The they do. Is. It's a little bit tighter. Uh, Tighter, you know. Get out from that seat like the demon from Insidious. I don't know why my character sits like that. I think there's something I need to adjust. Yep. Don't worry. Take your time. And if you ever hear me uh, being silent, you know, I'm just writing down my notes, seeing, reviewing them to see any questions I'm missing. So don't don't be nervous if I go quiet. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Yeah. All right. I need to eat, though. I am, like, on the brink of death. And yes, hello, David. We're doing interview for career day. I actually have questions written down, and it's really fucking funny to see how people respond. It's so cute. It's like learning about everyone's life stories. All right. Have you located the nearest uh, gas station? Yep, yep. I see the little dot. All right. All right. And we're all off. Are you able to turn on your sirens just for the uh, for a quick show? Yeah, I can do that. Oh! <gasps> Ooh. I I feel I you know I love being in a police car like this. Luckily, not in the back seat of it. This is my first time right, actually. Right, right. I don't. You don't seem like the type that would want to be in the back. What's going on here? Hmm. hmm someone has their door open, but uh, it's Looks okay. Like there's no car. I'll, oh. I'll bring that into the station later. <laughs> 
Of course, of course. Just go ahead and do this real quick. Get a little like with the lights on. You know, we do. We, we can do a, a couple things. Here. It probably scares some of the locals seeing the lights on. Honestly. Yeah, it's true. All right. Well, here we are. All right. Once again, thank you so much. And oh my God, the lights! I just feel like a little kid again. Just seeing the police. <laughs> Not a problem at all, ma'am. Well, be safe. If you need anything, you're always welcome to call the police. All right. Yeah. Have a good day. Oh, Thank my you, belt. You too. All right. Uh, I don't think I can eat in here. Shit. I said any gas station and I forgot to offer him uh, to pay for the food. Uh-oh. 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 I need to eat soon. <laughs> I think I might have food in my... Okay, good. I do. Uh. <laughs> okay, that wasn't the best place to put it, but he couldn't have known. He couldn't know. He didn't know. He didn't know. Ah, oh, shit, I also only have $40. I forgot to ask him. Okay, uh, mission for the day. Find it. Oh. Okay. We found the EM e AMT. We found one ATM. The mission today was to find the ATM and get some food. And brother, I just checked off one out of the two of the list. This is going to be a spectacular day. Mission complete. <laughs> All right, let me re withdraw some money right here. Uh, let me go take another 570, just round it down right there. I love being a news reporter. I, I'm a, a lot more free to do whatever I want and still get paid. Although, unfortunately, it doesn't seem like... Uh... Okay, let me see if there's any... Uh... Okay, luckily, there's a 24-7 uh, grocery right there. Why did I get a ZZZ drop watching for you? I do have ZZZ enabled for drops. That shouldn't happen when I'm not playing the game. That is... I am so sorry. And knowing Twitch, that thing's gonna be on your screen forever, dude. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Um, why did I get like... A, wait, I already read that. AO? Yeah, ZZZ is like the hottest thing. Also, whenever you're not in a vehicle, you kind of just have to find your way around this town. Which, a little, which is a little bit difficult for me as someone that is... Uh, has trouble with directions already, so it looks like I gotta go one block here, cross the street. That police officer was really nice. That police officer was really nice. I kind of want to see who else is online to see uh, who we can uh, not interrogate. That's not the right word. Oh, it seems another police hopped online. Uh, oh God, did I actually hold up the other police officer? I'm so sad if that is the case. Wait, what if we do, like, applied learning and I just faint on the ground with starvation? No, I shan't. <laughs> Anyways, oh, uh, we are including the NDA question because it's kind of funny. But, although, I kind of agree. Maybe we shouldn't include it anymore because I don't think a lot of people are going to say no. But, you know. Okay, it's going to be straight. Crossing the street right here. Uh, do I see any, uh... So maybe I could cross it more. Uh, this is really fun. Sorry, Miss Garcia, we don't have the funds for a more for a more modern GPS. I it's okay. It's totally okay, ladies. You know, I I've been driving around here too much mindlessly. I think it's about time I learn about the the layout of the land. There is a hands-free car wash. That is super interesting. Hey, who knows? Maybe someone will buy it. Yeah, exactly. I love seeing the new characters that come. I mean, the uh, new names that pop up on my screen. I hope I wasn't taking much of the... What was that guy's name? Oh, Harry Balls. And I realized I put the wrong question in the wrong box. Don't worry, easy fix. Easy, easy fix. Harry Balls. Yeah, yeah, you guys remember him, of course. The grilled cheese costs $2 now! Thank goodness. All right, we can also buy a bunch of other stuff as well. Uh, I believe I can afford maybe some 16... And, of course, bottle of water. A classic, a classic. It really does feel like a town in here, everyone. All right, and uh, I would love to get cola, but I do not feel like it right now. Let me get some whiskey, though. I heard cola whiskey is a very popular uh, recipe with one of our... Uh, News members. News, news crews. News crews. I keep forgetting to call you guys news crews. Man, the price is... It's only $2, right? Wait, can I actually... Oh my god, there's a new team here too. Um, I will... I kind of want to need... I kind of need to keep track of all the ATMs mentally. It's really fun. 
Um, hold on, there's a way to do a quick view of the uh, items. I don't remember. I don't remember what button that is. Ugh, I kind of realize, honestly, how much I talk with a lisp, and I want to end my life. Wait, do you have a? Don't worry about that. Don't you know? Now that I mention it, I keep accidentally plopping it up, and now there's a new rule of the land that there will be less violence enforced today. New gun law rules. You know how it is. The fact that if you actually pull it up, people will get actually scared. You're going to uh, blow their heads off. Granted, that's been the reason why there's been many death rates in this town. But uh, God's law has now enforced that we need to use our gun when we need to. Don't ask why a civilian has a gun. Simply ask... Um... Why I feel the need to have a gun. Don't ask me how. Ask me why should I have it in the first place. The real question should be uh, given towards society. She ate the bottle! No, I did not. Right? Hold on, let me get one more snackies. That's water, that's water. Oh, there's a new ad being posted. Let me go see that after I finish my 20-year animation of drinking water. I didn't even know I was I was a uh, part of the crew. I just got here. Everyone here is part of the sh crew, part of the ship, part of the crew. You did give me very good at questions. Um, I like that I'm kind of tapping my feet. It seems I suffer a little bit of anxiety, but you know, who doesn't? Did I get pinged? Wait, I saw advertisements in here. I think my phone is broken. Don't ask her why she has a gun. Ask why God gave it to her. So, so true. Okay, hold on. Why can't I see advertisements? I think my phone is broken. Uh, let me, may, maybe if it was on Twitter? Hold on. It seems I probably need to post about this. Um, sorry if you posted an ad. My phone doesn't seem to let me see it. Uh, reply if With your ad, please. All right. Actually, now that there's less people in here, that means uh, there could be a rising star on Twitter.com. Not saying the rising star could be me, of course, but you know, like, uh, how do I say it? I could uh, try to influence the whoever's online. Meeting done. I yaffed, I yaffed, I spin the wheel. Yay, I'm so proud of you, Zepter. All good. Welcome, we just finished interviewing the taxi driver and the cop. I I still think it's funny that the fucking cop called me and then punched me. It's great. Uh, I, I probably need a new keybind instead of my uh, side mouth. This, side mouth is kind of hurting my finger. All right, let me see. Oh wait, hold on, let me see someone sweet. Felt a little angsty, got a new car decal. That's pretty fun. Holy shit, you're Shadow the Hedgehog. Anyways, um, let me go ahead and see who else to call online actually. Services. I kinda wanna interview the police, but um, let me go interview an ambulance. Let me talk to someone new. Well, yeah, we kind of skip. Hello? Hello, hello. Is this the EMT? It is the EMT, yes. How can I help you? Well, I am a reporter for my Indie News, and today's theme is actually Career Day. So I was wondering if you want to pick me up with your EM with your uh, truck, ambulance car, vehicle, and uh, oh. drive me around while answering some questions. Yeah, I totally have an ambulance. I'll pick you up. <laughs> Oh, anyway, where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, yep. Yeah, I will tell you my location once I open my map. Oh, she yeah. seems so excited. <laughs> it might, it might look a little small. It might. Some people might say that, oh, an ambulance should have four wheels, and your <laughs> ambulance has two wheels, and also has handlebars. But don't listen to that. <gasps> oh my gosh, she has a scooter. Um, handlebars and two wheels, huh? Would this be the bicycle, uh, vehicle type or the uh, scooters I've seen around? Some might say it is a bicycle, but you know, I would call it an ambulance, a stripped down ambulance, mm. like an ambulance light, you know? Congratulations on your uh, bisexual cycle. I'm very proud of them for coming out. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, well, oh, I don't think it's that way. I'm a, I, just to be, to be fair, I'm a little bit heterochromic, so I don't know if I would call it that, but. 
Oh, oh, okay, okay. I was, uh, you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course. Yeah, um, of course, of course. on the mat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hold on, let me pull up the map again. I forgot my number immediately <laughs> after I looked at it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It seems I am in uh, the 24-hour grocery store at 9066. It is in front of the car, self-washing car. 9066. Let me see. I also employ self washing This car. person is so oh. silly. I love this. Is that that technology oh. now? What is Musk doing these days? Oh, sorry? Oh, yeah. No, just, you know, self-washing cars. That seems like, you know... I don't know, man. It's a slippery slope. You start with self-washing cars, next you got cars that are running for president, you know? Oh, 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 this is quite an interesting angle. I, I'd love to get your opinions on this once you uh, arrive this for an interview. Yes, it will take me probably like two-ish minutes, but you know? Yeah, 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 of course. Uh, I will be waiting for you uh, until then. 90, 60, uh, hold on, 90, 46, 24, oh, 7. Yeah, sorry, sorry. I thought it was a six. I, that was on me. Oh, good. It's all yeah, good. It's all good. The icon in there kind of covers the number. All right. Well, I will see you soon then. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Does she know how to hang up? I, I want to see up. if she knows how to hang up. How's the hang up? <laughs> they found it! They found it! Actung, actung, three nine four six, three nine four eight six. <laughs> I always knew bisexuals rode bicycles. <laughs> I knew as soon as they said bicycle that I had to make that joke. Wait, yeah, we kind of skipped over that. He just assaulted you after out of nowhere, then you were chill. Yeah, he, um... Kind of had a little bit of a muscle spasm there, but that's okay. It happens to the best of us. Don't be afraid, uh, news crew. Anyways, uh, this is really fun. It's almost like they have two wheels or something. Almost like that. Almost. But, you know, it's a, it's an ambulance car. <laughs> they were so cool. I don't know who they are, but interacting with them, it's so fun. They, they talk like with a smile on their face. Acton, acton. Let me go hydrate real quick. He decked you right in the schnoz. You know what? We should have a replay video about that. You know, can anyone have the clip for that? I'm sorry I actually don't have cl clip commands working still. Maybe in the middle of the stream, if another ad break happens and I'm alone, we can uh, take time to drink water, do stretches, and, um, uh, what do you call it? Get the bot to work real quick. Act dunk, baby! <laughs> All right, hopefully they'll be able to find me. They don't have my number, so uh, I could just hit them up again because I realize I keep forgetting to uh, give number to people. I think I was holding up uh, Harry Balls for him to leave. That's so funny. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Garcia, lesbian sleeper code. <laughs> I totally understand. No, it's okay. It's okay. You're totally free to say whatever you want in the uh, in the news group chat. Oh, is that them? No, no. I don't see a bicyclist anyways. It's almost like Avi never plays Signalis. I, I don't remember how to chant. I, I knew it was the uh, Signalis reference. It's just that I love the actong, actong. Uh, do, do, do. Hold on, what was I gonna say? Um, I'm excited for them to show up in their uh, vehicle of choice. I, I hope they find me. I get a little, I, I need to ask them now. Where are you? I am in this location. How long do you think it'll take you to pick me up? I realize no one has my number that I've interviewed so far. That's so funny. Well, this has been a very exciting news uh, news crew, honestly. Even though it's a bit slow in this town, I hope that maybe like uh, exposing different careers will make anyone that wants to uh, get their visa to this town look forward to some things maybe i should do that like what would you say to our future emts slash drivers slash um police that want to join this uh job Ooh, i sound so fancy now you know i never asked that cop what his education is oh. um oh Sorry. that ow uh, my leg is a little bit hurt Oh, I uh, I have some bandages. I'm sorry. Hold on. Are you are I you still registered as a, as an AMT member? No, I'm currently bank driving. I'm driving for banks. I'm sorry. I only have these. I I I'm so. <laughs> Did you think I was a local? 
Kinda. And do you do you usually run over locals? No. <laughs> it's okay. I won't tell the cops if you do. Okay. Hey. Um. So we have a bit of a situation okay, here, here, actually. Funny seeing you. Uh, Hello. Hello. And and are you? I'm sorry. I'm looking. Oh. Um, I'll see you soon, Ralph, for an interview if you... Actually, hold on. Let me ask for this oh, man's number so I may interview oh. him. Is he... Oh, wait. Oh, that's the wrong button. Hold on. Oh, and I, I mean, he can come along. I, I believe he's an um, ENT as well. No, oh. I'm, I'm, I'm doing bank bank job right now. You see right there, the bank truck? Oh, is that what that is? It's yep. full of money? Is it full Not of money? Not right now. I haven't oh. gotten any yet. Oh, okay. Let me know when you... um. Figure that no. out. Can, can you Can you heal them now? What am I healing? Her? Oh, she hurt? I yeah, had a I little bit. Hit her. Yeah. Oh, she looks fine to me. Oh, okay. Okay. Hold on, Ralph. May I exchange phone numbers with you so I may call you for a news day, a career day interview later? We'll get to your interview soon, ma'am. It's just that I keep forgetting to ask people for their numbers. Yeah, I got okay. a number. Yeah. Oh, I a number. Ralph's yeah. great. Ralph's great. Yeah, no worries. Um, oh, I don't know. I heard some news about him, but. Oh. Hello? Yeah, yeah. I'll get your numbers, Ralph. Your contact details. Yeah, um, I've been interviewing service workers actually on our mobile oh, devices. You get access to you. every single EMTs, police, all that, but you don't get things for like the big drivers. Oh, I see. Well, that's amazing. I or that's really cool. I really think what you're doing is really important because a lot of the little people, you know, they get forgotten, they get lost in the cracks, you know. Exactly, especially after yesterday's news cycle where there was gang activities. Oh yes! Oh my gosh! Did you did, were you able to to get any coverage on that? Is there any update? I actually was working with my uh, fellow partner. She is gone. She is uh flew gone? flew off to another city now. But yesterday, she actually got pretty involved in the story herself, even though she was a camera lady. Oh wow! Oh my gosh! I hope she's safe. Yeah, she, she was very safe. Okay. She uh got recruited to be one of the ten wives, I believe, for uh, the Battelle man. Oh, I. Oh, is that? Oh. Is that... I don't think that's good for the agency, maybe. No, it's not good, but, like, you know, she was also in a dangerous situation herself. She she probably didn't know what happened if she said uh, she declined his uh, offer. He didn't even offer her. He just declared it. Oh, wow. And Oh, these terrible... And, and this is between you and me, but that was kind of... She's also uh, my wife, so uh, it felt really offensive oh, to look hey. at the... No, that's okay. That's okay. I totally get it. Do you want to get in the vehicle? Yeah, I would. I mean, you know, it's a little worse for wear now. It's missing two of the doors in the back, but... No, no. I think it adds character. It really says I've been on the fields. That's, you know what? You're right. That's a great attitude to take. I do think that any customers that I... Oh, buckle, buckle up. Put your seatbelt on. Oh, oh, yep. Totally forgot about that. Yep, yep, yep. Any, um, you know, people... Patients that we put in the back might not be as uh, accepting of that, but you know... Yeah, yeah, of course. But, you know, you need to get to where you need to get to. Yeah, you do. All right. So, as we see... Uh, oh, I can't keep it, keeping actually, any money in there. probably drive off to a location. There's one near the hospital, but there's also a further location. It's probably being taken care of, but i just like to check it out in case. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. And I think it would be very cool to have uh, an on-the-air field work live. Bring yes. up ratings. It's true. I'm also a very good driver, so... <laughs> oh, yeah, don't worry. Obey, I'll obey all traffic laws. So oh. you're, that you're in no danger. No, I think as an EMT, you're allowed to uh, skip ahead. You know, you are in an oh, urgent okay. business, in you an urgent field. You think it's okay then, right? You think it's okay then? I mean, okay. if the firefighters and the police can do it, then surely you're going to have to do it as well. Someone's urgent in urgent need of care. All right, excellent. Yeah, no, that's what I always say. I always just, say that just we should... Maybe it needs to be on the right side of the... Uh oh! That's what I just think we should, you know, we should... We got oh, so oh, much slack... I, for all the danger, that, like a oh. danger, we don't cause any danger. Oh. We're very good. And safe oh, ow, ow. I'm just, sorry, I have to check my phone real quick. I'm oh, my arm! Quick. Oh, uh, my see. legs! Um, oh, what's? Oh, are you okay? What's wrong? What's wrong? Um, what happened? It seems my spine took like, if I were to uh, quantify this into numbers, it looks like my spine is taking fifty percent damage. Oh wow! You know that's you know what the problem is. Yeah. A lot of people don't care about their health in this day and age. You know, you get to a certain age and you're like, oh, <laughs> I'm still in my twenties. I can just you know, I can just <laughs> stay all night long playing you know video oh. games, violent video games. 
Yeah. I think, I think it's important that we actually still exercise. You know, oh, sorry. Let me just. Oh, oh, no. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, no worries. Take your time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, you seem a little, you seem a little pale. Are you all right? I think that a uh, wall smash we did there kind of hurt my spine. No, I I mean, you think that, right? You think as the environment, people say, oh, these chairs and everything, they're getting so you know, <laughs> bad. And, like, they're not as good as the products we used to have. But really, it's lifestyle issues. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you think that's what uh, is causing my uh, back to hurt in the middle of that drive here? Yeah. No, no. It'll, your back, you will just randomly get back pain and random body pain all throughout the day. Do you exercise daily? Um. Yes. Right now, actually, is the most exercise I've gotten right now because I have been, uh, Trying to connect with locals and citizens, so walking around has been uh, my preference of transportation. Oh, that's amazing. Wow. Yeah, you really get to see a lot of people when you're just on your two feet. I would have thought that maybe the agency would provide you with a vehicle or some sort of device. But... They do, they do, but by the time I learned about it, um, I already have purchased a vehicle of my own. I call her Betsy. Oh. Yeah, but you know, after yesterday, she was in a bit of a calamity state. Oh no, it was it? Oh, those gang members again? Yeah, the gang members again. Just even just being an, around a police station gets you uh, a little bit of damage here and there. Oh, I'm can you honk for me? Oh, yes, I know the button for that. There you go, look at that. Whoa. Oh, oh do, you know, do you know this one? Yeah, that is amazing. It's even lighting up too, it's amazing. Guess, guess what song this is, guess what song this is. Da, 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 I I don't think I'm quite familiar with my tunes. Oh, <clears throat> is Megalovania? Sorry. Oh, yeah. oh, I I know. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, sorry. Oh. What's wrong? I I know Megalovania. Oh, I just uh. Like oh, you don't like video games? Are you one of those reporters who are like, oh, you know, devil's devil's game? No, no, that would be uh, another news where actually, now that you mentioned that, I am not affiliated with any official news agency i'm my own so i'm very open-minded and we we don't have any oh, worries about censorship in here oh, that's excellent then that's excellent can i can i be a bit honest with you freelance is a good word yes i think that hey sometimes I, I i don't really there's these so we have these med kits that we use to do our job right? oh there goes the uh front thingy what front thingy sorry what were you sorry okay so what did you say yeah, so we have these med kits that we use, right? Uh huh. As um, you know, devices for for our job, and it's just I've just been using them willy nilly on the patients. Well, don't you usually use med kits on patients? I do, I do, but like, I've never questioned what's inside the med kits. Oh, well, what prompted this up? Where are you going with this? Well, the other day I was it was it was actually I was chatting with one of those you know those dangerous gang members but they were saying they he called you know the the pink man person yes pink man is the one i'm familiar with yes yes he called us scammers he said that we just we are charging people like we fix them but we don't fully fix them we're holding the good stuff to ourselves and i'm like that's that can't be true right he said that to you yeah me and my partner me and my partner this is the band that has been hauling missiles to the city like no one's business and he wants to call you the scammers that's what I was saying. Also, where is he getting those missiles? It's very strange. Oh yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea where he's getting those man. Those those uh those gangs, they just get resources when whenever they want, wherever, I guess. It's crazy. This city is going to the dogs. I but, know. But you know, he did get me thinking. Mm-hmm. He did get me thinking. Mm-hmm. What is in these med kits? I've never questioned what we're doing. Hmm. I you see. You know what? Yeah? Ever since I started get, using these med kits, I've started hearing voices. These voices. Have you, do you hear them? Uh, uh, I haven't gotten use of the med kits today, but I'll think about that next time I'm using them. Oh, well, it seems like. Sorry, it seems so like a signal. Funny. Oh, there's a new injury. Let's see, where is that person? They are out in the mountains. Wow, that's a long trip. Um, um we got all day. We got all day. I, that's I, true. That's yeah. true. Usually. You know what? Yeah. It'll be easier to drive in the mountains, too. Less people. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Less people to, uh... You know. Oh, and less objects, too. And walls, and, uh, buildings, and trash cans, signs, exactly, lampposts. Exactly. What I was saying is that, after, when you use those med kits, you start to hear things, see some strange things. Have you seen 
Sometimes I'll see animals in the streets who just seem to be talking and walking, you know? Animals walking and talking. Any any species specifically? I'll see like, you know, dogs walking. I'll see oh my deer gosh. talking. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry. I was on my phone again. Wait, you were looking at your phone just now? I was, I just no, it's like an important business. We get like we get like, you know, messages on there about the job. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Go on, sorry. Animals? Yeah, so I'll see deer walking and talking and chickens walking and talking. Animals. I mean, that, obviously, that's not the issue. It's what they're saying. Oh, they talk. Yeah, yeah. What do they talk about? They tell me. Well, actually, this is actually true. I'm pretty sure the chicken told me to give them some sacrifices. <laughs> the chicken did that. Oh, it's oh. <laughs> the okay. chicken. What kind of sacrifice? Like uh, ten dollars, human lives. They asked me, "What do you think would be the best sacrifice for a chicken?" And then, I don't know, I, so here's the thing. I was not alone at the time. I was oh. with multiple people yeah. who were who were tell, who also heard the chicken. And uh -huh. they were all offering up sacrifices. Oh, oh. Wait, actually, I think I saw a tweet about someone saying that uh, they would like to request for good citizens. Good citizens. They were asking if there are any good people around, come to the EMT. And then they talked about a chicken posting later. You don't think they, uh, did something to that citizen that did come in, right? Oh. <gasps> You're saying that the citizen was the sacrifice for the chicken? This guy is, does not a drive. Can he just, I mean, it's a green light, buddy. Come on. Yeah, everyone knows you have to make way for the EMT. Exactly. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. That's oh. what I'm saying. These med kits, they alter your brain. And then that's how the government controls you with these chickens. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I see. I think, I don't know when they're going to fly back in or wake up, but I actually have a buddy you could really connect to with this. Oh, yeah. Is, are they also an EMT? Are they... Um, they are not an EMT, actually. They've been off the grid and trying to stay off the grid for a while. Actually, they've been on these mountains before, and, uh, how do you say it? They, so, they were hunting for Sasquatch. Hunting for Sasquatch? And they that, killed the that... guy. They killed the Sasquatch? Yeah, they killed Sasquatch. They posted it on Twitter and everything. That's, that's, that's I mean, that sounds pretty, I don't, you know, I can believe in a lot of stuff. That's pretty, that sounds pretty far-fetched. Oh, yeah, that's fair. But I would love to get you guys connected. Their name is Fully Adu. So if anything, you could talk to them and ask them what's in the med kits. That's true. You're right. You know, I would love to get in contact. I would love that. Yeah. Thank you, thank you for hooking us up. Of course. And, um... One more thing, uh, I know that they actually, I didn't believe them at first, but they were telling me about how they put chemicals and vaccines everywhere, and I didn't believe it until we got the, uh, the Ten Commandments back from a, a god above saying that drugs are in the area. Drugs are in the area? Drugs are now accessible in this oh town. Oh my god. This and town's going to shit. They're just letting, that's flooding the town with drugs. Yeah, it was a whole, like, announcement. Of some sort of server. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. And a, a number came into my head, and I got like the number one w in the red bubble circle. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, and I was. Gonna, is that that sounds like something a kind of beat that a reporter would follow? Is that something you're also gonna look into, maybe? Yeah, yeah, but I, it's not like I could ask God for an interview, right? Well, I mean, here's the thing. I think that if you pray hard enough and go on like a psychedelic journey. It so, might happen. so you're saying I should pursue the uh, drug lords of the area well, to I'm get this just, exclusive? Saying, it, it's it's really more like a, a search for yourself and for for you know religion, right? For faith. Uh huh. You're right. I mean, it is God. You'd have to do uh, unorthodox ways to get to Him. That's just a long route. I'm gonna take a bit of a shortcut. No, that's okay. That's I don't think we can take a shortcut with the uh, rails right here, but. Oh, as soon as I get an opportunity. No, no, those, those, those things. That, that, that thing. That orange things. Just the uh, orange. Around this corner, oh, actually. Oh. This corner might be better. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. That looks way better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Duh. Oh, there, I'm sorry there. That. That, that's okay, you, you that's okay. Okay, good, that's good. I, I don't know if I... Yeah, yeah, we do, we do. I remember. Hey, so you said on call that you had a, a bicycle? And this seems I... to have four wheels now. Did you upgrade it? Where'd you upgrade this, uh, bicycle? Well... Oh, <laughs> 
Sorry, oh, better about me, right? Sorry. Oh. Um, well, the exciting thing was that um, I tried to. So I figured I realized the bicycle is not a two seater. Uh huh. So, oh. Yeah, I thought I thought I would upgrade to this vehicle, and then the sad thing was that I couldn't fit the bicycle into the back of this vehicle. Yeah, I know. I I feel like there really should be a tow truck in this area, like uh, like for situations like right now, in case we uh what go what on happened? the side like that again. The truck went on its side for a moment. Yeah, I I am on the first person perspective. Uh, I flexed my V muscle to access right. this view, and it looks very lovely. Uh, yeah. Uh huh. And it, it kind of it went looked, sideways. I don't think it went on the side. It looked pretty pretty upright to me. Oh. oh. Well, we're seeing oh, very different that. things. Oh, owie, owie, owie. Oh, Please. no, that's just... No, it's really good. Like, the aloe vera is very good for you. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just forgot that this uh, vehicle had busted windows. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it does. It does. You know, these shitty vehicles, the, the department does not get enough funding these days. Yeah, I, I heard that, it. like, the EMT isn't just in starting a union. Oh, yes, they are. Oh my gosh, have you? Have you? I think who's the union? I actually have no idea who the union leader is. You don't? Oh my god. Yeah, I don't think there was ever a declared leader about it. But I do know that God, in one of His commandments, said that we, you guys, need to take your uh, prices more seriously, charging customers when you heal them with your med kits. Well, I'll be, I'll be honest here. That's part of why I've kind of, I kind of did a little bit of. I've started a hot side hustle because the EMT business does not pay well enough. No, for sure. They're like fifty dollars med kit, so I've heard. Yeah, it's crazy. It's Outstanding crazy. rates. All right, you can go do your business. I'll follow right behind you. Oh, they're gone. They're not dead anymore. I mean, not oh. dead. I mean, sorry, they're, they seem to be even helped. So. Oh. Maybe they went to the hospital. You know, I think we should have thought about that. We took I enough did. times. They probably yeah. went to the hospital. It's interesting, especially I will say, as an EMT, the most busy hours are not during the day. I will say it's quite. I feel like the gang leaders probably don't wake up at this time. No, no, you're right, you're right. They don't they don't come back in this time, actually. Uh what time zone would you say is your preference to uh obviously we're all in one same time zone, but yes. you know, people have preferred time zone like Eastern, uh Pacific time zones. For me, mentally, my headspace is at yes. Pacific time zone. What's yours? Oh my my headspace is at in Eastern times. Oh, there's a kitty cat, so cute. Here. Yeah, you know, some people are coming in here and they still experience that jet lag. Exactly, my mind. Wow, they're on the highway. Whoa, oh, this is crazy. beautiful. I don't want to follow them a little. A bit. nice view of nature. Yeah, yeah, you can follow them. Exactly, especially if you're in the V position. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm trying. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my. Okay, there you go. Oh wow. Oh, oh they. Whoa, they're ready to go. Just disappear. Oh, just I think you scared them off just a little oh, bit. No, no. He's okay. <gasps> okay. Oh, one of them got stuck on the on the. Geometry, some might say. Oh, and he's hidden over there. Oh, 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 yep. He just went all the way over there. They're really fast creatures. They're crazy fast. You know what? I think, here's what I think. You want a demonstration of our skills, correct? Yeah. Let's just, let me, I have, I have something I can show you. Hold on a moment. All right. We're getting a pretty interesting piece from this lady. Look for that deer over there. And then maybe, I think the deer probably got injured, don't you think? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, right. Let's go look for, yeah, let's go look for that deer. Yeah. I think they went this way. I'll be I'll be in a shouting toggle so you'll be able to hear me from afar. Good, I'll do that too. Let's see. What is that? Is that the She's gonna shoot you? No, she's not gonna shoot me. Can you hear me from here? Say Marco uh, say Polo if you can hear my Marco. Oh, I can okay, perfect. Can hear you. Marco Stay behind you over there. Polo Marco Marco? Marco? Yeah, I can't hear. Let me pick over here. Marco! <laughs> Are you able to toggle your ability to um, speak very loudly? Do you know what button that might be? I mean, what muscle that might be? So, this is an interesting procedure. I'll let you, uh, fig I'll help you out. If you look in the forums, I can actually, uh, Send you it in the in a ping message in the forums if you would like. Right. Your name is. May I have your name? Yes, my name is Rena EMT Stara. All but right. You just call me Rena. Okay, Rena is such a love. Rena. Oh fuck, I'm not in the game. Rena is such a lovely. Uh, I'm just, uh, I'm just Rena gonna... is such a lovely name. Let me go send you the uh, ping you so to much. deliver this message. Right, right, a text message or something, right? Yeah. Hold on. It's a bit of a procedure gonna, to do I'm it. Sorry, I'm gonna look in my mind palace. Hold on a moment. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, no worries. 
Okay, I'm gonna go send her the forum because it's really nice like meeting new people here. But I do know that settings are a little bit harder to go across, so I want to help as much as I can with the FAQ. Um, here do I, um, how do I emote? Is this normal? I want a phone, collect trash. I think it would be actually in the info. Uh, hold on, give me one moment, chat. I'm so sorry. I don't know if it, I don't know where it is. Let's see. Range, maybe? Oh, it says, okay, I see. It is, it is, hold on. Um, it is called cycle. Hold on, let me look up something. Uh, audio. The button is here. Push. Let's see. Hold on, let me look for it. Um, cycle. What button is it? I don't know. I can't figure out what. What's your name, Rena? I mean, what muscle it is. I mean. Let's see if I can find the controls. Oh! oh <laughs> I am so sorry. I am so sorry. <laughs> I'm oh, so sorry. Oh, God. Oh, 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 don't tell me. Oh, God. Wait. Oh, my God. Why are you... oh, that hurts so badly. Wait, why oh. are you on the ground? Weren't you uh, well healthy? Oh, God. I don't know why I'm on the ground. You punched me in the face. I'm sorry. I tried oh, to. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I was just chatting here. I'm sorry. Is this how you treat the, the health workers? No. <laughs> No, the last thing I wanted to do was hurt you. I just, I accidentally, you know, set back into reality for a moment. I did let you know how to uh, oh. shout. <laughs> and so I had to click uh, my mind palace back here. And oh, unfortunately, God. I forgot the uh, muscle for clicking back in here. I should have done it at a distance. Oh, God. I should have, I should have flexed the uh, alt tab instead. Can you imagine? Oh, taking someone to an isolated location and then uh, and assaulting them like this? Yeah, and with no one to be able to help them. I'm so <laughs> sorry. I thought you were fully healed. You know, you're a you're an EMT worker. Very frail. I have skin, a pa paper skin, and glass bones. <laughs> I I can I take your vehicle to the hospital where I may see you again. Oh, now she's gonna rob me. Okay, all right. No, she I'm bringing you back. Die. You're gonna go to the hospital oh. and you won't have your vehicle. So I will drive back God. to the hospital and I will give it back to you. And we can keep okay. doing oh, this interview if you'd like. What, it, well, you, free, you, won't, it, you were a freelancer. I won't forget this. No, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. What, what would it take for you to forgive me? Well, it's, uh, I don't know, maybe like, uh, 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 I, don't, I don't know, if, like maybe $30,000? I can give you 30000 I have 12000 actually. I can give you like 6000 It's not, that's not 30000 is it? Oh. I, ma'am, please, you have to understand, reporting doesn't pay as well either. We're both struggling women. How about we oh, uplift each other when I give you six, 5000 for uh, sil being silent about this? You should, you should uplift with my face, didn't you, with your fist? I, I am so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. But I did help you with some advice if you want to take the time in the hospital to adjust that. I, I, will I definitely will. Thank you. That is actually yeah, very yeah. much appreciated. $5,000 for your silence? Nope. 200 for medical pills? And your silence? I can't. Uh, it's all gone. No! Oh! <laughs> am. Oh, there's the vultures. I... I'll see you then! I'm going to buy her silence chat! Actually, no! I want to see how long she teleports. If you were to quantify how much time you have in this place, how much would you say it would be? I'm dead, but maybe 15 seconds. Okay, I'll see you soon. <laughs> Take whatever you can. No, I'm not gonna do that. Oh, I said that and, and twist the dog. Fuck. I'm so embarrassed. Take her left shoe. I'm not gonna take her shoes. That is not ladylike. Oh shit, I have to search for the keys. Shit. <laughs> Wait, you know what I could do? You wanna know what I could do, chat? I could call up a taxi! Hey, Abisma, how's your Thursday going today? I just killed a woman. How crazy would it be to call a taxi? 
career day. She's interviewing a murderer next. <laughs> Call the guy. I will. I will. I will. Oh, this new, this career day has gone down to the shit, man. My reputation is ruined. I hope she does not tell everyone about this. I try to buy her silence. <laughs> oh, shit. D guy, we have a bit of a situation. Oh, shit. D guy, we have a bit of a situation going on. Uh, uh, what do you need? Um, how much would I, you, you be willing to let me pay you for a trip up the mountains to drive you back to the hospital? Uh, sure. Uh, where do you need pickup from? Looking at my map right now. I am near uh, the big lakes on the top right. If you look on the map and then look up northern, there is a huge lake. It'll be on the top left, number 2031. I know I'm a bit far from the from the city side. It's fine. I can I can manage it. Yeah. Okay, How what number is it again? 2031. It'll be 2031. near the big puddle of water on the top right. All right. We can stop right. for gas. There's a gas station if you ever need it. Just make sure you get some gas for yourself. I could uh, pay for your gas when you arrive up here. I know this is a big ask and maybe a big bill. It, it's all right. I got it. Thank you, sir. All right, I'll be there as soon as I can get there. Thank you. I got to hang up now. <laughs> top left? Did I say top left or top right? I thought I said top right. Chat. I mean, sorry. News crew. I have let you down the integrity of this new station. It's been lost. I thought I was going really good. I have the police by my side and we even called up a driver. And now we had to call up this driver for help. He's going to ask me what's going on. I I had to tell him that I killed a woman. I killed a, I killed an EMT nurse, but she pulled a gun on me. No, I can't see that. I didn't see it. I didn't see anything. I... Uh, she was going to show me her field work with a deer. And I wanted to play Marco Polo. I tried to help her learn how to play Marco Polo together. And then I punched her. I punched her and she's down on the ground. How was I supposed to know she was on the brink of death? She drove so safely. I thought she took care of herself too. <laughs> this girl. I think you need to look for another host. No, I can't give up yet. I won't give up this new story, the, this career day. I just, uh, I might have a harder time uh, getting phone calls back if uh, word got around. That's why I really want to buy her silence. Nah, spread the news and pin it on an NPC. No, oh, I can't do that. I gotta keep up my integrity. Wait, I can call her actually. I can call her. I can call her for her apology. Don't worry, Miss Garcia. I'm contractually bounded to never reveal your secrets. Thank you. It's going never showing me the live. I'm so sorry. Maybe it's an adjustment with the settings. I killed a woman. I killed an EMT nurse. Ugh. Oh, she didn't pick up. She didn't pick up, Chad. Maybe if I, uh... Maybe if I stop putting myself to... Oh, it's off. Oh, everyone knew who I was. That's funny. The one punch kill. I can't touch you. Wait, hold on. This might not be her. I don't know who where her number is. Your integrity is based on what you tell them it is. You're right. There's no way I can fix. There's no way I can fabricate myself out of the story, though. Hold on. I need to call her back. Ma'am, please, please. I'm on my knees. Ma'am. I'll buy your silence. Ugh. All right. What if I call the taxi driver while he's getting up here? Ah! He hates me. She hates me. How did he come call? Hello? Who am I speaking with? Hello? Who am I speaking with? Uh, <coughs> <laughs> Sorry. I, I 
think I got the first number. <laughs> sorry, can you repeat that? Can you, can you repeat that last part? I, I, I'm sorry. I, I think I received a call from this number. I, you did. It's not the wrong number. Is this, um, Rena? Rena, that name sounds so f familiar. Oh. But I, I <laughs> I'm sorry. My memory's a little blurry. I just, I woke up here and I don't know. Oh, you, you don't know what, why you woke up in a hospital? No, the last, uh, the last, uh, like approximately the last, like, ten minutes are, are kind of foggy. I fucking love you, RP! Do you know what happened? Why I'm here? Um, I, I can answer your question, yes, but, uh, I'd rather do it in person. I was the last person you saw before you laid down in that hospital. I can tell you everything. Everything that I know. That'd be great. I just need to... Okay, I'll... I'll <laughs> well, I'm gonna walk out of the hospital soon, but I just need to adjust the voices in my head a bit so people can hear me better. Oh, no, actually, I was going to say that. I... I the last thing I told you... The second last thing I told you was about how okay. to adjust your speaking volume in a ring in a circle. You're free to call this number at any time. Oh, you don't have my number, but you're free to look at the call history and guess which one's my number anytime if you have any help... If you need any help with the uh, settings for it. I'd be glad to offer you that much, at least. All right, awesome. That's great. Thank you. Uh, let me just, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll see you later. Oh, I, I really want to play a uh, Marco Polo with you again soon. We played Marco Polo together? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was in the middle of a call, but uh, I need to go to the hospital. All right, hospital. But it's not for me. I'll put on my seatbelt. Actually, I don't think I'll put on my seatbelt today. It's yeah. okay. A lot has happened to me, D, since the last... Uh, what shall I call you? D-Guy, right? Yeah, H-D-Guy, Guy, whatever you want to call me. Mr. H. I don't need to know yeah. what the what initials mean. It's okay. A lot happened since the last time we talked. Yeah, what got you all the way up here, anyway? Well, I, it was just another career day interview with an EMT woman and, uh, you know, I didn't realize how fragile such a beautiful butterfly was. I mean, ignore that last part. She, the point is, we were driving up the road, she got a, a call from up here and, uh, we showed up here. No one, uh, they, they probably, uh, went back to the hospital via another surface. So we were both alone. I was asking her from some questions. She asked me if she if I wanted to see field work, her doing her job. And uh I wanted to play Marco Polo and see how far away I uh she can hear me shout Marco and her responding polo. Well, she didn't know how to adjust her uh speaking settings from whisper to talk to shout. And so I uh called upon the forums to uh ping her, so the kids may say. And because of that, I tabbed out of um, my mind palace of this world. And when I went to tab back in, well, my muscle of punching kind of flexed and uh, I hit her. Oh. And I thought, well, it was one punch. But the next thing I knew, she was lying on the floor. That's crazy. And uh... Everybody's having muscle spasms these days. Yeah, I think she was a new resident who, uh, you know, I have been here since day one. I should know better. But, uh, I punched her really hard. Yeah, it can be like that sometimes. The guilt is eating me alive. Know our own strength. Yeah. The guilt is eating me, though. Um, she's lying in the hospital and, uh, she got the case of amnesia. Uh oh. I, I tried to call her number again and she didn't even know her own name. Oh god. I'm I'm left with the guilt of telling her the truth or and, and upsetting her after such a horrible thing accident or uh letting her go by innocently. What do you think it's I should hard, do, D? It's hard it's a hard situation to uh figure out these kinds of things. What do you think I should do? 
Uh -huh. I don't know. I've never really known too well how to deal with people. If I'm always on the move. Uh, same time. I guess your best bet would be to either into the reality of what's happened to her and uh, who you are and what what happens. All right. Maybe, I'm... maybe uh, ease it on. Maybe don't give it to her all at once, so to speak. Okay. Thank you so much for this news. We're we're very close to the hospital, and I'm scared. Yeah, I'm I'm sure it'll be all right. You How much? Gotta, uh, yeah. You just gotta follow your heart. All that stuff. How much for this service today, sir? Uh, it's two hundred is fine. It's good to say a little bit longer, but it's not that much. <laughs> I understand. What is your favorite number again? I seem to have lost it. Fifteen. Uh, yeah. Let me make sure. Yeah, it's fifty. Cash. Give. Uh, 15. 210. Uh, 250. I give you a little, uh, tip there for your trouble. Alright, thank you. Thanks for riding with us. I hope everything works out in your end. Thank you for being safe and fast once again. Take care now. You're welcome. I don't know what to do. As, I take a st as I'm taking a step further into the hospital, I, uh, I'm getting faced with the reality even closer and closer. I don't know which ward she's in, but uh, if I were to assume, it's probably the one everyone goes to for the first visit. Avispia, we got a scoop! News reporter murders in cold blood and eccentric EMT. No, that's, I don't like that news at all. Where is she? I... I don't know. I, I need to resolve this really fast. I, uh... Can't... She's not here. Let me take a moment myself to lie down. That that makes you pay $200?! Well... That's okay, I understand. You know, I always wonder where the, uh... Hospital takes the $200 from, if not the workers. Uh, I think she would have loved to have that question uh, as well. To be fair, it's a very comfy bed. I might as well have gotten a hotel for that prize. I could have at least gotten breakfast service. B, are you aware of my situation that's happening? We can save ourselves. Yeah, at least I got healed up. Now you just have to fabricate medical records. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Garcia. We'll fix that headline right now. <laughs> yeah, I've been watching. I hope she's okay. Also, what's up with the arm jacket? It's, uh, it's always been, I've always been a bit of a, a, a muscler, muscly girl myself. Uh, is that her number? Oh. 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 Marco? M Marco? 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 Marco! I can hear her voice! <laughs> I'm just scared. Marco! 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 Marco? Marco? I'm gonna pee! Marco! It's you! I'm sorry, who... Do I know you? Um... Yes, you you did. Uh, sorry if my, uh, call from for you was very distressing. I know that, uh, coming out of amnesia from such a tragic incident might, uh, have you a little bit, uh, tilted, disturbed? How are you feeling? Tragic? I mean, it's for, for me, it's not so tragic since I don't know what happened. I just... I'm just a little confused, and I don't know why my face really hurts. Dude, I'm feeling like the plot of Silent Hill 2 right now. It's, uh, it's okay. I'll, I'll explain it on... Is there anywhere you want to eat? And anywhere you want to drink, really? I could, uh, I'll, I'll buy you something so I could, uh, lay down any, uh, information that isn't clear to you. Sure. Do you, is there somewhere we could get maybe some sort of, like, like venison or something? I just really... I have a strong association with deer, deer food. <laughs> 
<laughs> Wait, deer food is med whatever. I'll well, we could walk there. We can walk there. Let me just look at the map. We'll have to walk there. I I took a taxi to uh, go back to the hospital from the mountains. Oh, you were in the mountains? Okay. Well, ac more accurately, we were at the mountains. We were at the mountains. Were, were, we, were we some sort of mountaineers? Um, so, you don't remember anything at all? No, I don't. I don't remember it. my name, my age, anything. I just remember feeling really betrayed in my last moments. Well, <laughs> I'm... I'm uh... I'll I'll lay in any details. If you uh, have any money at the ATM, here's a good time if you want to buy yourself anything nice uh, after oh, we depart. You... Oh, I thought you were buying me some. Oh, I will. I will. It's just, you know, oh, there's, okay. I just noticed it just, you never know. <laughs> no, it's good. No, I just, I have, I have money on me. It seems, yeah. All right. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll give you the news slowly so that, uh, because uh, I don't know much about you myself, but we, we spent time together for some moments and uh how do i say this we were strangers so so let me introduce myself first um after i deposit some money i am a news reporter and uh for my for my indie newspaper yes yes uh and you know things were running a little bit tight a little bit slow days recently yesterday we had gig activities and i had like you know a lot of stories to report from that but today was dedicated to oh. career day, right? Okay. And that's exciting. And you were one of the people I got to interview. Oh, that's exciting. What did I do? Well, see, that's the thing. Uh, I was getting to know you some more. Oh. Oh. Oh, is that a bird? That's, that's, those are fishes. I, I, I know it's a little <laughs> bit hard to identify, but. <laughs> oh, my fingers are really scrambled. <laughs> <laughs> These are fishes. Do you like them? They they're so cute. I feel I feel kindred I, I, I empathize with them. Trapped inside this cage. <laughs> they know. Oh whoa. Do, do fish make that noise? Um No, but there is a person right next to us. They don't make that noises. Um I think the person next to us is hello. Oh. We could learn about are them together. A, are you a bird? <laughs> they're pointing at you i i'm a bird i oh 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 they have a question mark above their head all right above their head what are you seeing what oh you didn't see okay don't worry about it um we did well i'll be taking uh this lady now to uh get some food and drink if you if you want to follow behind us that's totally okay i'll just be talking to uh her the entire time yeah yeah oh, bird. Uh, your name is, uh, Rena, actually, by the way. Oh, my name's Rena, okay. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's probably what I should have told you first. That's alright. Was name I is... some sort of, was I some sort of, like, um, maybe like a, a stripper or something? I'm just confused by my outfit. No, no, actually, I, uh, that was one of the questions I wanted to ask you, uh, about your work uniform, but, you know, there were lots of questions I could have asked you, but I never got around to it because of what happened. Oh, okay. Um, mm -hmm. let me go look at my, let me go look at my map for, uh, groceries and medicine and stuff. Oh, all right. This is so fucking funny! I can't handle it! I'm trying to go with the, give me sympathy points, and like then- too many, it feels like there's too many windows in this device. Windows in this device? Oh, we could actually call a taxi, together! Oh, okay. I think, I do think that I can, seems that I, oh. If, if I work here, though, shouldn't- I mean, sorry, if I'm a... Did you, see, did you see what my job was? I forget. Oh, oh, oh. No, I was going to get around to it. You... Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, okay, okay, yeah. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, we can take a call taxi. Let's take a taxi. There's, ta there's one yeah. right there. Oh, there's one right there. Hello. Hold on. Oh, it's Grandpa. He looks a little bit occupied oh. right now. So, uh, I, there, I think... Hold on. Let me check if there's another taxi. If, you, if you're already busy with a customer, Grant... Wait. I'm you... not. I'm just looking for people to pick up. Oh. oh. We are people to pick up, actually. Hello, hello. Hi. I'm Rena. Where do you need to go? Um, somewhere to eat, drink, and get bandages. It's a bit of a multi-trip if needed. Okay. Are you able to get in? How do I do that? 
Oh, I am so sorry. I should have told you to back up. You press, uh, you flex your F muscles. Oh, for... okay. Yeah. Okay. Call a lawyer and get an alibi. Do you want to come with us, Birdie? I don't know where we're going. Yeah, do you want to come with us? Okay, they're coming with us. This is so awesome. All right, just take us somewhere to, uh... Do you want to get bandages first, to drink, or to eat? Up to you, uh, Vina. Um, I want to, I want to eat. Yeah, let's go get eat. Yeah, let's get eat. You All can right, come with us, I'll too. go to a supermarket. That sounds like a good idea. That's so cool. I think I... Someone RPG that car? How are you all today? Um... I, I will... Yeah, um, so... Rena, right? You... And I... The... We were meeting up. And we were... Getting an interview together. You were driving me. Because you were an EMT. EMT? Yeah. You had a pretty amazing... Respectable job. And I wanted to interview you because... Is this guy driving? Is he an EMT? No, this is a taxi, oh, a driver. taxi driver. Yes, thank you, Grandpa. Mr. Grandpa is his name. I refer to him as. Okay. Nice to meet you, Mr. Grandpa. All right. I could use a bite to eat, too. Yep, no worries. All right, so, Miss... Okay, so, Vina. Okay. Um, okay, first of all, what do you want? I'll, I'll, I'll buy you anything you want. Just look through our items with the, um, are you able to look through items? I, I think so, yeah. Can I have, um, just like, like a whiskey? Oh, a whiskey, all right. Sorry, Mr. Grandpa, if you're confused. She is being hit with, um, uh, amnesia right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, uh, uh are, you a, are you a bird? Well, let me, let me go get that slash. Oh, that one's a bird for sure. That one's for sure a bird. Item. Hold on. I don't know if she knows her digits. Item, target. So, I need to ask you something, Rena. If you check your phone on the top left, you will have a digital number assigned to your identification. Oh, okay. Yeah. What is those numbers? So I may Six give you this. 16? 16. Yeah, let me copy this. <laughs> it's a bit of a procedure to give you something. Hold on, give me one moment. No, Count it's fine. It's totally fine. one. Oh. Okay, whiskey is very good so choice. One. Bird. Type metadata. Three. Ever try these grilled cheeses? <laughs> Amazing. Whoa, that is so good. Did you make that? No, I bought it from. From, the, from them. All right, I seem to need a metadata for this drink. Place? Factory? Uh, maybe. I don't know if they're homemade or from a bag. Mm. They're delicious. <laughs> I think I may have dropped whiskey on the ground in a black bag. Do you see a black bag on the floor right now? I do. I see. Oh, I see. Yeah. Pick it up. That's for you. A nice little is this, whiskey. Is this the whiskey? Yep. It's just in my, I found this in my pocket. Oh, oh, that's sorry. that. That's I don't not whiskey. Think that's, whiskey. <laughs> that's a oh. weird looking camera. That's a camera? Oh. That's a camera? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a camera. That is not oh, a cram wait. camera. Don't, don't look at grandpa. Pictures? No, don't look at grandma. Don't How look do I, at grandpa. How do I take pictures? Don't look at grandpa. Grandpa, do you want your picture taken? No, yeah. no, no. That is not that's a picture right. camera. That is not a camera. He's lying to you. He's lying to me. Why would the camera lie? Why would he didn't mean to lie. Camera? He's suffering from dementia. It's not a camera? I've got cataracts. He's he suffering from something else. <laughs> a similar condition to yours, but not exactly. It's from old, old age. <laughs> oh, okay. You see, you you got your uh, amnesia from head trauma. The truth is, we were running together to the mountains because you got a report from the EMT reports. And, uh -huh. okay, you want to know the truth? Yeah. I punched you. <laughs> I hurt you. What? I'm sorry. It's been eating me trying to avoid the question, but I did it. I punched- I didn't mean to! <laughs> Grandpa! Not right now, I'm so sorry, but not right now! You- but you've been so nice to me! How could you- you would never punch me! No, that's what I- did. I- I just had a muscle spasm. I- I- my mind was shifting off. You were learning how to play Marco Polo with me. And I was telling you how to do it, and it required me to cl click away. And when I clicked back into this reality, oh. I- the next thing I knew, I punched oh. you. And no, you were, no... 
you were on the floor, okay? You didn't do to me. You wouldn't. I didn't need to. That you're no. Lying. I say that you were lying. I'm not lying. And if you want to hurt me, that's okay. I don't know whether you're registered as the EMT still after your death, but um, whether you choose to revive me right here, right now, or not, after feel do what you need to do with that gun, not a camera. That's a gun. That's a gun. Oh no! I won't let you live in this lie anymore. You can't hurt my my customers. That's that's against store policy. That. When did you own the store? I thought you were a taxi driver. <laughs> Why would I take you to this specific one unless what? I owned it? What? Stop! 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 Don't hurt him! Get away! I... 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 Oh wow, I can't even shoot. Oh, I'm, I'm so confused! Oh, there we go. <laughs> you like that doesn't mean you need to hurt anyone else. holy shit no. don't hurt anyone else please no your job no. was an emt you saved people That's, that you cared that. about people you cared about people so much you started questioning the system you were in you had to pay 50 dollars for every med kit you used then you started to wonder what was in the med kit and you know i came up with the question myself where did the 200 dollars every time you visit to the hospital go when our workers are so underpaid. What? I I didn't lie to you. I just didn't know when to tell you this. Can't take it anymore. No. Don't hurt punch yourself. Me again. No, I can't. I don't live in this reality. Just punch me again. But, but, but living in reality means you have to live with truths like this. That we all make mistakes, and you had to know mine. Okay. How can we have a real friendship? A real start to our new found camaraderie if I didn't tell you everything that just happened? I know it hurts, but I have to live with this. And I know it hurts you right now as an amnesia person, but I hope you can accept me for what I did and accept yourself for, um, I don't know what you need to accept yourself for. <laughs> I'm sure there's something in you that accepts yourself in this reality. This is Los Santos, and this is just what it's like here. And I think that was the uh, conclusion of my interview. Oh. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> you see? <laughs> the city of Los Santos doesn't stop for no one. <laughs> Not even us. <sighs> if you're willing to try, I'm willing to try again as well. Thank you. I I think I'll depart from this now. Is that is that a thing? Oh 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 look oh oh. Huh? Wait, let me try that again. Look 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 look. I'm looking. Hold on. Look look. I'm shaking hands. Look. Oh, I don't know how to conclude the shaking handness. I don't know, I just had to, I, I felt, I just thought about, I just thought real hard about emote handshake. Alright, I'll, I'll think about that too, and maybe we can finish it together. Alright, on three. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> oh. Well, I, I hope you can find yourself again. I, or reinvent yourself. I would take this as a time to really think about what you want. Thank you. There's a, there's a lot of things. You give me a lot to think about. I don't... It seems like my previous line of work wasn't probably what it was cut out to be. You know? Maybe what you thought was the truth. Seeking the truth or whatever it was you were doing wasn't quite right either. And you know what? I'm For that, I'm sorry. For making you face the reality. And... Making you switch career paths and a lot of emotional stress. I this is where I have to depart from you. It's all right. It's thank you for changing my life. We'll Bye. soon see if it's for better or worse. And that concludes the end of our interview with Miss Rena. Okay? Oh shit. I can't do the ride, Grandpa. Grandpa, are they okay? okay. <laughs> I'm gonna let them have their moment. 
Oh, I'm so glad this has ended well. I was worried for a while, but Miss Garcia pulled through. Yeah. Telling the truth does pay off, but, uh... I hope she'll, she'll be okay with her life now. I I don't know if we'll ever get back the uh, Rena we knew before, a moment before. But... Whoever she ends up becoming... I just hope that for her sake, she'll be proud of who she will become. You wrapped your shirt? It's called Fashion, sweetie. Read about it. Oh, that was quite a storyline. Oh. I hope she knows how to put on her seatbelts. She does, surely. He would tell her. All right. I'm going to go take... A sip of water and we're gonna go ahead and take a pee break everyone i need a pee you have no badly how badly i laughed at that and how much i needed a pee okay let me go use the restroom and tell me what you guys think of that storyline that's a shower break pee break brb okay i'm gonna go pee real quick all right we're gonna go take an ad break as well this is your 30 second warning we are having an advertisement break for our sponsors. If you are not that of the subscription, you will need to do that soon. I need to not stand at the side of the road. I need to tinkle real bad. So this is your warning. I'll see you guys soon. No ukulele needed. I guess I'll return this. <laughs> you know, if she ever uh, calls me out on this to another uh, broadcaster, I'm going to have to take out the ukulele. Grandma jump scare. It really was, Matt. Hello, Matt. How are you? I'm so sorry I couldn't respond to your comment. I was very immersed. I'm gonna go pee real quick. Wait, why didn't the ad run? Oh, I pressed snooze, that's why. I'm so silly. Okay. I'm gonna go pee right now. I can't wait for the ad to start. I'm sorry.
Note dog that just subscribed for 35 months. Is her bladder a whole bathtub? She's taking more than a second bath. All right, I'm back, ladies and gentlemen. All right. That was a crazy story, Miss Garcia. I do hope that you'll uh, censor the names involved. What? Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. Oh my god, this looks like my username is P Break IRL in the uh, BRV in the game. That's so funny. Um, Welcome, everyone. Welcome back to the story. If you guys just are just tuning in right now. A tragic incident occur and it was really funny. I need to get clips for that later for like a big compilation. I need to pay someone off. Um The Ballad of Pea Break. <laughs> Babe Barbali, hello, welcome. Have you heard about the GTA VTRP server? How, are you interested in joining in a season two once it comes out? Are you interested in joining uh getting your visa accepted? This has been a really fun experience, honestly. Uh, I gotta figure out what to do now. Um, I'm gonna drink water. We just went through a very, very interesting plot line. It was great. How are you doing? My goodness. Uh, let me know if there's any problems with audios and stuff. I've seen some of your goobers playing it. Yeah, it's really fun. You should totally join if you are interested. It is very exhausting if it's your first time RPing. Oh, he hello. Sir, are you interested in a street interview? Hello. Oh, a street interview. Uh, oh, fuck, hold on. Uh, uh, I've, I've never, I've never done an interview before, but, but if, if you, if you'd like. Ooh, I'd love, it. okay, so today's theme is career day. Would you happen to have a career in this uh, city? Um, I thought I did, but I'm not so sure anymore. I, I'm a barista, you see. Except, oh, <laughs> yeah? I'm not too sure. Wait, why are you not too sure? It doesn't. <laughs> I thought I had a job, and then I went there, to my job, and I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I was able to actually um, do anything. <laughs> uh, you see, it's my first time in the town. Mm, oh, I see. Oh, it's your first day here. Oh yeah, my first, my first day here ever. Oh, all right, all right. Um, may I ask you another question about? Uh, we can, we can start walking around. Uh, are you hungry, oh, thirsty, yeah. anything? Um, oh, uh, if you're hungry or thirsty, I have, like, 20 water bottles on me and, like, uh, some grilled chicken breast. Oh, no, I was just asking, just for your sake, oh. since you are new in town. I need to oh, make I sure I take care of all <laughs> my interviewees. Oh, you're so- you're- you're, you're too kind. You're too yes. kind. It's so nice to meet you, though. Um, yes, my yeah, name- I'm, I'm, I'm Mant Mai. Mant Mai, that is such an interesting name. I love that. The, the, what does it mean? The, the, what does it mean? Yeah. It was just, uh, you know, the name I was born with, but you can also call me Mr. Man, because my, my last name, you know, is, uh, Man My Man. <laughs> man, because, uh, uh-huh. You know, if, if it comes to gacha games and, and waifus, I'm your man. That is such an interesting name. That's a very manly name, actually, if I were to describe oh, it. Oh, oh, uh, the, 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 thank you so much. Oh, uh, <clears throat> Th 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 thank you. Um, th please, please stop by. <laughs> please stop by my my coffee shop sometime. The yeah, I was going to ask which coffee shop are you assigned to? Is it the Cat Cafe, assuming from your shirt, or is it the Bean uh, one? Um, I actually work at the Bean. Oh, the do bean you want to head off to the uh, Bean right? Actually, no, no, no. Let me ask you: Is this self-assigned, or did you go to City Hall for your barista registration? Registration. I, I went to City Hall, but oh, it's a little it's a little bit weird. But when I look, I, I don't really have any I don't really have any tasks for my job, if that makes sense. They don't give oh. me any tasks, and no one was there, so I don't even. I, I tried self assigning at the City Hall. I signed up. It said I got the job, but then it. I don't know if my application went through. You know what? The same thing happened to me. Something similar of that nature happened. Did that <gasps> woman just teleport it? No way. To me. Yes, I am a reporter by by license. But if you ask me, honestly, I've been the one that has to do the field work around here for interviews and such. But the the um, there's been no way to have a building of my own that I can enter a, a whole office or anything. So 
I gotta figure out my own way to have an apartment in the city and a vehicle too. Hello, oh, Eggy. I don't know where Me the sign you I'm saw. Actually, do you do you know how much the vehicles cost? Because I was gonna head down to the car dealership that's this way and try and see how much a car costs. A car right off the bat costs about like six thousand dollars for a SUV, the one I got. But they can go around Ooh. like the uh, six figure, honestly. Oh, oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, it's quite a lot. Uh, we could. Uh, I don't. I don't have the money. I mean, I just recently like spent kind of everything on the most recent update on my favorite gotcha game cat girl cuties 3000 um, oh but, okay you know, yeah, it's worth it though you know like worldly goods they, they can only k compare so much to my pixels yeah to, to your pixels. oh my god <laughs> oh my god they're downloading oh. it that's very good another player has bestowed upon your uh video game oh my gosh the aqb 33 I'm guessing. Also, oh, hello, Cal. I saw you make a face earlier. Is it like um? I wonder if this is like really high tech, you know? Looks super, looks super cool and cyberpunk. Yeah, oh that one. I have no idea how they were able to visually say that, but they just did. They just did. I mean, the tech's crazy. I think they kind of have like a hologram that, oh. comes, that pops out. Shows yeah. What, shows what they're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 uh, I, I don't mean to pry into any if this is an insecurity or free to stop me, but your vocal range is very extensive. Hologram technology V2345938. Oh, very cool. Very, very interesting. Did you mean my vocal? Oh. Yes, your vocal range, Mr. Man. Oh, my, my vocal range. Oh, uh, th thanks. I actually, <laughs> uh, I don't know if I'm good enough, but I, I feel like one day if, if I could be cool enough to be like a like a voice actor and then maybe maybe have a cameo in cafe cuties that would be uh, such a dream you know so i've been practicing my anime girl voice uh I would, I would really really like to just you know just be part of the game that is really really good you know i didn't want to assume anything but those socks kind of tell me everything now this fits my image this fits my mental image oh, that, <clears throat> that makes me real glad yeah, yeah. You, you, you've you've made you've made Matt my a happy man today. You know your oh, outfit. Snap. I I think once we figure out how to get you to be registered officially with your resume and everything. Ah! <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh. Uh, are, are, are you all right? Did I did La I do Vicia something wrong? Garcia, telenovelia. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I am right. You could just call me Miss Avicia. Sorry, protocol. No, that that's totally okay. No, a muscle error. <laughs> protocol, muscle error. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's oh, what's man, happening you know, around. I hate when that happens too. Yeah, my, yeah. Sometimes my hands start cramping. Yeah, yeah. No, although I probably should get some bandage for myself. Uh, we should sit down somewhere to talk properly. Oh yeah, I would. I would love to. I would love to actually. Um, I'll. I'll be. I'll be back briefly. I need to. My. You see my. My earbuds, my state-of-the-art earbuds, they actually have little voice lines in them that sound like my waifus, but uh, I, I, need to, I need to turn off the music that's playing in there. I'm sorry. I've been having it on for a while. Yeah, no worries. No worries. You're good. He even has cat right, stockings. He does. I love it. Excuse my absence. No, no. Uh, no, if you need to take the time. Oh, by the way, uh, you're new in town, but are you new to this uh, universe, I guess I should say? Have you been oh, around actually... this? Yeah. It's my first. It is my first day on the job. It is my first day in the world. It is like I. I feel like I th I'm 34, but I've kind of just been born. Oh, 34. Yeah, you kind of just born. Yeah. Well, I totally get it. This world is a bit hard on the uh, uh, brain. Really, it took up a lot of storage on mine. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, same for me. It took me like uh, traveling here, like on the plane. It took me like two hours before I could get off the plane. Like, wow. Yeah, yeah, same, same here, same here. Um, with that, I will show, tell you, theoretically, about some settings that I uh, would recommend you put on so that when you uh, tab out to look at windows outside of your car, um, mm -hmm. you'll still be able to hear me. Uh, you know, oh, have your renders rolled up. So you, if you uh, go to settings, mm -hmm. And then you think of the audio around you. Got you. You can press, uh, there, there's, um, think about the fact that you have mute 
audio on focus loss as a category, right? Oh, you're going to want to let me take a look. Yeah. So, am I still able to hear you while I'm checking out, you know, the little the little app settings in my phone? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. I'm I'm here now. So, you go to settings, you go on audio. I'll take all the advice you got. Uh-huh, audio. Okay, you're on audio? Mhm. Mm you sure see I got I turned off the radio earlier. That's good. Cuz uh yeah, I think I think, you know, just get a bit too itchy listening to copyrighted music. <laughs> Oh, absolutely. You know, I don't want to hear what's on the radio nowadays. I'd rather go to live concerts. But yeah, if... I know. Yeah. They but... don't have my niche anime music on there. Oh, my God. Oh, hold on. We can talk about that in just a moment. There's something called oh, mute please. audio on focus log. You're lost. You're going to want to disable <clears throat> that. Turn it off. Thank you so much. So now you have your windows rolled down whenever you go to look at other windows outside. This analog G isn't making any sense, but what does? Hi, Chia! Welcome! Okay, you can test it out. Let me know if that worked. Google search cat... I'm sorry. Google search cat cuties 3000 thing. <laughs> the oh All right, yeah, does it that... It goes something like... <laughs> Whoa. Hold on. Uh, Hi! Uh, I'll, I'll be right back. You can continue speaking, though. I'm gonna just check if yeah. the windows... Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it went... Nya, 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 nya. I'm not quite familiar with that melody. Yeah, that applies to you too, if you didn't know as well. Uh, I had a helpful local tell me about that, and it just changed my life. Six tunes, I agree! Oh, you're, you're the helpful local that helped me with that now. Oh, that is that is so helpful. Yeah. I was actually wondering about that, really. Yeah, no, I've been Whoa. trying to spread the news around, but it is in a bulletin board of FAQ. If you look in this Discordia bulletin board, mm -hmm. FAQ. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to spread the word around. Configura configuration. Nice. <laughs> you know, I'm... I'm not too a active on Discord anymore. I, I I used to be a Discord mod for uh, <laughs> the the Cafe Cuties server, but I, I think I was a little too active on the server or something. Like they just they didn't like the fact that I said that Nekorara was my waifu and no one else could actually claim her as the waifu. So oh my god, I don't know though. They just don't get it. Oh my god, I am so sorry. Hold on, would you say that Discord mod was your um career for a while? Your uh, employment? Uh, kind of just before becoming a barista, uh, yeah. I was, for for lack of a better term, let me let me let me think how to put this. Like, <laughs> oh my god, Discord mod the ladder is more so coming through. I know. Stay, stay at home and uh, <laughs> I was playing. I was playing all kind all kinds of games. You know, as if there's a wife winning, I like it. So uh, I was playing all kinds of those games. Uh, but it was right before Cafe Cuties released. And then when Cafe Cuties released, like, they kind of inspired me to get my life together. Because, like, they're these cute cat girls. And they just, like, work so hard. And they're idols. And they sing. And I was like, oh, my gosh. I, you know, I feel inspired to be a better man for them. Especially, you know, I, I met my wife. So I'm like, ah, I gotta be, I gotta be good for them. I gotta be good for them. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what inspired me to try becoming a barista, but it's like my job application didn't even go through, so I've got to figure this out, you know? Yeah, yeah, I know. The economy is really hard, but you actually came at a good time in the economy. Grilled cheese sandwiches used to be $75. You're kidding me. No, I am not kidding. I have been a day zero resident in here. This town was being built. I looked around, and there were $75. Oh, oh, holy cow. Now it's been down wow. to two thanks to Barrynomics, which, praise the lord. Oh my gosh, Barrynomics, thank goodness. Yeah, thank they got goodness. it figured out. Hold on, let me look in the map for a better setting for us to sit down in. <gasps> thank you so much for the painkillers. I appreciate this a lot. Painkillers? Yeah, now we have painkillers in the city. Before, we just had bandages. Okay, let me go look at the place. Oh, snap. Yeah, let me go look for a good place. Actually, no, I'll call someone. Uh, let's see where we can hang out with. Uh, I don't want to uh, force you to go back to your job to hang out in there, lounge around, because... Uh, actually, no! We can stay at the Bean Cafe together in case an employer came in and we could help you. Talk oh, to them yeah. about it. Yeah, so I'll That's call so a taxi. True. I'll call a taxi I guess, for us. I guess you could come to my workplace, though. My supposed workplace. Yeah, you're soon to be, you mean. <laughs> oh, yeah. I want to... Um, <laughs> I want to check out the... The cat cafe too at some point you know i i just i don't know i'm a little nervous 
a little nervous. They are a bit of competition, but there's nothing to be nervous about. They do have kittens. Cats, sorry, cats. <gasps> okay. I'm sold. Yeah. Well, they got cats, but, you know. All right. If, if they have cat girls, not, not not that it's like a requirement or anything. Oh, like, oh, if, cat, if cat girls. girls. Well, we'll, well, see well about I like that cats soon. too, you know. Yeah, we'll see that soon. I'll call a taxi right now. Hold on, just give me a moment. I, uh, you might not be able to hear the uh, taxi call, but I'll call a taxi. Sheesh. All right, I am on a incoming call. It's uh, dialing soon. I'm excited for you to, uh, you can check taxi services anytime if you go on mobile and you see services, it's a little suitcase button. Oh, it's services. I, I tried opening up the phone thing and I was like, thinking of a number to dial, but I was like, wait, I don't know what number the taxi service has. Oh no, that's totally understandable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It really helped me out. Um, as I said earlier, I'm doing a career day interview, so I've been using that feature a lot today. Oh snap, that's amazing. I'm sorry, I accidentally opened up my phone. Oh, my gorgeous wallpaper. <laughs> I, I got all my waifus on my wallpaper, yeah. All right, all right, all right. All right, let me just call a taxi. The one I just called uh, fell asleep. They're off duty now. I am unable to call them. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. It happens all the time, you know? They don't post their hours. You just kind of hope that one calls back. I'm not calling all that right, guy. All right, all right. Thanks for getting the taxi. I'm kind of broke right now, you know? Cause, oh, you know, of course, of course. Whaling. Hello, Mr. Hello. H? Yeah. All right, so I got another request. I will wa want you to drop us off at the Bean Cafe. Let me just tell you what number I'm on. All right, I'll, I'm a little far out, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Uh, oh, so how far out are you? It's okay. I can call another cab if you'd like. Oh, uh, no, it's fine. I'm already on my way back. I'm like, a, I'm just three miles out, but I drive fast. Uh, what number are you at? Uh, 9048, right next to a telephone line. 9040? 40? 48. Okay, 9048, alright. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. No problem. Okay, there we go. Okay, alright, the taxi man will be coming soon. His name is D Guy. I've been using his services a lot. The guy? D Guy? H D Guy. Oh, H D Guy. Oh, snap, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I've been using his services all day. I, I meet a lot of people just walking around, actually. Oh, yeah. Oh, look! There I seems mean, to be I've... suitcases on the floor for us. Thank you. Oh. Whoa. Well, what, oh. Do, what do these do? Oh, another resident has appeared! Welcome! Hello? Hello, hello! hello. Can we them. can hear you. <laughs> I'm trying to get these items. Hello, and what might your name be? Uh, hello? Oh. <laughs> They're looking away. That's okay. That's okay. I understand. I, I think I think that uh, she might be retreating into her mind palace. I don't know. No, that's okay. That's okay. I'll need to give her the helpful tip, too. Uh, I need them to... Uh, if they want, they can hop on the taxi with us. I just wanted to request that. Understandable. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, I don't know what to do with this bag on the ground. Can I pick You gotta it up? put it on your tab. Just go over it and put it on your tab. And you will see an item, and you need to drag it from one side of your mind palace box to another side. Yeah, you got it! Thank you, B33. I got it. <gasps> Hello. Hello! Hello, we can Ooh, hear you now. Me. Yes, yes, yes. Nice, nice to meet you. Hello! Um, I heard that you're a very famous reporter, and... Uh oh I just started, and... I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. Can I please <gasps> work under you? Oh my god, of course, of course. Actually, I, I have a set of interview questions I'd love to ask, but I kept getting so distracted. And, like, you know, typing and talking is very hard. So I'll let you ask the questions, and me will be typing up the answers. This could really help us. Oh, that's awesome! Yeah, yeah. I just want to give you one new feature so you could, uh... What do you call it when you have people, uh, new... What do you call it? A rollout? There's a thing called... It's really fancy. Whatever. Anyways, uh, so if you uh, think about escaping really quick, escape, and then you go to settings. I just told this lovely young man about this. It's career day, actually. So we're interviewing questions about jobs. 
And so if you do ah. escape settings, you'll think about audio. Think about like a car. When you tap, when you look out to another window, you don't hear anything in this uh, uh in your ears all of a sudden because the window is rolled up when you look away. So you okay. fix that with by going to settings, audio, and think about how mute audio on focus loss is enabled on. You're gonna want to turn that off. <laughs> okay, give me a Whoa. second to process that. Thumbs up. All right, I can say oh, no, it in the I most simplest of terms you need. Uh, escape settings. Uh, audio, look all the way down, second to last one option. New protege! Yeah, it is I a new apprentice! I think I apprentice. may have figured out your riddle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is it enabled off? Uh, I, I think it's off now. All right, so now... You have your new screw. Oh, our ride is right here, actually. If you guys would all like to hop onto the taxi, we're going to the Bean Cafe. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you too, P, if you want to hop on. Don't worry, I got to wait around. Uh, D, do you mind if I, like, stand on your car while you drive us? Uh, sure, oh. I can try and pull it off. How, how do I get in the car? You flex with your F. And don't forget to uh, put your seat, BB belt. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Right. Uh, <laughs> I'm still fine. Oh, no, I'll just no, walk no, there. No, no, no. I'll just get there. You'll have to catch me. Ha ha ha. I'll just follow you. I'll just follow you. Just take us to the Fiend Cafe. B, B, do not do that. That is ill-advised. Why are you running faster than me? Uh, All right. Over to the over to the coffee shop that I work at. Bean. I think saw the bean something. I'm sorry. First yeah, bean. A little rough. It has a big B in the map. No offense, B. I got it on the map now. It's glitching out of it for a second. Don't worry. Oh, yeah, there's a free seat now. Somebody. Oh, oh, it's so unfortunate. B left us. I, I, uh, I did like going to the roof, even though I uh, fell off. All right, I got it on the map. Yeah, I feel so bad. Anyways. Oh, no, it's fine. It was... What is your it name, was... uh, uh, reporter in training? Uh, my name is Lena. Uh. It's so nice to meet you. Hello, yeah, nice to meet you my all. name is... Yeah, this is my guy, HD guy, Mr. H. All right, we're all out. We'll be seeing him a lot, uh, you and me, Lena. All right. Okay, okay. Don't forget to unbuckle by pressing uh, your belt B again. And then going F first, or F last, I guess. Yep, there you go. All right, thank you for riding. Wow, See that's you. so awesome. I forgot to pay that guy. Oh, uh, it's okay. We'll see him again, though, right? Yeah, it'll be on my tab. <laughs> All right. Oh, I thought that was a person, but that's just local. Anyways, you guys, I have a lot juggling on my plate, but it's okay. I'm down for an adventure. Take a seat. Take a seat. Uh, actually, no, let's go here. Look more roomy. I wonder if you guys can sit down here uh, all at the same time. Oh, let me check. All right. So you look with your third eye with the alt um, muscle. Oh, yeah. And you hover your eye. Yep, yep. Lena's got it. And you too, Mr. Man. Oh, thank God. you. God. I'm uh, sorry for the unflattering. Oh, looks uh, like I'm stuck. I don't know. <laughs> oh! I, I really wanted to wear, like, some flattering shorts today, but I'm starting to think maybe they're a little too short under this shirt when I'm sitting. Well, it seems I'm, uh... Hold on, actually, I could get out. Oh, hold on. There you go. Yeah, I'll be sitting uh, right here, like this, right there. Uh, leaving you to some space for Jesus. Oh, oh yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Sure uh, we'll wait here. Okay, Lena. So what happened is I was interviewing this young, nice young man, but he told me that he applied for the Bean Cafe. But there's no employers at the moment, so we'll be waiting until one strolls by and ask how he can uh, get his resume accepted. Uh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. So today is career day, as I told you, Lena. 
I know you have your own news production now. Um, uh, you have your own news crew at home, so I understand if you have moments of silence to talk back to the news crew with your earpiece. Uh huh. Mm hmm. And uh, Mr. Man, I know you probably have some Discord kittens uh, at home that you have on your earpiece as well, so I understand. Oh, I, I wish, but there's actually no one. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, oh. Uh, I, I got, I got no kittens. I mean, I do like. There's, there's a lot of them, but not, not ones I can really talk to. They're just a. Uh... You know, do they kind of lurk? I'm talking to my my gotcha waifus in my head occasionally. <laughs> play out the conversations that we could be having, theoretically. So if I ever go quiet, that's why. All right, understandable. All right, um, Lena, I'll have you registered as a reporter real quick, but I am going to test you on your skills. I will send you. Uh, I will have my um, production team, production team D last name M deliver you the questions to ask this young man. All right, oh, understandable. I will. I will hear from D. M. Uh, I, I can't. I can't wait to see uh, what questions you got for me. <laughs> I'll, I'll try my best to answer. I don't. I don't speak to. I don't speak to women very much. <laughs> uh, or anyone for that matter. No, oh, it's okay. We're we're all I've learning. Gotten, I've gotten the message from uh, D. Yes, message message from D. Yeah, uh, feel free to put it in an external uh, browser so you can view these better than a D from Miss D. She's a little sloppy on the format there, I know, I know. Um, I put it on an Excel sheet personally. I think the organization's a little nicer. But yeah. these are for you to verbally ask and I'll type out the answer. Feel free to improv any questions. Of course, you don't have to stick by this guideline. He has a very unique life situation. Everyone does. So feel free to branch out, ask for more elaborate questions. Nothing's by the book over here. It's a live interview. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, oh. it's nice to meet you. What is your name? Uh, hello, right. hello. The, name, the name's Matt Mai. Last name Man. You can call me Mr. Man for short. M Mr. Man? Or Finally, Mr. I can Ran? concentrate on my sheets. Mr. Man. Oh, Mr. Man. What yeah, a, my what name's a... Mant Mai. That is M-A-N-T-M-A-I so, so Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, They're uh, giving yeah, out the compliment. I was, I was trying to, you know, go, go, go for <laughs> something that would be uh, r really, really co cool. And I'm gonna do something ham cool. Ham sounding. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can tell by your outfit. You know, the ladies love you. Oh, yeah, I mean, I'd say it's something like that. Uh, alright, alright. Moving on to the next question. So, what is your job? Uh, well, uh, my day job is supposedly working at, working right here. Being a barista. A barista How do I freeze bean cells? Bean coffee. But I think, um, I know how to freeze, there it is, I found it, I found it. My work situation's a little bit in the air. Uh, I've learned how to freeze cells. Kind of tough. I think, I think I... I, I wasn't really, you know, I, I was not really. Also, hello, Lee. Nice to see you. I'm sorry. I'm really into this RP. Just like playing full lots on. Of different, lots of different games, you know. I, I live for I live for my my cutie waifus, but uh, my life changed when Cafe Cutie 3000 released on on mobile. Uh, I, I picked it up. I, I saw the app icon. It's really cute cat girl, and I my life has been different ever since. You know, like I, I don't know. They're just so perfect. I feel like I, I gotta gotta be a better man for them i i see so uh, what do you mean by supposedly working at this place <laughs> I, I submit my application it's guessy, i must say this I is genius this is why you're the greatest journalist when thank I you go and i check my uh when i go and i like check my phone and finally out of bishop hellos after work it, we're having an really interview tell me that i'm actually employed so um yeah, so uh, Lena, I, I'll show you the uh, city hall where you can get your official license and submit your resumes for places. You'll see really quick what he means by you usually um, that you don't get any um, updates or informed of what to do next after you apply. It's going to happen to reporter. It's, it's a bit of an interesting field you just applied in. But, you know, I'll be willing to show you, Lena, around the ropes because I know everyone is quite lost, just as we all are. Oh, well, thank you so much. Well, it sounds so nice. like City Hall's got a problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a little bit. But, you know, maybe uh, next season when we come in, everything will be a little bit more cleaner. Well, it's all a learning progress. Oh, yeah, uh -huh, it's, it's no problem at sure. all. I'll see, because, well, uh, you know, 
uh, honestly, it's my my first day. You know, I just got off the plane and everything, so uh, I feel like it could be on my <laughs> to being so clueless. I I really just spent. No, all it's my okay. Time I I love helping newcomers, and Lena's new too. So we're all learning in here together. Yeah. No way. I think I we saw you on the plane that I got off of because I literally just got here. Oh wow! Yeah. <laughs> when you were flying overhead, you could see us. See us there. Nobody. <laughs> Wait, really? That's really interesting. Uh, where did you both land at in the uh, map? Well, uh, you know, I've been sitting in the city hall first thing. I had to get some paperwork done. Mm -hmm. And you? Me as well, actually. That's where I tried registering for my job. Oh, oh so you both uh, uh, for gamer terms, so I can, you know, better relate to the audience at home. You spawned? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. First time ever. Yeah. Mr. Mr. Man. Those are the worst guns. I'm sorry. Oh my god. So because you do not have your job on paper, does that mean that you are not receiving any paychecks? Yeah, I'm not getting formally paid. Um, but I also wonder if maybe I just have to wait for some customers to make coffee for. It just doesn't, you know, my 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 boss doesn't have any tasks lined up for me. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to have any actually. I'm trying to figure out how to have like oh, a... that is so unfortunate to hear. What do you think the wish? Uh, what do you wish the city can provide for you in a situation like this? Oh, honestly, I, I just need a little bit of unemployment benefits, like. Well, some, actually, some yeah. Money, so the benefit. Out the ground. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, the the city oh, does no. provide like ten dollars uh for unemployed people. See, I think I think I've still been receiving that even though i applied to be a barista so damn i don't I'm know so i think sorry. i'll go i'll go troubleshoot that sometime yeah I... I muster up the courage to walk outside again yeah yeah no worries well uh did you ever think that you would be in the situation that you're in right now and would you switch your careers if you don't get this figured out uh, honestly i i considered for a moment working for the cat cafe because i thought that you know Maybe, just maybe it'd be- uh, Or just become a farmer? There are some roles you can be. Cool you could be uh, baristas, police, that, EMT. I, I think I'd really like, because, you know, in Cat Girl Cuties 3000, they worked at a cat cafe, so... But I, in the end, I chickened out. I figured being a barista first, and then maybe moving my way up would, would work better for me. All right, all right. That's understandable. I hope Wait. you can get your job, though. Wait, so, but, like, but if you're unable oh, to so get sorry. the job I was at... Nervous. Could you repeat yourself real quick? Oh, oh, I was just saying, I hope you can get your job at the Cat Cafe. Oh, thank you so much. Actually, yeah. I think I am employed. I just I just got my paycheck. My first one, maybe. Holy well, lord! How much did you During get? this very interview, I got a notification. Whoa! I got my first paycheck for being a barista. Whoa! Holy cow. I'm so excited. Does that That's mean you can strange. interact with the? Uh... Oh my gosh! It's all—it's all thanks to you guys, really. Yeah, it's yeah. All thanks to you guys. Thank you. Oh, yeah. You know how it is, reporters. So we much. gotta, we gotta get the news out to the people so change can happen. Yeah! Congrat you congratulations! Uh, th thanks for all the the work that you do. You know. Wait. Just... Yeah, of course, of course. But are you able to uh, interact with the uh, coffee shop items right over there? I, I am actually. I just, We're okay. I, yeah, I just did not have to meet him. Yeah, maybe you can wait, get up right now. Wait, let's take a photo. Oh, yeah. yeah well, I, I was about to say, you know, you guys have been so kind to me. Um, if you'd like, you know, the lattes are on me. If you want. Yeah, yeah, go try it drinks, out right it, now. It, of course. It'll be on me. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I'm so thirsty. <laughs> oh yeah, I actually, you know, my butt's actually a little bit glued to the chair. Do you know how to oh. unstick that? So um, X, you gotta get excited real quick, and then uh, you gotta get excited real quick. Yep. <laughs> yep, and, and and then we hit the uh, okay, okay. We gotta think about killing him with hammers. <laughs> this is great. All right, so let's see if you can work your barista skills for us. I'm I'm too grateful for you guys. Uh, I'll, I'll I can read off the menu if you guys would like. You can see. Uh, I see. will take a, a mocha a coffee or mocha latte if you have one. Okay, I'll, I'll take a quick look. Let me let me get right back to you guys. And then he's gonna learn how to. I've got to report to my news crew real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah, no worries. This is so fun. I love this game. Right. Let's see. 
you guys can hear me all right? Yep, we can hear you all right. I had to, I had to just fix up, you know, clear my throat real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the Extend vo your volume. Cords, you know, sometimes. Uh, let's see what we can make for you guys, though. And then, all right. So it looks like there is a drink called High Noon, and it's got a hint. It's coffee, but with a hint of an orange flavor. There's a Speedball, which is just a black coffee with sugar. There's a Gunkachino, which has cheesecake and coffee and sugar. Um, we got the the Brat, which is a lot of sugar and coffee. Um, the Flusher has got coffee, chicken breast, a bottle of water, and oranges. Uh, I just said how a chicken uh, has got coffee and milk and <laughs> some some water. Uh, and a Cafe Agra has got. Rhino horns and oyster shell in your coffee. So uh, what are we thinking? These are very exotic recipes, I'll be honest. Uh, I think I'll take the one with chicken you said it had. Oh, yeah, the what, flusher. That's what got the coffee fuck beans, are in these breasts, coffee? My last barista didn't tell me anything about this. Oh, my I God. I'm that for you real soon. Uh, and uh, Miss Miss Kamalo, once you, once you have... An idea of what you'd like. B thirty three two. This is funny uh, as you, fuck. You guys can let me know what kind of coffee you'd like. I wonder if you guys are able to view a menu anywhere. Uh, you use your little eye muscles. Your little alt eye muscles. Oh, view. I can't view my muscle. Um, the menu with the eye muscles. You kind of just have to verbally ask us. Oh, okay, that's not a problem. That's yeah, that's problem. exclusive I, to Parisis, of course. I will handle it. This is well, so funny. I will just have whatever you recommend. I trust your choice. All right, Miss Garcia, oh like some mocha latte noted. <laughs> I like mocha lattes because oh, I love chocolate. I think you were made You're to be ugly. A you are barista. disgusting. I'm going to kill you. Oh, wow. Give me $200. Thank you so much. Let, me, uh, let me see. What have we got here? Wait, what does the eye muscle do? Huh? I'm actually a little bit hungry in person. I, that's probably my cue to call in. So I think today's uh, oh, line of... You know, our, 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 the music in the cafe is actually kind of broken, but... Is there any kind of music that you guys like? Uh, well, you choose, Lena. First day in the city, I want you to feel at home. Wherever you flew oh, in from. Oh, um, you know what? I'm a big fan of... Actually, never buy it. Go on. No, no, you can share. We're, we we have a no shame policy. You know, like, uh, you know this artist, Rick Astley? Oh my gosh, I love that artist too. Rick Astley! Yeah, you know, like, kind of underground. I know that a lot of people know them, so. Oh noted, noted, this is why he I'm is a favorite kind of intern group. I can't believe you know who Rick Ashley is. Oh my goodness. This ladies oh, is the person God. that usually brings my coffee. coffee. Confirm. Oh, you're my little you're intern. You're never gonna believe it. I'm never gonna give you up. Yes, yes. No way. That's awesome. I, I love this music. You know, usually, usually I go for, uh... I go for... Oh, I'm making your coffee right now. Don't mind me. But was B playing? Well, usually, usually I go for you know a anime OSTs or. Yeah, I like love your OSTs, vocal cords but... right now. That sounded exactly like Rick Astley. That was beautiful. Honestly, are you a musician? Such These beautiful tones. Going off. Let's see. Uh, I I think I've got. I think I've got. Stuff. Okay. Hold on. Um, let me see something. How might I? How might I give you guys your coffees? Um, there's this one I way I never figured out how to do. So you just walk to our side over here. It'll have to be one at a time so we don't get confused. Uh, you, uh, tab. Is it just, uh, I drop it? Ta a tab and then put it oh, to yeah. the other side. Yep. Of the boxes. That's how I've been doing it. I haven't figured out the other way. Just do it one at a time so no one grabs the wrong drink and we'll have to do this again. A literal uh, voice box. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I don't. Uh, I think it. I don't know if I'm frozen. Oh, wait. Here, here. Let me try again. Let me try again. Okay. Ex excuse me for getting a bit in your face. Let me. Let me see if this works. Oh, that's okay. Take your time. Um, it's a learning lesson for all of us. Okay. It's I'm so going funny. to go ahead and drop that. 
Does anyone see the flusher? That one's for you, Miss Avicia. Thank you. I'll go get it right now. Hold on. There you go. There you go. Oh, oh. oh I see. I see. Alrighty. Oh, the flusher. I hope this fills me up. All right. Got and, it. Uh, there we go. Nice. Miss Kumalo, I've got your coffee as well. Uh, I think I think maybe you would enjoy a I keep thinking they're saying Kamala. So I'm going to go ahead and drop one of those for you. Right here. Oh, that filled me up Whenever good. Whenever you're ready, Miss Kamala, you can go ahead and pick that up oh, from okay. the ground. If you this just stand like a on movie. top of it and use your tab muscles. Uh, B33. I'm so sorry if you placed an order earlier, but would you like a coffee? It's on me. Feel free to type it into your feel free to type it into your uh your hologram. Yeah, we we've got a lot of different options. Uh I, I'm still working on memorizing the menu because I'm new, but there's ones with oranges, there's ones with chicken breasts, there's ones with sugar, or ones with milk. And I, I can make a selection. Point star drink. Point star drink. Oh my. Oh, sorry, sorry. I didn't okay. mean to read it, Ellen. You'd like the same thing as Miss Avicia. Okay. No problem. B thirty three. B thirty three. How do you point? I've been accidentally pointing at people, and it's so rude. So what must I avoid? Muscle pressing to get that. B protocol. Let me make that. Let me. Make and that so point. it is. Thank you. Thank you. B protocol. Oh. B as in boy, <laughs> if you were so to press V. Really quenched my thirst. Oh, I'm, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, you it, I will give you a five-star Yelp review. <gasps> hey, thank you. That would mean so uh, much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'll, I'll mention, you know, definitely ask for man as your server. A hundred percent. Oh my gosh, yeah. I'll, I'll, try, I'll try my best to be the best barista ever, you know. I gotta, gotta make a lot of those those tips. Those tips mean gotcha rolls. Wait, how do I, uh, <laughs> give you the tips? Oh, oh, oh. You, you don't, you don't have to do anything, but... No, 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 uh, it's okay, it's okay. So, if you, if okay. If you actually want to give me a donation or tips or money of any sort, I think the only way I know how to do it is just how I gave you the coffee. No, but there's another uh, way, there's another way, there's ahead. another way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me tell oh, you another way another to give way. money, to give money. So... <gasps> oh. And this is a very important lesson because okay, so you all get close together, huddle around me, huddle around me, children. Huddle around, huddle around, huddle yep, around. Yep, you are my little baby ducks. Okay, um, you two, you can be involved in too. Okay, take out your phones. Oh, actually, I don't even, I don't have a cellular device. Oh dear lord, yeah, we're gonna I need to get you. I, I, I think somebody said I need to pray to God. For a phone? There's a new way to get oh, a phone no. now. We can buy them now. Is that how you did it, uh, Mr. Man? Yeah, yeah. Uh, a phone is only $100. You can... There's actually a place to get one kind of close to here. You can get oh, that's one awesome. soon. We can, walk that, we can walk on over and get you Yeah, phone. you want to walk together? Yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah, let's go walk together. Pray, pray to God to wish for a phone. No, no, yeah, no. Yeah. God has been done many good things, but um, I believe the good things are coming to an end now. God won't answer for our prayers as much. You know, they are a very busy person. Come with us, Mr. Man. You're leading us through. This is so fun. I could play this game forever. This is like playing dolls. I am so happy. We keep screaming. Yeah, we keep screaming, but do God doesn't answer as much. It's okay. They had a very busy, busy day last night. There was a oh. gang oh, yeah. activity happening, and it took up a lot of their time, you know, answering prayers for oh. everyone. Oh, I, see, I, I, see. I understand, you know. Yeah. God has to get their uh, beauty sleep, too. Exactly. All right, lead us on, Mr. Man. We don't get a map when we walk, so you're just going to have to look out and then look back in. But it's okay. It's, you know, you'll figure it out. Left arm status, two gunshot wounds, minus 47%. <laughs> They're too funny. I love you, B. You're good, Mr. Man? Hello, I'm right here. I'm trying to check the map to see where the closest one was. I think it's quite a distance, actually. Hold on, let me look. Is it this thing? Is it the calculator icon? Uh, yes, it is the digital... Called digital... Den. Den, I think? Yes. Yes. 
Um, it is quite a long walk, walk, but I think we can do it. It's just down the street of Vespucci Boulevard. So if we turn left and then kept uh, go straight, we'll be good. All right. I think, or I think if I'm looking at this map oh. right. I didn't realize how long of a walk it was because I, I walked from there to <laughs> work. That's okay. We can walk there. We, I think we can still walk there and talk, you know? Oh, yeah, but uh, it's so inconsiderate of me. You guys are wearing heels. This is true. This is true. It's okay. It's okay. I've already got blisters, so. <laughs> oh, no. And no, it's you guys okay, get hungry, you know? uh, If you guys get hungry or thirsty, I have food and water on me at all times. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta teach all you youngins how to give each other money. And that is very important in this economy. Thank you for being our guide. Yeah, and be and having a phone is going to be the most helpful thing, Lena, especially as we're doing these career day interviews. Oh, I see. I understand. Yeah. Um, once you get your phone, you'll be able to see that we actually have services uh, that you can call up on. I've been calling mechanic, the police, the EMT. B, I actually see that you're registered as a mechanic yourself. Uh, that I don't know how far you are into your education, but uh, how may I say it? I've actually had met one mechanic in here. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. B is taking the time to see themselves. Mechanic skill 0%. I understand. I understand. Uh, there is one mechanic in this town I've met before. I think they're called Jebediah. I think we walk this way. Oh, uh, let me look at my map. Let me look at the map again. We're walking the completely wrong block. It is the other side of the block we walked on. Hold on. Sorry, sorry. Oh, no worries. I think I think I kind of remember. Maybe let's run together. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. I kind of just bolted in here because, uh... <laughs> We're all learning. We're all learning. See? I'm gonna need to teach you guys how to play Marco Polo with proximity and cycling through it soon, too. That would be so fun. Yeah, we could all learn together. I've been thinking about reporting on tutorials for these kind of thing. I know there's a lot of people that'll be like you, you know, flying in in the middle of the week. And, you know, just as clueless, lost, needing a lot of tips. I know there's a bunch of forums you guys need to look in for sure. But, you know, you guys are here. I'm here. And, you know, I might not be, uh, I might need to sleep soon. But I would need to let you guys, I want to let you guys in. And as, as a, in with as much fun as I have been having. Oh, I'm not speaking very loudly. Yeah. That's so nice. That's yes. so nice of you. That's yes. why I look up to you as the number one reporter. Ah, oh, you flatter me. You flatter me. Let's just walk in this street. Uh, the civilians, the locals here actually kind of drive crazy. Well, just straight ditching them. Yeah, you know, I gotta leave soon. It is 3 p.m. Uh, let me, let me see. I'll, I'll check the map really quickly, but I think this is the right direction. Name B. B, your, holo your holographic message is quite scary. Hold on, they're checking something real quick. Okay. Oh, go, yeah, let's just wait for Mr. Man. If anyone needs to check your phone or check the map to see if we're going the right way, just let us know and we'll oh, yeah. all stop for you. I think we're I think we're all good. I don't know. Yeah. So, so Lena, um, where did you come in? What is your story? Why did you want to be a reporter? I am so interested in knowing who my peer is. I say that and then we left B behind. <laughs> there you go, there yeah, you go. Yeah, I mean, uh, well, you see, I was often... I don't know, I got bullied a lot as a kid because I was a nerd. So I wanted to be a reporter because I wanted to stand up for people who need their voices to be heard. Oh, I quite admire that, Lena. Simple, straight to the point. Now, I gotta ask that something. Is so inspirational. Yeah, sorry if this is a little bit personal too. Is your hair dyed or were you born with it? Um. It was dyed. <laughs> That's okay. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline. <laughs> You know, it was like, it was like kind of orangish anyways, so I just dyed it some more. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I dyed my hair jet black, actually, but you won't be able to tell. Oh, what was your hair color before? Black. Oh, it, it looks so natural after you dyed your black hair black. Yeah, yeah, but now it's more of a, a deeper shade of black. It shows up better on the television and uh, it just looks nicer. Oh, I understand. I understand. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Alice underscore the oh, hold on. How did you get into reporting? Oh, thank months. you, Alice, for the hearts! 
Uh, hair RGB 0612. <laughs> You're so funny, B. I just love your commentary on the side. How I got into reporting? Well, when I came into the city, I didn't know who I wanted to be. Or, and, um, my backstory, well... So, oh, hold on, they're stopping right there. Uh, my backstory, well, I, um, I actually got a little bit blacklisted from other, uh, news companies. Uh, blacklisted how? What happened? Well, I came from a suburban town, uh, pretty big population, but still quiet, and, uh, I reported on a story that no one really liked, and, uh, got me in lots of- Oh! Oh no! I'm oh sorry. My God! Uh, uh, sorry, muscle spasm. Oh. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Are, are, are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm, I'm okay. okay. I just I was I was just really surprised. <laughs> oh no. Um Pioneer's so a really good name. I just, oh, I just don't know how quite how to how to act sometimes. Do I need my hair dye still my ordered? It's okay. No, it's okay, it's okay. Talking You're so strong. Anyone. You're so strong. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I didn't- I didn't know that you- you- you, you had arm strength like that. <laughs> I, I mean, you know, I think Rhythm Games would surprise you. I didn't know oh, Rhythm see, Games I made see. your right arm really buff. I, I think it makes both arms pretty- pretty buff, actually, you know. <laughs> Particularly your thumbs, so... <laughs> that was your thumb muscle right there on, at work. I mean, you know, if you wanna- if you wanna even it out and give me a punch back, I'd be okay with that. No, it's okay. I, I understand. Muscle spasms, you can't really control it. You're yeah, all good. It's just, I mean, you uh, they're die, learning. So we're, we're even. And also, no, I don't need any more hair dyes. Or maybe we do. Maybe we do. Get some in order, actually. I know I'm wearing shorts, but... It in your Never gonna run yeah, around yeah. and the, desert the you. I love that beer. that much storage room, but there's a lot. There's a lot of room. They're talking together. This yeah, is adorable. We don't need to be in uh, all no, conversations, no, no, no. and you know, cooked. this might be so the start of a uh, friendship right the here. breast is grilled, so it's cooked all the way through. No fear of salmonella. Uh, the the water um is just bottled water, so uh, yeah, everything everything sanitary is just sitting in my pockets is all. Oh, okay, okay. Would you consider yourself someone who sweats a lot? Yes, ma'am. On it. Thank uh, you, I ladies. Mean, I appreciate that a lot. I don't, I don't know. Do, do you think do you think people can be conscious of how much they they sweat? <laughs> Wait, well, I, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I just, you know, I'm just. I want to see how far B you know, gets. I didn't mean to, uh, yeah, it is your job. <laughs> that was I so think, funny. I, I, I don't think I sweat too much if you're concerned about the the chicken. This is so adorable watching them talk. I may ask for you for some chicken later. <laughs> how long are we gonna walk our know, course? Yeah, yeah. Fourteen percent down. It's just. So much protein. Yeah, I saw a bit of your parkour skills there, B. So wonderful. Oh, oh, are you attempting parkour? You know, we should all attempt parkour. Make this trip a little fun for all of us. Would you guys want to race there? Racing there sounds fun. I might be a little Ooh. bit faster. Oh, whoa. How did you do that? I saw you skirt there. All right, it is just a straight path and it'll be a red building. Let's race. Go! Oh my gosh, I'm already losing the race. <laughs> this is so funny. I love these guys. New residents might be a lot slower. You gotta build up your lungs. Can you hear me okay? Say polo if yes. Oh fuck, I can't hear if they talk. Okay, B can hear me. What's wrong? A little bit worn out? Yeah, a little bit. I can't breathe. <laughs> I didn't know I'd have to run this much on my first day. I know. Oh, whoop, I ran into a tree. Yep, this is what it's like. Sometimes you get people you want to interview, but they don't want to talk. You just got to pursue them a little bit. Some of them like the chase. I really got to go to the gym more often. <laughs> it's okay. That's why we're doing uh, foot interviews, you know? <laughs> it seems we lost our uh, gotcha gamer player. The kids need to go out these days more. Oh, we made it. We made it. Here, guys. 
Oh, is it here? We made it. You buy a phone back here. Oh, okay. You gotta show us. Uh, so so come here and use your your alt eye muscle, uh, and look at this guy, and then you can browse the store. Oh. Wait, B, may I inquire you how you got shot? I didn't think you were serious. I thought it was a funny joke. You're you're a really good joke, sir, by the way. I love your bits. And the bit just kidding, I'm not saying that. Do you think it would be beneficial for me to get a radio? Uh actually, yeah, but if you don't have any money, I could uh, spot you for it. What can I do with the radio? If you could tune into the same frequency, it's kind of like a phone, but more discreet. If you, you're, uh, if you want to get off the grid and make private phone calls. Oh, I oh see, yeah, I you were shot in the convenience store. Actually, we should probably get you to the hospital. Actually, no, we don't need to get you to the hospital. We just need, um, to give you one single bandage, which I do own, but don't know how to separate. All right, I'm gonna give you all of my bandages, B. Put that on your tab and um, just after you use enough for you to feel better, give it back to me, please. If you used up all of them, that's okay too. This number above give protocol. Uh, that's, hold on. Did my, okay, there it is. Well, I already popped out an egg of it, so just go ahead. It's, it's okay, I'll, I'll learn, I'll learn soon enough. Let me know when you're done. This has been so fun! I got Hello. both of it. Hello! I got both of them. You got both of them? Alright. Yeah. So, finish.mp3. Or need hydration? You know, I might I might need some of that uh, chicken pocket. I mean, pocket chicken right about <laughs> now. <laughs> yeah, I, I got your pocket chicken here. Uh, let me drop some for you. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you. How y'all doing? This has been really fun. I've been having a really good time chilling with you guys. Uh, all right, so as new citizens, you will need to know about some certain things uh, about how to exchange contact info. This has been a really good conversation. Left arm status op optimal. Okay, got you. If you need any more bandages, just let me know. Bros have literal hot pockets. I know it's so silly. It's so nice of you, Mr. Man, to uh, uh carry around hot pockets. Oh, they're they're not quite hot pockets, but they're um, it's just grilled chicken. Oh, and oh, sorry, I meant that your it, your pockets are literally hot. Oh, oh yeah, they're they're a little bit warm. Yeah. But uh, don't don't worry though. The water doesn't get that warm, so it's not like gross bottled water. It's uh, I, I think it's kind of room room temperature. Do you have like a an ice cooler as a right pocket and uh, what do you call it? A warming storage in the left pocket for your chicken. That could be really useful, actually. I'll I'll consider that for the next time I wear shorts. I I might try modifying them. Yeah, like, yeah. Do you, are you in need of any pocket chicken or pocket water? Oh, uh, I got plenty of pocket grilled cheese on me. Oh, nice. The pocket chicken was delicious. Did you make it yourself? Uh, it's, just from, it's just from Hello, the, Freddy. Wants cooking recipe? Thank oh. you. I can't, take, I can't take sole credit, but... Uh, Did you actually give yeah, me a recipe? This is pretty know funny. Know, you know. Sorry if I'm surrounded by people for that sure, are very loud. Sure. Oh, God. I gotta tell them about volume control. All right. So let me tell you youngins how to exchange contact information. Uh oh, it's irritated. Condition error. She's so good. Uh, Dodd. I I um. So um, I think if you're bleeding out, we'll just need to take you to a hospital, and then once you faint to the ground. Hold on, let's see where the hospital is. Is B all right? Um, is the battery dying? I'm not too sure how to heal. Uh, without her lying down on the ground. Um. If you're bleeding out and you're grounded, you will have to call an EMT and they will come very, very soon. We might need to call one and let you bleed out. Is your heart, is your heart, uh, circle, pie thing getting lower? Oh, 
not too sure how to help. Yes, it's quite good. Condition stable. That's all good. Right. That's good. All right, all right. Sorry about your arm. Anyways, uh, you youngins, you think about the muscle F1. And you will get a pie. This is a very important pie. Sometimes you get three pieces of pie. Sometimes you get four pieces of pie. Uh, labeled citizens in general. When you're in a vehicle, oh. you'll get the vehicle slice. I see. Okay. And in the slice of pie, you got you press citizen. And you'll see something called give contact in details. That will ex let you exchange phone numbers. So, you see something propped up on your phone? Yeah, yeah I, I got it. it. So, uh, you will press your mobile phone. And sometimes you need to pr go back to the home screen and then look again on the phone number to see, uh, to accept it. Oh my gosh. I, I got you guys. I got you guys. My All first, right. my first phone contacts. How do you pull out your phone? Oh, M mobile device. Thank you so much. Yes. One more advice for the road. So you go on your home screen and there will be, uh, numbers. On the top left. This is your identification number. You guys see it? The top left? Yep. Okay. So right now, for some reason, my identification number is 14. Mine is 50. Mine is 11. All right. This is the information we use to give each other money. Wait, B, do you have a phone number? Do you have a phone? All right. So with this information, uh, you go to press the uh, flex the uh, T muscle and it'll give you a box to type in. I, I see, I see. Okay. When you hit the text field, the text box field, you press it and type forward slash uh cash give usually commands are give blank but this one is cash give hold on let me see why is it not typing in mind hold on hold on, hold on. should i put in your name no you will use the identification number you gave each other so it's forward slash cash give and then identification number the two digits I have a question. How do I close the T muscle? Uh, you flex the X. Escape. You escape. You escape. Me thanks. Uh, I see. Thank you. And when I cash give, do I need to put a name and an amount in a certain order? Um, actually, you could just press enter cash give and it gives you a box afterwards. That's interesting. I never knew that. It gives you it so you can wire transfer. Oh, I see. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Forward slash wow. cash give. No space. No space in between cash and gift. Okay, okay, I understand. <laughs> that was funny, you I'm sorry. You received a hundred money from me. I did. Please keep it as a, as a token of my my gratitude. No, we're supposed to give kindness. you money. I look up to you as a mentor. No, the coffee was on me. Oh, thank you. Truly. Well, well uh, I hope we can meet again someday. Of course, it was nice adventuring with you. And you know what? If you stay at the cafe, I don't know how long uh, your work hours will be, but I actually do want to give out interviews with you and hand out coffee to my other career day uh, people. I'll help you in a oh, bit, that would be lovely. Yeah, so if you want to head out and sign off, you are free to do that. Wait, man, what, num what number was it? Uh, just enter cast, uh, just press enter on cash give command and it'll give you a prompt. There is someone in that vehicle, I think. Oh, well. Thank you so much for the coffee. These children are so sweet. For oh, once, oh, so obviously, I know what she's doing well enough to teach others. I think this might be a first. I know. I love helping out people. It's so and fun. Thank you so much for the guidance of Avisha. Of of <laughs> yes, 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 of course. And I'll see you again soon, uh, Mr. Man. Oh yeah, I, I might be working at the the coffee shop for or or walking around for maybe the next hour or so. I'll I'll do my best. No I'll worries. Feel free to call up any services if you get lonely, Mr. Man. Oh, let's exchange contact details. 
Oh, sure thing. I think I think I might have you as a contact. Okay. Do you have Lena and B? B, do you have me? I don't think I've got B yet, though. Let me see. I, I don't think I have you yet, but I have man. Okay, we'll exchange contact info in a bit. Alright, if you need to head off now, you shall, Mr. Man, have your little fun adventure in this town. Thank you guys so much. Uh, I'll, I'll, I should probably get to work. Uh, the sun's setting real nice, so maybe everyone that wants their evening coffee can stop by. Of course! The police, EMT, give those guys a call and ask if they would like some coffee. Oh, yeah. Hey, thank, you, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Time. See Have you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right. This was really great. This was really great, Lena. How are you liking the city so far? This place is awesome. I know. Uh, I'm so glad I was able to help you get these controls. I will actually show you where to get your own vehicle. No way. Really? Yeah, however, um, how much money do you have on you right now? It's okay, you can say any amount, I won't judge. Um, I'll be real, I think like... 150? <laughs> Perfect, no worries, no worries. You know, I learned something on the job uh, from another reporter. I haven't seen her hop on since the first time I saw her, unfortunately. I don't know if we'll ever cross paths again, but she told me something really important. Okay. We're gonna get a free vehicle with the word reporter news on it. Come on. Oh, no way! Yeah, we can get issued a car completely free of charge. That's awesome. You kind of showed up at around a time where it's pe more peaceful around here. Hello, B again. Hello. Oh! Oh, oh B, oh. do you need assistance with Are the hospital? I can actually carry you around. Would you like me to carry you around as well? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, do you want me to carry you around? Say yes or no, please. I need consent. <laughs> um... Um, okay, we'll wait for you. I can carry you. Um, I think I... SOS. All right, I'm going to get the EMT on you. Just stay still. Whoa, 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 whoa. If I, oh, shit, I'm so sorry. If I hurt you enough, if I, if I hurt you enough, she wants to hurt herself more, so the EMT will come. She, she wants to hurt. She's trying to hurt herself so the EMT will come faster. I'm so sorry. Did you see how oh, she tried okay. to go herself to in front of a car? I got her signal. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, All we'll right, stand I'm around. Here. We'll stand around for you. After this, I'll show you the reporter car that they issue us. Okay. Let's go. All right. Forgiveness.exe ex executed. Yes, actually, I do need some bandages <laughs> myself. I got it right over as well. Didn't you say it was uh, kind of peaceful around here? Yeah, so as I was saying, you oh, I need to stop shouting. <laughs> you guys actually showed up around a good time. Um, before, in the first couple of days, every uh, local in here, you can kind of just hop onto their car and rob them of their vehicle. Uh, for the cars that are parked, you need a key and you need to search through the keys there, but sometimes you can't find anything. Yep, you need to stay off the road. Like I said, the locals here are kind of okay. insane. In pain and missing Mr. Johnny. I'm sorry, we'll see someone soon. Did you, did you call for help, right? I'm assuming you did. Like I was saying, um, who's Johnny? What is happening, what is happening here? here? Hello, are you uh, EMT? Are you EMT? Uh, no. No, no EMT here. All right, we'll, we'll be waiting for EMT right now. Our friend got a, a okay. gunshot wound. Oh, how did that what? happen? Did one of you from shoot? a gun, I think. I have a gun. No, I don't we have a gun. Hold on, we did stay away from the uh, locals over here. Yeah, um. Oh? They're, they're running away from us. Oh my god, they <laughs> Yeah, the, the locals are insane. I am the conductor of the poop train. I guess that's Johnny. Uh, villain full. 
Boulder and she won. Rita. Okay, so I kind of had a bit of a conundrum during the field. I'll let you in on it way later. It's a long story. And what ended up happening is uh, Rena shot our uh, B friend right here. B uh, but she was suffering from amnesia, so you're going to have to forgive her. Rena? Yeah, Rena. She uh, was one of the EMTs. I'm not too sure if she is. Let me check my phone. We can just quicken their death to avoid suffering. B, would you like me to send you- Actually, no, it'll take some time for you to be uh, in the hospital for $200. Oh, it's $200 to go to the hospital? Yeah, do you have $200 on you? Hello, are you I EMT? Yes, hello. Do Please help our friend. Oh I God, will pay I the tab. Um, it's that famous EMT, no, uh... Fishy! Fishy! Oh, oh my yeah, goodness! Hi, Rita, you new in town? Welcome! Yeah, I just got here today. <laughs> 45! Um, I'll cover you, it in my you, tub! You're kinda cute. Stay I'm away from the road, lie. though. Hold on, let me, um... Let me... Here, I'm gonna... Be, get off the middle of the road, please. And then... <laughs> um, Mrs. Miss... Are you a miss or a missus? Sorry if this isn't cheating on you. Rora, thank you so much for I the raid! what the difference is. <laughs> this is when yeah, you married. I'll miss. pay for the tap for I'm beer. not currently married. It's it's all right. Oh my god, they're flirting. Hello, Hello Rory. We're just playing as a reporter doing uh, anyways, uh, what, what, what's your name? Career how, day. How would I uh, just... So I have a new oh, uh, friend right here, I Lena. Mean, they are currently uh, <laughs> being okay. my intern. I, I have those um, impulses too. Well, hi, Lena. Um, here, I have I have this little thingy for you. Um, you might want to pick that up and then just you know uh, keep that in your pockets, I guess. Ooh, what is this? Miss Miss oh, Fish. Thank you. Thank Miss you. Fish, I have given you money. Uh do I have to give yes, slip a little something in your pocket to take the edge off on the pain? <laughs> Hold on. I don't know. I tried to check hold and see on. if the lady directed it with come the Spanish on, lady from Instagram. On. But hello, how are you doing today? Are you welcome, I'm doing so good. Are you willing to You're become... with Becku? Uh are is that actually Becco my... or someone else entirely Mrs? with a similar name? Because I know Becco actually know. fell off, but Becco sounds very cool. What is their employment? All right, Bethany. I don't know why I tried to check and see if they uh, hop. But ne welcome to the news crew, Rora. If you need to hop off and do anything, uh, sorry, I got people from the uh, studio back uh, raiding into it. Uh, I have to say thank you. Uh, 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 you guys, is it? Is that only a two-wheel vehicle? Sorry, two-passenger uh, vehicle. It is. You need us to get a. We could, we could we could borrow a car from a, a upstanding like citizen this. that would like to donate it to us for a little bit. No, that's okay. We actually have our own vehicle we need to get to. You guys can hop onto the where did where did Fishy go? I think she went to go borrow. Oh no, that's okay. You don't have to borrow. We're gonna head out to our own car. No, we get a free car from our job. No. No, no. Well well, we will be signing off now. I'm sorry for the rude leave. But we'll see you around. Alright, All right, thank you. Are you officially licensed as an EMT? Yeah, yeah, I yeah. am. Would you? Okay, so I'll be able to call you for a career day yeah, interview just yeah. later on. Oh, it's okay, fish. We have our own vehicle. But thank you for doing a borrow. Well, we, we okay, could okay. Use the ourselves, so. They pulled up. Yeah. They pulled up. All right, see you guys. Because like we can fit five people in one. You know that, right? We have our own vehicle that I'll need to show Lena right, so they can right. get any time they want. Uh, do you guys need to dro be dropped somewhere? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, oh my god! Oh my god! Are you okay? Are you guys okay? <laughs> yeah, the locals! <laughs> the locals don't like it when he calls traffic! But bye, bye, bro, bro. Have a good day. I'm gonna go eat some stuff, but I hope everyone can watch. Yeah, thank you. Are we gonna have to report on this later? Oh, definitely. Um. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Let's get on the car, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and everyone else. Sorry. Sorry. I got a little. Yeah. I know. I know. I know. We're locks. Locks. Can we still get in? <laughs> <laughs> Lead up behind you! Hello! Hello? Is, is Fish still able to... I think they left. We'll be hopping off, uh, getting our own vehicle soon, but hello. See you later. Alright, let's go walk, ladies. Let me... Hold on.
All right, after this turn, we'll need to take a left. See, we're actually near Weasel's uh, news uh, headquarters. Grubbing my hot dog till the food comes in. Oh, I totally get it. I'll probably need to hop off to eat soon and then come back here. But it was really nice meeting everyone. Lena, are you reporting in? Yes, I'm reporting in. All right, all right. So here is what the building you'll need to go to. And if you look on the map, it is not marked at all. Okay, okay. Yeah, but it is, uh, the, the vehicle we will be getting on is marked with a red, all right? A red car icon. Yeah, I saw it on the, on the map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is how we are going to get our vehicle. You can access this at any time up until you can get your own car if you would like. Uh, it is a bit of a walk, so I would recommend getting a car and then going into a parking lot to save the car. Uh, register it officially as yours. Okay. It's all so complicated, I know, I know. It's a lot of stuff, but I'm glad I ran into you. Well, thank you for showing me around. I really appreciate it. Of course, of course. It's all a learning process, a learning curve. But maybe in the in the fall, winter, summer season, a sequel, perhaps you may call it season two, uh, we can even get better acquainted with everyone and new people and all, old people alike. Oh, for sure, for sure. All right. Now, follow the instructions that going onto this arrow will so lead you. So are any of these cars available or no? So you press the E muscle in here in this arrow. You press the E muscle, sorry, you press the E muscle. Yep, and you're learning just so fast. I am so proud of you. Let me just find out Whoa. where I am. Oh. Yep. And that's your car. You can wow. hop on too. You can actually hop on. Miss Garcia, I think I'm gonna get some piper work done. Well, we're pretty packed up at the moment. All I right, totally get you. I know it was pretty active. Yep, you're right. And We'll just see how your uh, driving skills go. I'm so glad uh, you're um, my uh, intern that came along. Recording driving data, of course. You can use this advice too. I don't know if it prompts up for you Sorry, as well. Sorry, uh, what, what, what? I don't know. I can't reach the brakes. My legs are a little short. You just let go of your muscles. Got it, got it. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah. Um. Has she forgotten her new search or has she become the news? Um, I, I wanted to teach these, uh, interns before I leave. Um, I think in about... I think in about 30 minutes I will be, uh, signing off myself and sleeping in. Uh, so I, uh, you know, you can help us around. We actually got a crew in our network. We have, um, Kat, unfortunately. She flew by to another state, so she's not going to be hopping off. Uh, and maybe you'll see her again season two. But, uh, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. Yeah, so it's just me on the field right now. That's understandable. We'll go, I, I hope you have a good rest of the night after the 30 minutes. Uh, and thank you so much for showing me around. Of course. I can still stop right now and, like, see where you want to take us. Just... Familiarize okay. yourself with the area, look at different symbols, and you can actually, uh, if you look at the map and you double tap on any icons, it'll send you a GPS location of how to get there. Has oh, it been a busy day? It has oh, been. Okay, understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're picking up things so fast. I am so proud of you. Hooray! Well, you're just a very good teacher. Thank you. I know I speak in very hard jargon. So I will try to slow down for sure, for sure. No uh, need, no need. Yeah, oh, 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 we're getting a little... My bad. That's okay, that's okay. You're learning, you're learning, you're new. My, my depth perception is not so great. <laughs> oh no, oh no, no, B, you, you should delete that file so you don't want to pick up on bad influences. Driving data recorded. All right, that is a little bit terrifying. Um. Oh, oh, oh! I've never gone this route before. This is a nice view. Wow. Taking us to new roads. So you uh come here often? <laughs> oh, ow. Um. Yeah. Sorry. It's okay. 
Well, like I was saying in my story, uh, I did get kicked out of my own town. Nothing official, but just like, like, okay, officially blacklisted. I'm making my own weasel news network, but unofficially, you know, like your neighbors start wanting to not talk to you as much. Uh, the, the, the children around are being scuttled by their parents away from me. Just, I had bad reputation for myself since reporting on the, uh, serious news that I thought would give me like front cover of the newspaper organization, but, uh, they told me to hush up and to never speak of this tragic event again. Oh, I see. They were paying you off. Yeah, they paid off for my silence. They gave me a big benefit to uh, quit the job. And so I left that town, and now I'm in Los Santos, where, uh... Oh, you know what? I forgot to put on my seatbelt. I don't think my seatbelt was on either. Yeah, you get more stressed if you don't have your seatbelt. What did you do to get blacklisted? That I think I'm actually bleeding private. a little bit. Um, take yourself to the hospital. Just chill around the area if you are uh, very critically injured. I think I'll be all right. If you start blocking out and your pie chart of the heart gets lower, you should get near the area. Yeah. But as I was saying, um, if you ever want a quick buck, oh, sorry, a quick buck, sorry. If you ever, uh, want to go out to, uh, sleep soon, you can just dial any number from the services, uh, and call the police, any of the new polices we've seen that, that have been showing up. I feel like, uh, this world is going to get more active as you're, uh, exploring, you know. Actually, uh, I see that you have your news crew as well. How long have you been uh, broadcasting your view for? Wink, wink, with a purple icon. Just, just, uh, just, uh, an hour and 30 so far. Ah, uh, for me, it's been, uh, oh, four hours. It's actually three hour and 59 seconds. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's, it's, it's about time you gotta get off of work. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, what else can I say? But... I, I I don't know why I assumed you were uh, broadcasting for longer. Uh, tell your news crew I said hi. Okay, I think I think they would they uh, they really loved your presence on air for sure. Oh, that is so sweet of them. You know, my news crew has been saying the same thing. Uh, they saw that I they they were very surprised at me being a, a guiding figure. Driving theater recording. <laughs> they were very surprised on what? Oh, the the uh, leading figure I was for you guys. You know, guiding you around, giving you instructions. <laughs> Do they not see you as a guiding figure? Oh no, definitely not. My news crew is uh, you know, they they lightly nudge me here and there. A couple insults. I I am a bit clumsy myself, but you know, I had to learn everything here myself. Ah, uh, I see, I see. Well, hopefully, uh, your reputation has increased in, uh, a positive way. Of course! <laughs> I will say, though, when you were interviewing Mr. Man back there, I love that you kept giving him compliments. Telling him he's a <laughs> ladies' man. That was very, very charismatic of you. I have a feeling you're well, gonna get I, a I lot would of- I say, yeah? you know, Mr. Man is, you know, very handsome. He definitely knows how to get the attention of ladies. Let's just say, uh, 2D ladies, though. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess so. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, Mr. Man was quite the interesting type, but you know, we don't judge here. We stay at neutral ground. Yeah, I mean, I think uh, he has a lot of talent as as a barista, for sure. Yeah. By the way, have you been getting unemployment checks or actual reporter of $150 uh, per paycheck salaries? Oh, I've been getting 150s. Okay, good, good. So you are legally uh, registered. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, the more you yeah. stay online, the more you get it. We, we don't got any prompts like the police or the EMT has saying a radar for reporting news. Which is unfortunate. Just means we, uh, just means we gotta work harder. Yeah, exactly. Driving data recording. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, I will let you actually uh, make a phone call to a fellow employee. Let me recommend to you. Um. Wait, I said employee like they work with us. Oh. Actually. 
Hold on, I get to show you my Bessie. Let's see if I get scared at the word Bessie. I want to show you my Bessie. Okay, I see we're going to the mountains. Oh, oh are you going to go get some more gas? I wonder if they're scared at the word Bessie. Lena? Like a bee. I mean bee. I mean... Yeah, let's just uh, get off here, get a drink, and then uh, exchange uh, info here. Absolutely. Take your time. Oh, it seems we're having uh, a little bit of an ad break in four minutes. We are on the lower class. <laughs> uh, been a long day How recording. Do I you again? <laughs> Say it again? How do I add you again? Oh, you, oh yeah, huh? Um, you think about the pie in the sky with F1 muscle. Okay, okay. Pie in the sky. The uh, pie slice citizens and then give contact details, but you have to be close to them. I think I've thought of the pie in the sky. All right, it prompted in my phone. Let me do it for you so you know how to do it yourself. So I'm going to give you my contact detail right now. Oh, I see. I see. All right, try to accept their request. We are on the lower class. We're not on the lower class, everyone. We're I'm in not my sure why, but it's not showing up in the suggested contacts. Don't worry, that's just one of the many bugs I have found on the phone. Uh, there's gonna be a couple of bugs like that. Uh, so what you want to do is go back to the homepage. No offense, B. Uh, back to the homepage. <laughs> oh, she took offense to that. And um, then click the phone again, and it'll be suggested. It's not okay. Suggested. I totally get it. No worries. Did you see me again? Yes, there you are! Yeah, yeah. One of the many uh, lovely bugs that are featured on our phones. You know, I love bugs. Yeah, yeah, I do. The mobile device ones are a little bit interesting. You'll find plenty. Alright, so... Tell me when you're ready. Go get your food. Go get your drinks in the gas station. Do whatever you need to do. All right. Thank you. Of course. This has been so fun. I'm sorry I'm not as chatty in the chat here today. Um, you guys are going to be basically my commentators. I'm sorry. It's really hard to duel to uh, juggle balls between you guys and them. Uh, I hope you admire this. This is kind of like a TV show. Hello, Miss B. How... How could you? <laughs> Every time I juggle your balls, you go, OW! It's so nice to see you, by the way, B. I did not think, uh, not, not that I didn't think. I, I didn't expect you to be such a lovely guest, or to be one of the guests, or fuck. I am not really good at eloquently wording my words. I am so excited to see you, B, and it's really nice to have you tag along with us. You know, I know what you did, uh, your services of having the status report updates for every live streamer on GTA. So, I, I'm really happy to see you, uh, being here with us. I hope you enjoy, uh, the little, uh, show that's been going on. Hello, Lita! Again. Um, I think this gas station's closed. I couldn't, uh, go in to get any food and that guy didn't seem to be of any help. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I'll hop in the vehicle. I'll point to a location of the GPS. Yeah, you can enter the back of the vehicle, by the way, Lena. It's pretty funny. By the way, uh... How do I turn off the radio? <laughs> oh, you're gonna have to look in the Discordium bulletin board forums for that. Or just type in the search radio off. Have you been hearing police reportings? No, it was just some random radio. Oh, radio! No, go go to escape settings and then uh, audio and then turn the music all the way down. Get out of the vehicle. I don't want you to be struck by uh, lawyers. Get out of this vehicle right good. now. Yeah, I'm okay, safe. okay, okay. I'm, I'm safe now. I'm safe now. It's all good. 
It was okay. just it was just some guy talking. Is oh, all it oh, thank goodness. Initiating anti DMCA protocol. I couldn't have worded it any better myself. Thank you. Also, it seems there's going to be a, a three minute sponsor segment for my uh, news broadcast. So, um, I will tell you what I do at this time when I have my uh, sponsor segment for three minutes. Um, I will remind you guys to drink your water, stand up from your chair, or I wouldn't ask you to stand up in your vehicle, but you know, do a little stretch in your vehicle. Hey, sounds good. Hmm. What is this place? I don't know where you drove us, but I will pinpoint a location on the map. Okay. Uh, am I able to see what you pinpointed? Oh, I can see it! Yes. Yes, yes, you can. It's really cool features. Uh, you can do it too for your map. I can do it for you. I don't know if the people in the back seat can. What the fuck are you doing? Uh, driving data recorded. <laughs> oh, I will be quiet you know, for the uh, three minutes to uh, stretch my bones uh, during the ad break. Of course, of course. I'll just be driving. Yeah, driving. I feel like I yapped so much. Oh, dear lord. I want to make a, a segment to make a YouTube... I want to make, like, a YouTube video for this season of GTA Tutorials. It, but that sounds very, like, hard commitment for something that's going to end in about, like, two days. If I'm going to be frank. But maybe it could be something for the next season, you know? Maybe I can do it in the off hours, ask someone... I... Okay, so for video editing, I actually really do... I think it's funny that, you know, we're in a global market. I can ask someone from the UK to edit a video, and then they send it to me when I'm sleeping. I wake up. Oh my god, thank you for the video. Uh, do you know what I mean? It's kind of like the um, Baldur's Gate thing, where um, they have employees 24-7 because they hire everyone from, like, every time zone. I think it'd be really funny if I could do something like that for myself. Um, oh god, I got a drink. Okay, I'll show her how to de-stress later. Actually, maybe someone else could teach her. How have you guys been doing? My special stud. Okay. Maybe for the reporter thing, subscribers can have benefits to uh, have attended for themselves. Because I know like when the ad breaks are off, I can't talk to people much. Uh... <laughs> so sponsored segments will be like dedicated to the uh, to you guys, the viewers. Thank you everyone, by the way. I know a uh, collab- this is basically like a huge collaboration. And collaborations like these, you know, uh... It's a little bit harder to talk to. I try my best. I try my best for sure, for sure. I think it'd be really funny if like, uh... Oh, I'd have to ask permission. Personally, I love having collaborations and like the other person having uh, the collab partners chat up. I think it'd be really funny to, uh ask if it's okay to have their news broadcast up. Actually, no, 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 that's immersion breaking. Oh, you know what? I accidentally sent us to a parking lot. I meant to send us to the grocery. That is my bad. No, it's okay. I thought we were supposed to park here. <laughs> what the? I could have sworn I saw a grocery. Hold on, give me one moment. Uh, you'll need to look for a 24-7 grocery uh, in the future. Oh, it was all the way over there. Uh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. There's one right over there, I want to say. Actually, I think there's closer. I can't tell. I'm sorry. It's okay. Thank you for the directions. <laughs> oh, so funny. Oh. <sighs> Actually, I'm experiencing a bit of a... Actually, no, I shouldn't say. I shouldn't say. Oh? Hmm. I'm interested. Let me see who's, uh... Let me see the population of this area. Oh, plenty of people. There's actually 21 people online. 
Lena. <laughs> yes. Sorry. <laughs> yes. No, no. Oh, oh, our car looks a little busted. All right, go get some groceries okay, for bit. yourself. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, I'll call a mechanic to see if we can get repairs done on this vehicle for sure. While you're at the groceries, don't worry. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I'll be sure to call them up. Uh, see ya. Thanks for calling the mechanic. <laughs> All right, I'll call them up soon. I love calling people on their phone. It's so fun. You want to learn? Okay, okay, B. You're a mechanic status. <laughs> Wait, hold on. This would be really funny. Actually, no. I'll call a mechanic and maybe you can, they could be, uh, you can take them under their ring. You can't. I don't know. Can you actively fix something right now? <gasps> oh my god, you can. Holy lord. I never knew this. This is amazing, B. I am learning so much every day. So how does this look, doctor? Huh? A bit of a mechanic joke for you and me. Oh, yep. That, that. That is what you need to be required to have to, uh, fix things, huh? Well, it's okay. Uh, I'll call up another mechanic, see how experienced they are. Garage required. Well, we actually just stopped. Hmm. I'm interesting. I'm interested. I'll call up the other mechanic. Don't worry. But we could, uh, see if there's a apprenticeship for you that could be offered. Let me call them up real quick. So funny. Go for Fratelli. Hello, hello, Johnny, Mr. Johnny, is this the mechanic? Is All right. Um, I have a couple questions to ask of you. All right, lay them on me. All right. So I have a bit of a reporter van that is in need of uh, fixing. Are you able to do uh, on the field work, or do I need to go over to your garage? Let's see. So. According to my manuals, I should have been able to do some field work, but you know, I just not lining up the way I'd hoped. So if you can like meet at me at a garage, perhaps, uh, I think we can probably coordinate the location to meet and get some work done. Yeah. Okay. Second question. Um, I actually have someone that's an aspiring mechanic. Would you love to have them as your apprentice? I'm still getting set up myself, but you know, I can definitely show them the ropes if uh, that's what they need. Oh, they, I think are heading towards you by foot. Uh, my third question was actually going to be where you are, but, uh, if you hear a phone, a phone line from them, that's why. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and see my maps here to see what shop we can meet up to get that work done for you. When will it explode? <laughs> I'll ask him that. Um, are I'm you able... you're in the city at the moment? Yes, I am at the city. All right. Let's go ahead and try, uh, 7231. It's, uh... They got a, yeah, the Los Santos Customs. They, they allow me to do some work there. So we'll just meet there at 7231. I'm currently just up north in the scrapyard. 7231. Up north. Oh, hold on, hold on. 7231. One, one. That's eight. 7234. 7232. Two, two. I see 7233. 7232. I don't see a 7231 though. We see a 7204 as well. Um, It's kind of in that general area. Let's <laughs> see. Uh, How's the it's just south going? of a bank, if that helps you oh, at all. Oh, there it is. I see it. I see it. I don't know. These icons are really small on the GPS. Yeah, ever since the update, it's been, uh, it's been real shite. Yeah, yeah, but that's why I appreciate the service phone calls we can make. All right. Uh, should I wait for your friend or should I just start heading over now? I will head over to you. I think you'll be able to converse and all that stuff. But yeah, I'll see you soon. All right. Uh, yeah. See you at the location, the seven to whatever, right? Yes. Yes. I got it. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I'm going to see if they know how to hang up. Yeah, damn it. Did you uh, just call the mechanic? 
I just did. And you know what? Since B was a mechanic as well, aspiring to be, they just ran there by foot. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I think they want to just extend their lungs some more. So hop in. I pinged it on the map. All right. All right, hopefully they will learn. Or hopefully they know how to do it. Mechanic is a pretty hard uh, job to do. It's a little bit unstable as a job feature. And um, unfortunately, there's only like four that can do it and figured it out how the patients do it. Bless their hearts, of course. Bless their hearts. Um, so, it, and like I was telling you, um, we used to be able to just nab a car from any civilians, uh, locals in here. Oh, that's okay. Um, <laughs> that's what the mechanic is for. Um yeah, it's okay. We're on our way. Anyways, but now we have to actually own vehicles nowadays. And because of that, I feel like the mechanic job is actually going to be on the rise. We just need more people in training for that. I believe in B. B seems very smart. Oh, yeah, for sure. They're very intelligent. And also, um, before that uh, new law was breaking into place where every car is locked by default, um, what was I going to say? The taxi driver role hasn't been paying at all because, you know, everyone can just nab a car on the street and just dip. But since now all vehicles are required to be locked by default, the taxi job has been very called upon. That's honestly awesome. More yeah. jobs for the economy. Yeah. I'm very happy for our workers in this uh, city. Yeah. Oh, and uh, I'll put in the form to ask people to uh, how long they've been at this town. Maybe you can ask them about the experiences before your visa got accepted and you flew in. Oh, that would be that would be awesome. That would yeah. be uh, lots of fun reporting on. Yeah, and you get to learn a lot of things too. Yeah, hopefully it didn't feel too much FOMO. I know that even though I was accepted first day, I only was able to uh, fly in and wake up at night. And by that time, everyone had their own storyline, and it was insane. Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely feel okay, because everybody's been nice. Yeah! You've been really nice to show me around, so I don't feel too much FOMO. But I, you know, reading everybody's stories on the newspaper, I definitely wanted to be here. Uh, I know, I know, but that's okay. I hope you're able to be... Will you be here for the next couple days? Yes, I'll be here... As much as I can tonight, as well as tomorrow. That is awesome. I won't be able to be here Saturday, unfortunately. So Friday will be my last day. That's understandable. Yeah. Wait, I thought that... Uh... Yes? I thought that everyone was going to not be on on Saturday. Oh, it'll be... Uh... Okay, so the server is going to... Oh, pff, pff. yeah, the server is going to be gone by the middle of the night, like midnight. Okay, So okay. it'll be the countdown of the last 24 hours, basically, before we're all uh, have our visa expired. No, okay, okay. The airport's going to be packed then. Yeah, the airport will be packed in this town. So I hope you enjoy it. Enjoy it for me, all right? Will do. Yeah. And, you know, you don't have to stick by this reporter thing if you find something of interest or if you get a, your own little storyline. You can go as crazy as you want. You're still young. You have so much potential in you, Lena. What thing? Yeah, I am dedicating my life to this job for the uh, next seasons to go. I also want to dedicate my career to this. Oh. I've been training as a journalism oh. professional for quite a while. Hello. Be be careful not to run them over. Are you? Are you the mechanic? That's me, Johnny. Yeah. All right. Just tell my uh, driver here, Lena, uh, what to do, so we will best be helped. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and bring it in. Just follow me. All right. Thank you, love. Be careful. Okay. I'll try not to run this guy over. Yeah. <laughs> you know. That EMT person, Lux, oh sorry, Fish, seemed to really like you. I know. 
uh, you know, just out of nowhere, she gave me a diamond ring, so... Whoa, that's crazy. Well, if you ever want to uh, keep talking to her at the hospital, it's just right there. Or you can give her a call, you know. Everyone has contact services to that information. Sorry, Johnny, sorry. Um, anything else for Lita you need? Uh, let's see. So I think I need to take the keys for a second just because I do need to be in the car when I am trying to do the repairs on my bench. The, uh, the manual is very strict in this. Oh, how do I, uh, hand you, hand over the keys? That is a wonderful question. I would assume it would just be a simple matter of just, you know, handing them over, but... You do, uh, you think about the text field again, uh, and type in, a. oh shoot, hold on, hold on. Give keys, I believe it is simply give keys. You think about give keys. It'll prompt you. It's a lot to think about. Yeah, it is a lot to think about. I've been actually leading I, on. Oh, I think I handed over the keys, yep. but I'm not sure. I got it. Um, I got it right here in my hands. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Go ahead and perfect. See what kind of damage we're dealing with. So I'm gonna take control here and see what damage we. All Thank right. You let me know. So let me know what you see. Yeah. <laughs> It has been really nice uh, just talking to everyone around here. By the way, Johnny, I just right. want to say thank yeah, you so it's not much. Looking for... Too bad. Oh, I mean, you just go ahead and start the work now. It'll take a take a, just a few minutes. Yeah, no worries. All right, all right. How Would long you like have been a uh, reporter, Johnny? Not reporter, a uh, mechanic. <laughs> <laughs> I would have loved to be a reporter as a kid, but nah, sadly, you know, mechanics life for me. Oh. I'm just flew in uh, yesterday, actually. We just moved in from uh, New York. Oh, New York! That's where the accent is from. I'll be sure to write oh, this all oh, down, Lena. You take the lead. All right. So thankfully, most of the damage was actually just cosmetic. So uh, I would only have to charge you like 75 bucks for the repairs today. Oh, that's totally fine. That's okay. I'll cover I'll it for today. I'll give you back the keys as well. Uh, give me a second. Flash. I hope I give you the keys to your actual car, not my own. Johnny. What was that again? What was the uh, bill? I think uh, Johnny said 75. Got you. That's correct. 85 tip. We are, we are in Los Santos, so I do love giving tips to my workers. Oh, much appreciated. Okay, let's make sure we got your keys at least back in your pockets before you send you send you on off. <laughs> All right. Actually, how, how may I uh, check for that? Uh, just enter the vehicle and see if the, you can drive it. All right. Looks like we're good. Yeah. yeah All right. Thank you so much. You did a spectacular job. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And let me know if you happen to, well, this is kind of an odd question, but uh, if you happen to see a robot running around, just let me know. She was supposed to be helping me out with the, the big oh, moves. Oh, yeah. Let me give oh, me a oh. call. Yeah. <laughs> uh, actually, Lena, maybe you should call and test out your phone. So uh, B okay, is okay. under uh, mechanic. So you can go to services and the suitcase icon. I'll let them take right. the call. I'll go ahead and give that a quick peek. Yeah, uh, Johnny, uh, after she's done, would you like to conduct an interview? Today is career day for our news reporting uh, station. Oh, I'd love to. Anything to get the word out about new business here in Los Gatos. <laughs> Los Gatos? Uh, what, uh, the, 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 yeah, the, whatever the city is called. Oh, uh, Los Santos. I know. It takes a while. Like Santa, like Sa Santos, but Santos, or Santos, Santos, whatever pronunciation you're, that is Beth with your dialect. Gotcha, gotcha. Los Gatos is pretty cute, though. I love that. I think it's because I heard about a cat cafe on my way in the town. Oh, have you stopped by to visit it yet? Oh, no, there's been barely any time. What was it? I got to get I had to get permits down at City Hall and there was some explosions in the distance. So that was a bit distracting. Oh, trying to secure enough money for a card or just right off the bat. It's really hard to walk around here. The infrastructure is god awful. Um. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was looking at the uh, different window and I wanted to come back to this window to view you. And uh, that seems my muscle had a spasm there. It's completely understandable. I will try to flex all tab next time. Oh, it's no worries. No worries at all. I've been through so much worse up in New York. Oh, I'm just so glad you're not fragile. 
Oh, take a lot more to take me down. What was it? When I was just getting in at the uh, scrapyard, actually, there was this guy that ran me off the road and broke my ankle. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Was he uh, a citizen, a local? Yeah, let me go make sure I got my car's keys for myself, at least. It's kind of sad if I hand yeah. all my keys over. It Lena? looks like B's not picking up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She had a phone? Yes, she has a phone. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't think she's picking up. Why would you assume I mean, B doesn't have a phone? <laughs> Not to say that she was practically born yesterday, but there's a lot she's got to learn about the world. I don't think uh, answering phones is one of her specialties. Oh That's my okay. god. Maybe she can give me a call back another time. Yeah. Yeah, there's no worries. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get pondering on this interview then, if that's what we want to do now. Yes, Lena, you will have to be the one asking questions. Asking questions. I'll be typing. All right, just tell me where we got to go or if we're doing it right here. I think we can do it right here. All right, perfect. So funny well, seeing how everyone talks uh, when they I'm just think of like a backdrop or anything like that. I don't know if there's any audio visual aspect of this or if it's just pure written word. Anything you want, Lena. You'll be taking station once I have to go off to uh, sleep. Oh, are you getting off of work soon? Oh, uh, probably soon. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Just yeah. tell me when you need to clock out. Yeah, yeah. Of course, of course, I will. Okay, okay. I want to see how she does it. Give me just a second to uh, pull out my uh, notes. Yeah, no worries. She's my intern, you see. She also just flew in yesterday. I've been here since day one. So it's been really nice teaching uh, her, uh, teaching Lena here just everything that I know. Oh, I gotta say, taking someone under your wing, it's very rewarding. Yeah. Speaking of wings, taking uh, advice and all that, um, do you have a problem with looking at under other windows, uh, Mr. Johnny, and not hearing any uh, people? I don't, I don't think it's something I've really personally experienced. You know, uh, most of the time I've just been setting up in the background, getting ready to uh, accept, you know, legitimate business. Oh, okay, uh, okay. Good. Okay, 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 okay. I was just wondering, I have a problem when I go back to talk to the new station at home, the mini, mini producer in my team. Uh, I, or I look in my questions, and then I just don't hear any uh, of you lovely folks back in here. Oh, yeah. I get oh, it. It's strange. one of those things. <laughs> it's a real dedication to your work to be able to listen in so intently. Yeah, yeah. Reading things from my uh, news crew, it, it's been really fun. Oh, I'd imagine. oh, for sure, for sure. Well, uh, Mr. Johnny Fret L. How do you pronounce your last name? Ah, yeah, it's a uh, it's Italian, but it's a uh, Fratelli. 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 Well, Mr. Fratelli, uh, are you ready for the interview? Oh yes, whatever you want to ask me, I'm an open door. All right. Well, what would you say your job title is? I would say, uh, you know, head mechanic at Fratelli Motors. We are a new business that just opened up here in town and uh, excited to service the people. Uh, that's uh, opening a new business must sound like uh, it's a lot of work, but it it's definitely rewarding, right? Oh, yeah. I just can't stand Sorry, working Fratelli. for other people at the moment. Uh, my last job, uh, you know, the boss was just overbearing. I couldn't stand the guy. Last job. That's why I had to skip out of town and start my start off on my own. Overbearing. And that's the thing too. Sometimes you get those bosses. Okay, I got all that paperwork furnished and filed away, Miss General you. You Garcia. Can't find work anywhere in the city. Thank you. We were just listening. Well, you in. sound like you make a great boss. Well, how much do you make? Uh, since you work for yourself, you don't have a paycheck, correct? How much do you usually make from your business? You know, it really depends on, you know, the business that I happen to get that day. Um, as you know, the part prices are a little different here in the city that we've just moved to. Uh, and with that in mind, hmm, you know, I do get a flat rate of about $50. I don't know where that comes from. Probably $50? from the government. Probably from the government because, you know, <laughs> they should be paying me, right? But aside $50? From that, it's really oh. dependent on, uh, you know, what the jobs are for that day. That's uh, crazy. Sometimes, you know. <laughs> I know, right? Sometimes, though, I usually try to charge like at least a thirty percent markup on the pots, you, you know, because we're interviewing um, Johnny I heard for that, Career you know, Day. His wage is one of the lowest in the city, so you know, I do have to make sure that I'm taking care of myself and my employees. Yeah, would you like yeah. to pay us for your service, actually? Oh, actually, no, I've, I already did pay you. Sorry, I forgot. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I was well, just so I mean, ever since I heard that people have been uh, locking their cars, uh, it definitely seems like the job for mechanics might go up in demand. 
Oh, totally. I mean, literally while I was still getting my ID, I was getting calls from people wanting to get repairs done. And you know, that just told me that I made the right choice moving out here. You know, in a field of demand, there's nothing but opportunity, baby. I oh, love for that. Sure. Uh, you mentioned that uh, the city is paying you $50. Are you happy with uh, what the city is doing for you? Uh, do you? Is there anything else that you wish the Thank city could gosh. do for you? Left yeah. and right. Bradley. Fuck no. You know... <laughs> Sorry, I need to compose myself there. Sorry, just, you know, <laughs> you know stabbing at the government is one of my, you know, favorite things to do with my friends. And uh, with that in mind, you know, uh, I still need to get familiar with the services that the government provides. You know, I find that the $50 minimum wage is a bit insulting uh, for this kind of work. But, you know, thankfully with, you know, gracious and generous customers like yourself with, you know, generous tips, you know, it allows this business to stay free and moving. Ah, uh, well, sorry to hear that uh, the government has been disappointing, but I hope the, you know, we are able to uh, change the government to favor the people through reporting. Oh, of course, you know, we always appreciate good journalism in this house. Uh, a, a few more questions. Did you ever think that, uh, you would be in this career, and would you ever change your career? You know, I used to think that, you know, mechanics life wasn't gonna be my kind of thing forever, but, you know, the opportunities that it's presented me, the meeting the people that I've met, and the opportunities that's kind of led to, and the adventures we've been on, you know, I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. You meet all kinds of folks in all kinds of walks of life. You get to maybe meet a person that's on the way to deliver a baby. Maybe you get to meet someone that's on their way to a funeral. Mechanics see it all. Oh, for sure. Definitely a people's job. Would you say that you're in it for the money or the love of it? Oh, did I, did oh. I? Oops, sorry about that. No, but it's yeah, okay. I, <laughs> I thought yeah, maybe I, I end... forgot to speak. Oh, no. There's I somebody. think at the end of the day, I think we're all, we all are in it for the money, right? I mean, with the careers that we choose, we're just choosing the ones that we uh, hate the least, right? <laughs> and I suppose this is a, a job that you hate the least? Oh, completely. You know, at the <laughs> end of the day, these machines are just simple machines. The parts are very rudimentary, and it is just a matter of finding what's broken and putting in a new one. Simple as that. I see, I see. Well, how long does it usually take? What are your work hours and uh, what sort of thing do you do for your free time? Well, at the moment, we are trying to still source some pots uh, so that we can start offering on the field. Oh my God, B actually has lore with, with Johnny. Apparently they're part of a mixed storyline. That's so cute. Nowhere. And I just can't help him right now. So in my free time right now, I'm trying to figure out uh, how I can best serve those customers. Ah, uh, very diligent. Well, one last question. Do you see yourself in this career 10 years from now? Well, if I'm not dead by by then, I mean, ideally I'd like to retire onto the, uh, onto the coast side. But, uh... you know, since we are basically starting from, <laughs> basically starting from zero here, I walked in here with like $250 in my pockets and no goals for, <laughs> but I think, you know, I probably will be here for another 10 years at least. Unless, you know, some better opportunities come along. Well, I hope your business booms. Thank you so much for the interview. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Oh, yeah. thank you so much. And if you don't mind me interjecting, though, um, if anyone's happened to see uh, black and yellow uh, cybernetic advanced AI autonomous robot walking around, <laughs> please give me a call. Uh, <laughs> I think I, I'm kind of oh, worried sure. about her. If if we see if we if we see V we will <laughs> we will try to direct her towards yeah. you. Yeah. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Of course, and thank, thank you, you for your time, Johnny. Of course, I'm gonna walk into this white box and <laughs> use some inventory. <laughs> of course, don't we all have a white box to go to and use our inventory one day? Oh, oh, what they actually went to that white box? Holy they, lord! They did. Uh, uh, it's probably something private, actually. I probably shouldn't in impose, but that's so cool! Yeah, very, very, uh, very cool mechanic. Yeah. Alright. Lena, I'll let you... 
Um, I'll probably hop off uh, to go to sleep soon, but I, I hope, you know, if you ever want to add any questions to this career day thing or you want to like, uh, what was I going to say? Add questions or revise some for yourself. That is absolutely sure. None of this is set in stone. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, I just want to. This is just an opportunity to get to know to get to know the folks. You know, uh, the city will be closing down soon, so I think it'd be really, really cool to. Oh, oh, oh! That car just. Did you see oh that? Oh my god, that car just spawned. <laughs> that that. I swear, I didn't see that until just now. I know. Okay, I wasn't just me. All right, all right. <laughs> you know that actually brings me to my next thing. I have a call, uh, a tip line that someone is interested in a paranormal. So if, I don't know who it is, but feel free to ask around town if anyone knows a paranormal investigator. Oh, there's a paranormal investigator, but you don't know who it is. Nope, I don't know who it is. I was just told by the wind. Hello, disabled gamer. Okay, Hi, okay. Well. well, would you like me to give you the information when I do get some? Yeah, and also give me the scoop on them. I'd love to have their information in my database for... Sure, sure. Yeah. Is, is it okay if I contact yep. uh, your assistant, D? Yeah, yeah, of course. Anytime, anytime. You're always allowed <laughs> to slide into... Oh, that sounds weird. Um, don't stop. Oh. You're always allowed to uh, contact D anytime. Of course, of course. DM is a lovely assistant of mine. Yes, yes. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Is there anywhere I need to drop you off, or is this uh, where you need to get off? Uh, let me go look at my contacts. Uh, okay. Oh, I did a save. Okay, contact history. Let's see if I know anyone I want to talk to. Uh, I don't know. How do I want to end this story? I gotta go eat soon. Fuck the street. I didn't mean to! Inferno, thank you so much for subscribing. Unfortunately, I will be ending soon. Uh, but thank you so much for hopping in. We were just about exploring uh, GTA. Actually, I kind of want... Okay, okay, yeah. I do want to hop onto my own adventure before I leave. Uh, Where is the hospital? Hop into... I think my baby is in the hospital. Wait, no, she isn't. Hold on. Um, I'm going to show you Bessie before I leave, and then I'll venture off with Bessie for sure, for sure. Um, okay, okay. Let me just go find her. You can actually track your vehicle and your device and your phone. Uh... All right. Okay, vehicles. Uh, do I pull up my phone Track. now? Uh-oh. Doesn't look like my... Uh, hold on. No, I'm tracking my uh, device. Uh, let me... Caesars right. 24 parking. Let me go look for that parking lot. Where the fuck is it? Where's Caesars? Where the hell is my baby now? Okay, Caesars. It should be with a C. I don't see Caesar's parking lot. God damn. Caesar's 24 parking lot. Sorry, I'm just looking at this here map. I'm a. Uh, I don't know where my vehicle is and I'm a little scared. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry. I'm just uh, talking with the uh, audience back at home. Oh, we love to see audience participation questions. Have, okay, I'll be silent now. All right. Uh, one more note to make, though. Yes. If there's ever any jargon, feel free to ask D to translate it, or just ask um. <laughs> out of character. I don't mind being out of character for you. Aww. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah. Uh, for sure. If it's just one on one, I'm not too sure what anyone else's policy is on out of character stuff, but I'm. I'm I totally get it. I'm very new at this RP thing, so I know how exhausting it can feel sometimes. Yeah, I think you're doing a really good job. Thank I, you. I I don't really ever do anything like via voice, so this is like I don't know. It feels a little strange to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love to get immersed, honestly. So I, I I just nerded out when I was like, oh my god, I get to adapt language and like make up shit to for so people can understand slang and stuff. It's fun. I honestly love your assistant, D. Thank you! I love- I- I played, uh, D&D a lot IRL, so I think it's really funny, like, to explore RP oh. for the first time. Oh! Yeah! Every time I- 
I play D and D, uh, it always ends up being like uh, the 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 ju dungeon master just uh, stops. <laughs> No! Stop, stops uh, asking for sessions and then we just uh, disappear. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that, Rip. Yeah, no, either campaigns to last like years or they just last a couple of times and then you never close it. It's, it's tragic. It is pretty tragic. I know. I can't find my car. Where is the goddamn Caesars 24 parking lot? It's okay, take your time. I'm just chilling. You want me to move around or is it harder for you to find it if I move around? I'm just looking at the map right now so you can move around. Okay, and if, okay. And if you see anyone, like, uh, any citizens you want to interview, let me know. Alright, sounds like, good. Yeah. Tee -hee -tee. yeah, get your place familiar with the area. Young. No car. I know, I want to see my beautiful baby girl. I think I was here. Okay, where did I go? I okay, so let me think. I took taxis. So I was here. Okay, where did I go before but where did I go? Where's Betsy? Where the fuck is Betsy? Garage. Caesar's 24 parking lot. I think I might ask the server where Caesar's 24. Oh okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let me go ask um, in-game events. Okay. Oh no, that's not in-game events. That's uh, I guess ha uh, advertisement. Uh, well, actually no. Let me go look for. Hold on, I'm gonna go ask the more sea fishes because I do want to have my own adventures when I come back. Does anyone know where Caesars? 24 7 parking lot is. No car. Caesar must have sold you some, uh, your car for some pieces. pieces. I know that little shithead. <laughs> How could he do this to me, honestly? I, I'm so, so. So disrespected by Caesar. I thought I could trust him with my car, but it looks like you can't trust no Italian. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. I'm not gonna go with that angle. Don't tell anyone at the town center I said that. Cut that off. Cut that off the station. Does anyone I'm gonna ask uh, the Discord actually. I lost my vehicle and it just teleported away. I actually need to drink water in game. I might die if I don't. So let me go get some water real quick. Or <laughs> Lena. Yes. I think it's really funny that like uh what was going to say <laughs> whenever people talk to chat, they go, "Oh, I'm just talking to the voices in my head." Right? Yeah. But I think it's so funny that everyone has that as like their uh, hints for that, that it seems like everyone just has voices in their head as soon as they come into town. That's crazy. That's so I funny. I think uh, everybody ought to... <laughs> there should be a job for a therapist. <laughs> yeah. It's really so silly. Should I love it. should be a therapist. Yeah. Are you hearing voices in your head? I'll let you know how to get rid of them. <laughs> <laughs> it's so silly. I love it. Um, I was gonna say. Oh, am I not drinking? Okay, I'm gonna go back to looking at the map. Oh, yeah. Okay. The voices in my head are pretty nice. <laughs> That's so sweet. Tell the voices in your head. Um, I said hi. <laughs> hey, voices in my head. They said hi. <laughs> Do you name them? Uh, some of them have names, yes. And some of them, I, I kind of remember my voices by color, not necessarily by names. I feel the same way. That's me with like three like iconic voices. I mean, my news crew. Yes, yes, your news crew. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, this is a PT therapy arc. Uh. Okay, I don't know where my vehicle is, so I think I'm just gonna hop off and then like... <laughs> 
Hopefully I get reached back to in the Discordium about it. Otherwise, my Betsy is gone. Okay, well, I hope you can get your uh, vehicle back. Thank you so much for hanging out. Of course. I'll be in your chat probably saying how you're doing. Bye. Bye. Ugh. Finally. <laughs> this feels like a goddamn job, chat. And not in a bad way. I want this to be my job, but I feel it's really funny when there's like full-time streamers and part-time streamers. Where full time, she's like, Yeah, I stayed up at 6 a.m. for this plot line. And then, as part time viewers are like, Oh, I gotta get back to work. I gotta go study something real quick. Ooh, I'm so jealous. But you know, we all got some good uh, pros and cons to each uh, situation of our lives. Fantastic, award winning reporting today. Thank you. I need to get some clips from those moments because it was super funny the dialogue that I eventually got in the end. It was so silly. I hope that you all enjoy this. We will raid. Um, It'd be, it is a good job, Avi. It was really fun. I had so. Oh, oh, that's home. Well, like I was saying, uh, I will be heading off. Ooh, I don't think someone in my household likes my uh, midnight calls. Anyways, uh, I will be heading off. Uh, we will. I think we will raid into Lena, just for today. That's really fun. Have a good night, everyone. Oh, I'm sorry today was mostly just like tutoring, walking people around. I'm so sorry. But you know, maybe if I find my Betsy and get a response, I'll hop back on, do another gorilla stream. Hopefully a little bit earlier than the middle of the night. And see you guys around. We'll say hello to uh, Lena. Bye, goal. You did good work out there, but today, Miss Garcia, thank you for sharing. See you on the next group. Thank you. I'll see you soon, ladies. I'll see all of you in my news care today. I hope today was fun. Uh, Lena, news. Well, let's, hold on. Thank you. Thank you, B, for being part of the storyline until we got to do the mechanic work. I hope you learned how to get a toolbox in the garage. Uh, have fun learning about that I, I hope it's very exciting here is the raid message you will now be part of the lena lena news cruise now all right angelina kumalo kumalo there you go if you would like to follow any twitter tiktok youtube socials it'll be right there i hope to see you all again soon thank you <gasps> so fun i'm so sad it's gonna end in about two or three days the finale will be on saturday but unfortunately i don't think i'll be live i think i will be up to some no good trouble myself um but of course once the season is over for gta i hope i hope we get a lot of fun i hope we get a lot of fun together when the season two rolls around hopefully i'll be able to uh hopefully it'll be like a good winter break that would be amazing um, see you guys around. This was an interesting stream. Bye, Abby. Bye. See you around.